father walking through the amazing strength. Uh, the level one podcast restream thing. That's it. And I have a portable microphone for authenticity. That's it. Authenticity. Obviously. Um, I never listen to the Bayonetta one soundtrack. Oh, You're a fucking fuck degenerate. Man, I really need to change my play button. One day, I'm gonna write it down and do it in six months. We get out. All right. Welcome to the stream, dude. Hopefully, this microphone, uh, we're good enough. It should exist. It exists as a microphone. We have amazing pieces of clever. Friends are the to help you get started, to give you a push on your way. Friends are the to turn you around, get your feet on the ground for a brand new day. Oh God, what thing is that? Ladies and gentlemen, sixty-four, no, forty-four shipments coming in today. We talking about drugs and six online returns. I must process. He is. Yes. Clap, clap, clap. Egg, egg, egg. But you guys, I will be playing Mario plus Rabbits early, you guys. Yo, Dingus couldn't wait to advertise myself. Mario plus Rabbits early on Dingus stream. Let's pretend it's the Jazzy version so I don't get bad. I don't you're a fucking you degenerate. I have no idea what you're talking about. Anyway, we got some stuff to watch before we actually watch the real authentic level one podcast we got unrecorded post scorn segment frustrated with chat for not supporting well and then we got the daily rap 12 Hello. minutes long you want to know why it's that long i don't need to explain you can probably make an assumption so we're gonna watch that and then afk and then uh, we'll all be happy. 1730. Oh, yeah. I, Got a prediction. I, I'm like, hey, what's up? Hello. Fedgal just resubbed for 27 Hello. months. Whoa, 27 like months. 27. That's like nine three month anniversaries. Oh, Monster Week. That's a lot of Monster Week. Big ups. Thanks for the tier one of Supreme Positivity. And we got Dead Meows. God damn it. It's like, I don't, I don't even want to talk about the mic. I should just casually use it and just be here with it. And if you say something about it, well, you can't complain. It's the normal, not, it's the normal mic now. Forever. Forever. You're a fucking degenerate. Forever. You have to be kidding me. There's another fight. There's another fucking fight. It's a very casual microphone. Look, They're I'm not used kidding. to leaning. There's another fight. I'm super free now. I feel like Ellen. So, you guys, what do y'all think about the last begging stream? Like the last time, uh, y'all, y'all, y'all saw him when he said he wanted money to put a hat on. It was pretty, pretty weird, right? I can't even do it. I can't even You're do it. You're a fucking it. degenerate. Uh. So from what I'm understanding, if I leave it like that, I mean, tomorrow I'm playing Plague Tale. If I leave it like that, should speed this up. it should stay like that, and then I can still play Plague Tale, and then I can resume it tomorrow night. I guess what we're going to have to do. Oh, yeah, this is um, recorded. I'm not watching them actually play the game. Yeah, it's terrible. Like, that's really, that's atrociously bad. That's huh? I, I'm not even kidding you. Like, every first-person shooter I've played before, in my life has been better than that gameplay experience. That's yeah, the game sucked, ridiculously huh? badly designed. It's insanely boring. It's tedious. <laughs> It's everything you don't want that's not fun. No, nothing is intuitive about it at all. Badly it's complete. Designed. Just fuck around until you figure out what to do. Wow. So, yeah. Um, I will finish it tomorrow. I'm going to play it again to get it done with. You know? I don't want I just want it over with. So, you know. And, wow. That is atrociously bad. Um, again, I like the first stream. The first time I played this on Friday, I played it for about almost three hours. I like the atmosphere. I like the puzzles. Tonight... It was complete frustration. The moment that the game had gunplay, it was a complete misstep, and it completely ruins the game. So, and that.
what it was doing wasn't even considered gameplay. I like the atmosphere, I like the puzzles. Tonight, Yo. it was complete frustration. The moment that the game the had moment gunplay, the game, it was oh, a complete gunplay. misstep. And My apologies. Lose the game. So, and that, I mean, are you kidding me? Are you it's kidding like me? no one who worked on this game knew anything about first-person shooters to know what makes them fun. Why would you make that like that? That's toxic. not fun. I thought he all. used to hate in all game devs like this. <laughs> it's completely, completely bereft of fun. Oh, right. I don't completely, know what he was like. You say. sucked the fun out of any, any. All right, I'm definitely getting this Free done on game uh, pass, tomorrow by the for way. sure. But, Free. Uh, enough, is enough, enough is enough for tonight. I went super late. Um, I bet you if you all right, guys. I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm frustrated for two reasons. Reason number one because yeah, the game does suck. I really did not like tonight's stream. And in addition to that, as you guys can see, I stayed extra late for you guys, and basically it amounted to nothing. Um, no one's really. I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm frustrated for two reasons. Reason number one because yeah, the game does suck. Um, I really did not like tonight's stream. And in addition to that, as you guys can see, I stayed extra late for you guys, and basically it amounted to nothing. Um, no one's really supported. It amounted it's, to nothing. No. It does. Yeah, I'm playing a game. Obviously, it's frustrating. A lot of people showed I up guess to watch it. Mad and saw himself. how frustrating it was. Yeah. To support it. He wouldn't yeah, be mad at everybody else. Okay. Uh, it would have been one thing if I'm staying late and people are laughing, having a good time, and a few people are at least supporting the a stream. A bunch of trolls but no one showed did. up. And that really upsets me. Um, sucks, man. I'm going to hope that tomorrow when I finish Actually, it, sucks. Uh, there will be some support. Because it is pissing me off that I just stayed extra late and I got nothing for it. You know, the game's not even good. You know, if this were me, I'm not even exaggerating. If this were me not streaming, Playing this, I would have just turned the game right off and said, fuck this, I'm not playing this anymore. But the fact that I'm now five hours into it. So he's saying what the old it, Phil you know? would but have turned it off? Degenerate. I toughed it out for you guys tonight, and I got nothing out of it. He got nothing out of it. But it a bag bad. of fucking frustration. And that pisses me off, that they really ruined the game no the way they did. Tipping, I really do man. feel like they ruined it. If they just had different no gunplay or no gunplay, and the game wasn't it would have been a much better game. I don't know what they were thinking. Uh, that's Holy awful. Shit. That's like the big three of disappointment. Really, it's like you're walking around with a room full of guys with chainsaws, and they give you a nerf bat. Wow. Oh, by the way, you also weigh 4,000 pounds. Gravity is 10 times strong, and you're walking in goo. <laughs> oh, that's scorn in a nutshell. Very exciting. We all hate scorn, right. though. Uh, all right, so. I that agree is with tonight. you. I'm out of here. Um, I don't even know if my videos from earlier ever processed. Um, they did. Shit. Hallelujah, they did. Thank God. I don't have to do, fucking worry about that shit. They did show up eventually. Hallelujah. Thank goodness, because I was very upset. Hallelujah. The and the Playtale stuff. We don't have to think about the Plague Tale videos. All right, so. I know everybody been watching I'm going to upload Tale. this gameplay tomorrow. Basically, what we're going to do tomorrow is the same thing we did today. We're going to do more Plague Tale, and we're going to do more um, Scorn to finish it. And if we just finish Scorn early tomorrow night, we'll just chill. We'll have like a Q&A session or whatever. Oil does. The list seems like, yeah, you probably got about 45 minutes to an hour. You like, should hops. complain more. It's very easy. I agree. I'm on my Hoover. I'll be flexing. But yeah, you know, I'm on my Hoover. You guys have to visibly see that I'm really annoyed that the game sucks. And I'm obviously toughing through it because you guys are here to watch and you're enjoying you know, hopefully there will be reciprocation. There was no reciprocation tonight. You think he's I mean, going to give a yeah. shout out to that dude that gave that $2 right there? All the tips they he gave me before even the, the extra time I played. All right? I so, mean, he kind of have tomorrow, to, I guess. We'll finish it, it wasn't and, a know, bad, like again, a bad my last day of the week. I'm trying to raise funds for my day off here. Okay? And uh, by the way, from everything, you know, factoring in everything I made. It pisses you off that we didn't hand degenerate. you money? That's the textbook definition of guilt tripping. Humble yourself. You're not entitled to money. Just because you're playing a game. Check your tone. Today, all right, and everything else, my bill that I have to pay and everything on, to, on, on Thursday, I don't even have enough right now to buy Gotham Knights on Friday. Got banned. Just being honest, I don't. So I'm hoping that tomorrow's going to be a better day. You should have uh, got reformed after that. that. I can actually afford all the stuff this week, all right? <clears throat> all right, guys. Thank Hang you. Tight, Please have everybody. a good evening. I will be just Sorry, obviously, that, you know, uh, I got upset about the game, but talk. I'm going to be honest. When I play games, that game is terrible. That is <laughs> really one of the worst downward spirals I've ever seen. Wow, it's okay. really fun. And anyway, just all of tonight is just like frustration, thing. frustration, frustration. Bad gunplay, terrible game design. You saw as soon as I got to that castle area, I was like, oh, this is nice. What if she did? Giant trash. Y'all ever seen a Volkswagen Beetle with monsters? Wow. They're idiots. Chugging it and loving it. Part 3 with the mobile mic and the drip. Thank you, everyone. I'll see you tomorrow for more Plague Tale Requiem in the morning. Gotta get paid more first. And for the conclusion of scoring on the late stream, likely if we do beat it early, um, you know, we will we will continue on it and just do some Q&A or whatever tomorrow night to end the stream. Okay? Excuse me. Excuse me. Okay. All right, guys. Thank you. Have a good night. See you in the AM. Plague Tale was really good, by the way. If you didn't see my Plague Tale What video, about the dude that gave him the $2? Really good. I'm really loving the game. The he was complaining, saying he didn't get so any money, and some dude gave him $2, and I'm he's never going to get a shout Guys, out. Guys, thank you. Have a good night. What? See you in the AM. Peace out. That's not fair. He's done recording, like, the third time. Okay, now he's going for real. Poor oiled up black man. He got nothing. That's what he deserved. All right, that's exciting. And the daily wrap. 
October 18th, 2022. Plague Tale is awesome. Then Scorn completely fails. Wow. Completely fails. Wow. And welcome to the Daily Wrap for what was alone. Tuesday, the 18th of October, 2020. It's him wrapping up his day. It's 12 minutes long. 22, officially the first really major day of non-stop new releases for the, this uh, fall gaming season. Every single day moving forward, I'm going to be playing new releases. Uh, without exception, every day is new games, okay? So today, on the Level 1 Podcast, we covered a few news stories, a few odds and ends. I talked quite a lot um, about uh, people who get review codes and sadly how basically oh, yeah. they are... Last, last tiny bit. We got a prediction. It might be too late to mention it. Uh, will he complain about chargebacks? Yes or no? 88,000 going for yeah and 15,000 going for no. Last time I did this prediction, the no voters, uh, predictors, were the ones that won because he didn't bring it up. But tomorrow is his off day. And he, uh, I mean, we're going to watch the video he put out at the end of the day last night. So... Yeah, he, he might bring it up. Probably not. I kind think of it's pressured not. into being very positive. Those, about the games those specific from. chargebacks. There's a whole new story about this where the editor of The Escapist basically came out publicly Cannon, talking Cannon about it. He's really upset about it because Sony pressured him in the past and stuff. And it's pretty much stuff, stuff, honestly. Um, but we talked about that at length on the podcast if you're interested in that topic. Okay. Then, um, ah, itchy. Um, hold on. Some fucking idiot here. I'm trying to wait, do it. I'm trying to wait, do it. Wait, 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 wait. He's banning somebody mid daily rap? Now it is. This is next level. <laughs> Forgot to like, shut down the stream. I did now. But we got idiots in the chat fucking talking shit and stuff a lot. Like thinking I'm not here. Just idiots. Anyway, um, first stream today was Play Tale Requiem premiering. It's really good. Um, it starts off slow. Like the first hour is kind of like a, a recap yeah, flash, kind of a nice intro where everything's happy and nice. And then all of a sudden, in the second hour of gameplay, boom. The crap hits the fan, the rats arrive. All how, many, lose, um, how many reviews you think you read degenerate. on Plague Tale? Because he told us, basically, if you listen to him say anything about P Plague Tale, the only thing he ever said was that the graphics looked good and that it was slow and the exciting part was coming up. And then guess what? The exciting part came up, like, right halfway through the game. Boom. Just like he said. Oh, man. And if, you know... Why would you play a game and then excessively tell people that the exciting part's coming up? It's literally a new game, day one. Why would you do that? DSP work uh, in unique ways. He's just we right back into oh, where you were. Play Tale 1. Um, very gruesome, very dark. The gameplay elements already are quite good. The graphics are outstanding on the Xbox Series X. I, I don't have a complaint about the game yet. I love it. I loved every minute I played it today. Um, it's creepy. It's getting creepier. Uh, I cannot wait for more tomorrow. So, Plague Tale Requiem, big thumbs up. Support on the stream was quite good. Fucking we got, we at least hit the Tier 2 Tips goal, which was excellent. It was what I was hoping for. We actually had some gifted members, so we gained some members today. At one point, we were over 500 members, and we lost a few. But it is what it is. It was a good stream. Over, over everything about Plague Tale was great. I really had a great time today. The bummer was the videos took forever to go live. You may have been looking for Plague Tale all day today, wondering where's Phil's videos. They, they're taking forever. YouTube had a processing issue where they were all stuck processing and wouldn't show up. Then one of them had showed up, but wasn't showing as HD, like a big mess. And it sucked because parts big two and mess. three were live way before part one. You guys, so know I get the feeling a lot of people who were waiting to watch basically just kind of gave around. up because they waited several hours and the videos weren't showing up. As I was doing my late stream tonight, the videos the monkeys did show in the up. Office. So what I will they do is make never sure that those are in order in a playlist. I'm actually going to make part one my featured video on DSP Gaming tonight. I hope people check it out because it's really good. And I felt shitty that I couldn't get those videos out for you guys as soon as possible because of YouTube. It's funny because his videos aren't really that long. Process the video. And they're not that high Sadly, quality. Sadly, tonight was the complete polar opposite experience. So, now, I don't I know how we have so much problems. There's got to be some like, about atmosphere really specific. And, and both of them excel. Fucking the metadata issue and different. The this dude told us about metadata. You got to put in metadata of the I really had a good time with it on Friday and I was hoping for more of that tonight. That is an ad. What I got tonight was two and a half hours. Yes, two and a half hours because I actually played late. Of incredible frustration, the game's gunplay, because now I just but got I don't think YouTube The game's gunplay is you know atrociously bad. You move like but a they slug. Don't. You can't really dodge and anything. And DSP is also so really slow. dumb. So if you're in proximity of any enemy, they're going to hit you. Um, You try to outgun them, but the guns are weak as hell. Your first gun is a, is a pistol that does almost no damage. It'll take yeah, sometimes four to five hits to kill speed. the weakest enemy Imagine in the game. Imagine not just noticing joke. that. Now, eventually you get better weapons, like the shotgun that's really powerful and kills things with two shots, but you have incredibly limited ammo. Some of these enemies are tough that you're fighting and will kill you with two hits. So 
it's really frustrating. It's definitely not fun gunplay at all. And I get the feeling just because they wanted to make it feel like survival horror. That's fine. But there's a difference between survival horror and Resident Evil, where, yeah, you can aim and hit things, and you're effective against them. But wait, wait, wait. No, hold on, hold on. That does almost no damage. No, he's complaining about four scoring, isn't he? Kill the okay. weakest enemy That's in the game. Right, it's a joke. I thought now, he was complaining about weapons, like the shotgun fucking evil really within still. Two shots, I was going to lose my shit. Ammo. Like, dude, Some of these enemies are tough that you're fighting, and will kill you with two hits. So, it's really frustrating. It's definitely not fun gunplay at all. And I get the feeling just because they wanted to make it feel like survival horror. That's fine. But there's a difference the between survival time. horror and Resident Evil. Like, yeah, it's yeah, not fucking creative things, enough. And you're effective against them, but it's more about limited Why ammo. Versus a game it? where literally you move like a fucking slug. You can't aim properly. The guns are slow as shit and weak. It's like incredible frustration. Like the best way I can describe the gunplay of Scorn. You're in a room full of killers with chains. This dude straight up. Oh my God, he's going to give us that thing again. He remembered it. This dude straight up lied to us about being what? a uh, classic survival horror fan. Not even really a fan. You say he grew up with survival horror games and you watch him play Resident Evil, the PlayStation ones and not the remakes. And he tell you in those videos, dude, I never played these. This is my first time playing them. Oh man, this is super cool. Well, actually I rented it back in the day, but like I didn't finish the game. And now he grew up with them. What the fuck? He grew up in 2015? You know what, actually, we, you know, we grow up every day. So it makes sense. And you really did grow up in 2015. I understand, though. Saws. But to fight them, they give you a Nerf gun that shoots foam darts. And by the way, you're walking in water up to your waist. Fun, right? No, it's not. And the problem is tonight... They put you into a maze-like area where everything looks the same. Everything's a big maze where you have to open shortcuts and things to figure it out. And the enemies literally come out of nowhere. You'll be fine. And all of a sudden, an enemy comes from here and from here. How do I fight both at once when I'm, I'm a slug? You can't. You're going to take damage. It's incredibly frustrating. There's, there's times you have to die because you don't know what you're doing. There was a time when I walked by apparently a very well-hidden corridor three times until finally people in the stream chat yelled at me. It's right there. The don't walk by it. That is like difficult. Progress. Not necessarily it's difficult. Like I'm not going to sugarcoat it. It's Tonight hard to do basic things. It was a complete things. polar opposite experience from Friday. It was a terrible gameplay head. experience. Okay? No notification. Imagine so two not hours just leaving a fucking stream. By the way, I should, I should be honest It's been a 24-hour stream. All right? We were at the very tail end of the stream. It was $30 in support. That was like it. Okay, and I told everyone I'm going to go just a little extra because I, I want to get to a point where I want to be sure maybe this is no save. point. And the game then decides to put me into a boss fight. The first boss fight of the game. It might be the only boss fight of the game because the game is so short. Everyone says it's about five hours long. Um, the boss fight is incredibly non-intuitive. You have no idea what you're supposed to do. All right? It's a laughing stock because the, you're not actually supposed to fight the, the boss. You're just supposed to walk at rock in a circle to get him to strafe and miss you till he finally has to reload. Then you shoot weak points. So the more you shoot the boss, you're doing it wrong in a game that leads you to believe you're supposed to be shooting enemies. It, it actually punishes you for shooting this boss. Okay? Then once you shoot the boss with the weak points enough, now it completely changes. You're a fucking Now the only way to hit it is to lure it into trying to punch you by going close. You have a 50-50 chance of it doing an animation where its chest is exposed and you can shoot it. The other 50% chance it's completely defended and you have to try to get out of the way, which by the way you can't do because you're slow as shit. So, again, the boss is insanely badly designed. It's, it's literally a laughing stock. So is this I, I told a review of the boss this, this like, video or what? I'm not kidding you. There's much better gameplay. I like him saying, I told my viewers than this. Than in this game. The, every moment We're you're trying to use the guns and fight third, is terrible. Like a third it's like source someone who never played a first-person game. You know what? We all. Play, tried to design We're not his viewers. We don't Or purposely tried to make it frustrating because they thought it was scary. It's not scary. I don't even know how it would make sense. It just pisses you off. It's really literally bad watching design. him make you not so as you, I my guess. opinion of this game has gone from up here to way the fuck down here because well, someone who I don't designed see the right had no idea what the up fuck they were doing. To down who? Okay. Up now where? to make matters worse, in the middle of this happening, of course, stupid. people alert the trolls that feels frustrated at the game. So the viewership doubles, but no one supports the stream. So I went almost frustrated at the game. So the viewership doubles, but no one supports the stream. So I went almost three hours on my late stream tonight and got absolutely nothing for it. I didn't get a, one additional contribution. How many? For what? So the viewership doubles, but no, no one supports the stream. So I went almost three oh, hours on my late stream tonight. I thought he said three hours got absolutely over. nothing for it. I didn't get a, one additional contribution for staying late. So he went well, one hour over time. shitting on me in the stream chat. To try to finish okay? the game. Which like, dude, 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 he literally was doing the overtime to try to finish the game. Because he was at the end of the game. And he knew he was at the end of the game. And he couldn't beat it. You're a fucking degenerate. What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> like... How many times DSP's done this? He streamed like a 20 Jeff. minutes, 30 minutes extra Help. because he know he had the end of the game. That's what that was. But he just didn't get what he wanted out of it. No. But you would have thought, at least with me hanging in there and trying to do more gameplay for uh. everyone, 
they would have at least someone would have done something. You know, I didn't tweet tonight. Every time I, didn't I fear post I'm hey guys, too much, night, I listen to these and feel better. And, and never be honest, do that thing. You know, I shouldn't. Listen to positive people, people and you'll realize that your content Friday. sucks. I don't know what happened. I, I can't control contributions and make them happen. But admittedly, you know me, I'm an honest guy. Why does I'm he tell us this? Game. The game's I not can't good control anymore. where you um, give me. No fucking shit, asshole. You're not a people want to see me finish literal, it. Um, like, and when absolutely nothing comes in at all, no support. Mind controller? It upset me. You know, okay? you know how just, he'll be obvious about really dumb shit? Like what she, what she just did. Degenerate. He'll say something like, I'm not a literal mind control wizard. Like, yeah, you're not a literal mind control wizard, and nobody is. So what's, what's the point of even telling people that you can't control what they give you? It's like actually no point in saying that. He's just being weird. Just be being honest. You it's him you being want, honest, too. Whatever. Take it how no, you I'm just want. Upset. I did. You know, I was very frustrated, and I, I actually told my audience, I said, this is the kind of Feels game greedy or whatever. Content creator or streamer. When I get to the point where I'm frustrated, I just turn the game off and never play it again. Because why? I'm not getting any enjoyment. I'm really not. I'm not getting any enjoyment. Out I of thought it. he never but rage quit games. Getting, the set pieces and, and he tell us he the, don't. The scenery, he told us cool. he don't too. Tell us and told now, us. It's just frustration because they're making you use this terrible first person shooter gameplay that every other game I've ever played is better than this one. So, yeah, it's it's frustrating to me. Pathfinder because Zero. I, you know, Welcome to the. I would if it were just for me. I would have said fuck this and turn. I'm watching this before this. We're gonna watch the Daily Wrap, featuring Silent Hill news, and Plague Tale. I'm not watching Plague Tale off and play something else but now i'm gonna i am i want to finish it i played enough time into it i know people want to see the ending all right so overall the first stream today amazing great attendance great gameplay everything great second stream nothing but frustration rife with trolls no no mods to help me so i was just kind of flying by the seat of my pants trying to moderate while i was playing he was lying um, right here by the way and, and basically an incredibly poorly supported stream on top of the fact that i was frustrated and i even stayed extra to try to get further into the game Bro, and get past his boss he admit in this video if not in this video Sadly, it wasn't something else. He had a mod there that was telling him how to play. Literally, he had a hand-holding mod there. And they didn't do a good enough job because he didn't beat the boss. Fight, and it didn't pan out at all. It was basically a frustrating waste of my time, okay? So here's the deal. Tomorrow, first stream, level one podcast, like always, and more Plague Tale Requiem. I'm very excited for it. I think the game is great. I think people will show up and hopefully support. It was a really great experience today. Tomorrow night, I'm going to finish Scorn. All right, I, I, even though I'm not liking it, I want to finish it at this point. I want to see how it ends. Um, I'm nearing the end. Actually, someone who has beaten it, one of my mod, I, I take it back because there was one moderator here tonight. Ends. Um, I'm nearing the end. Actually, someone who has beaten it, one of my mod, I, I take it back because there was one moderator here tonight. But he was. Um, I always point this out, but DSP is one of the most thankful people in the fucking world. That dude didn't exist. He actually forgot they existed. He's like, he's like Amaranth. Forgetting his supporters exist. <laughs> Yo, he got an actual mod in the chat. And they were, hel they were helping in the game. And I only assume they fucking banned somebody. And he do a daily rap. Man, I didn't even have any mods. And next time I play the game, I'm going to get help from one of the mods. Well, excuse me, a mod was there last time. What the fuck? How you just get that wrong? I don't understand it. You know, trying to do everything Maybe by he's just, fucking degenerate. He's just really, really forgetful. That's it. It's not that You're a uh, fucking nothing means anything. It's just that he's really forgetful about everything. Um, Obviously. Basically told me I'm going to find Prancer and Blitz in the last and why Rain they have such dumb now, names. I'm frustrated at it. It might take me a little longer than that. So tomorrow night's late stream, I want to finish Scorn. All right? And if we have extra time, which likely we're going to, we'll probably just do some Q&A or do some nice interactive stuff at the end to have a nice chill end of the week. That way, if it's frustrating, I can unwind from the frustration and just have a good time Come with you guys. And relax. Get some. But tomorrow is my Come final second streaming day of the week. Oh, I got my day off the big on at the Thursday. End. And Come Friday, I'm buying a new game, God of Night. Come and right get now, some. As of now, I don't even have enough Come for all of that funding. Japanese Gex is in. Very oh. slow day I think it's like a big now, man. Tonight, there was almost no support for Scorn. All right? So this is alarm. I have a day off. I have I'm to pay for on Thursday. I have to buy the new game on Friday. I got to buy a game day, tomorrow. Be no, I can't buy Gotham Daniel. Nights on Friday. I'm just going to have to wait. Maybe maybe start tomorrow. I, I have to pay for on Thursday. I have to buy the new game on Friday. I if I don't have a good day tomorrow, I can't buy Gotham Nights on Friday. Shit! Dinger I'm just going to have to wait. No. a good day tomorrow. Gotham Nights, Gotham no! Nights I'm just going to have to wait. What is Good day, tomorrow, streamer. I can't buy Gotham Knights on Friday. <laughs> this dude. I'm just going to have to wait. This is in a different universe. Day, tomorrow, I can't buy Ooh, Gotham Knights on Friday. So much. I'm just going to have to wait. Maybe maybe start it Saturday instead. 
and then on Friday we I guess we just do more Plague Tale. Um, that's just the situation what I'm the in, guys. What the fuck is the day difference gonna make? I don't even want to really ask, but I don't know if I want to know. What's the day difference gonna make? You know, I'm not making it up. I'm not. You know, I'm not being trying to be greedy. I'm telling. You. And then, why do you think he got to tell us this? He think that people that give him money like him and trust him. So why is he saying this? Like a very awkward statement while he's asking for something. Wait, maybe maybe started Saturday instead, and then on Friday we. He's like a do... suspicious man on the street, like actually on the street. I'm not making it up, bro. I need this money for real. For what? To fucking take your wife out for one dinner a week? Oh, yeah, you need to do that so much, dude. That's his day off. That's his money for day off. Get the fuck out of here. Or Plague Tale. Um, and that's just the food. situation I'm in, guys. <laughs> you know, I'm not making it up. I'm not, you know, I'm not being, trying to be greedy. I'm telling you, this is the situation I'm in. And when I have I'm a not making like it up. tonight, it's, I'm not trying to be greedy. I just need some money. I'm not, you know, I'm not being, trying to be greedy. I'm telling you, this is the situation I'm in. And when I have a stream like tonight, it's like, damn. Do you want to talk about insult to injury, right? All right, so tomorrow, let's hope for a better day. There is no down on It's already super late. I, you know, I'm already in here, stuck in here in the fucking office late now doing this. Doing what? I just want to get out of here and relax with my wife, which I'm going. Oh, my Lord. What is, what is wrong? He hates everything about all of this. He don't even do anything. This is the situation ah. I'm in. And when I have a stream like tonight, it's like, damn. He's just chilling all talk day about and it's still ain't enough. Right? He got a live hand holder, and they want to do it, and he want to read it, and he still can't do it. It, it just don't work. All right, this so right tomorrow, let's What's hope today? for a better day. What happened in, what's I'm happening cool today? down and unwind. It's already super late. What, what I, you know, I'm already in here, stuck in here today? in the fucking office late uh, now doing game? this. Yeah, the right uh, game. I just want to get out of here and, and relax with my wife, else. which I'm going to. Um, please have a good night. Please enjoy the video. The play tale to. is great. I know you're going to enjoy the play tale. You're probably going to laugh your ass off at how bad scoring. Um. And uh, when I come back tomorrow, we regroup, more fun Plague Tale, and hopefully the end of scoring and some chill. Yeah, stuck in the week. office. And I hope if you can, you'll support the stream. Stuck in okay? the office talking Everyone, in front of this evening. stack of toys. I'll He's like Boogie. Morning. Peace out. Thanks a lot. Peace out. He didn't even, like, shoot his gun at us when he did that. That's how you know. That's how you know it's a bad peace out when he don't give you the gun, the gun hand. Well, we're in the, uh, the live. Get ready, everybody. Silent Hill News. Then more. Plague Tale Requiem. October 19, 2022. Oh yeah, we got some messages. Good morning, everyone. Uh, YouTube is working poorly already. Stuff is taking ages to load. You know what? I don't know what he's talking about. Yeah, and I don't have time daily to be making shorts, sadly. <laughs> he don't have time, to, time daily to make one minute long videos. Why would you say you don't have time for something like this? To just be mean? To be mean to people that listen to you. Being mean. Definitely related to YouTube playback. The mic is fine. Yes, he's talking about some shit. I'm not reading the context of these. But we do have... Uh, somebody said something dumb. Sorry you didn't hear your tips go yesterday, sad face. We got, why does someone always say romance cat? What the fuck is this all about? And then Femboy Jeremy says that that's strange. You know, I agree. Uh, I check and double check OBS and I have no idea. I need a pro to come here and look at the tech side of stuff to figure it out. But you see, I've tried for years and to no avail. So let me get this straight. Whatever like gamer thing DSP talking about, we need an actual tech to look at it big ups not just somebody that know how to fix something just an actual tech like uh, somebody from geek squad it's funny when i hear computer tech or read somebody talking about a tech in that way oh look i can't scroll up anymore i actually just always think a geek squad person i don't even know if geek squad exists but like you know a computer technician what Greetings. they exist but they probably take really high paying jobs. A <laughs> tick. <laughs> okay, he's muted. We got to go back to get the authentic opening. Dark Sea Devil. Is that?
that how you say it? Dark C Deffel. There's a Dark C D or Dark C D Phil. Ah, my name is. What? My name is. Oh. My name is. Dark C Deffel. Ah, my name is. What? My name is. Who? Oh. My name is. Oh. This is Dark C. Baffel. This is a bonus level, it. man, and you can take that to the bank. Now, what is this opening? What the fuck is this opening? This is a troll opening. Five gifted subs. Fake five gifted subs. Which is one of Look at that troll opening. It's like being pissed <laughs> off boy. <laughs> I see. Look, all of y'all pissed off too. <laughs> the troll opening. Uh, I gotta turn on my light, you guys. You're a fucking degenerate. <laughs> His sitting pose? I don't want to talk about it. Leave me alone. And he's so... Why does he do these things? All the times he fucking talk about nothing when he's across the room? What just happened? Is this a thing? What's happening? Well, oh, it's a clip. A shout out. I thought, I thought somebody had a really long entrance that I forgot I said. Holy shit. All the times he talked like about nothing across the fucking room. When he's opening the stream, right? The thing he call a podcast. He awkwardly does whatever this is. In the opening. Maybe he was muted too. He probably was. Alright everyone. Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> You're a fucking degenerate. What is this? Just pretend I didn't start Yo. recording until right now. Okay. Okay. Hello everyone. Oh my god, look. The troll opening continues. It's a new shtick. Uh, we gotta open the windows. Now, Pac-Man shirt Just on. Just pretend I didn't start recording until oh, right yeah. now. Now, now we're good. Wait, third time, rule of threes. Vince good morning, Thomas. everyone, and welcome to the Level 1 Podcast, where we're busy having fun down here on Level 1. I'm Dark Side Phil, and I welcome you here to my final consecutive streaming day of the week. Always well prepared for the show, as you guys know. You know, tons of preparation going into this to make sure the moment that we begin, everything's right how it should be. How's everyone doing? Today is uh, Wednesday, the 19th of October, 2022. It is my final consecutive streaming day of the week, and I hope that you're all having a good day and you're ready for some fun and spooky stuff today as we continue on with double horror-themed games. One, a, a horror game, because it's got a spooky atmosphere, it's got a lot of creepy gameplay elements, a lot of death, a lot of dismemberment, and a lot of uh, grim stuff. The other game is just shit, and that's equally scary. So, I'm very excited for today's streams, and I hope that you guys are too. Um, we have some big news today, which is why I actually changed the border of the Level 1 Podcast today. Ladies and gentlemen... Today we have tons of Silent Hill news that's already been leaked. There was supposed to be a Silent Hill event this afternoon. There still is, by the way. It's going to happen around 2 p.m. Pacific time in the middle of my live stream. But they already leaked all the information about it on the internet. Everyone already knows everything that's going to happen in this presentation. Big I guess the purpose Wolf. of the presentation now Sadly, will be to you get see, to see footage a level of what one they're going to talk about. Live. But I'm going to cover it fully right here on today's podcast and all the news is good if you're a fan of silent this hill is a very interesting thing bsp is gonna do with the silent hill segment hell today um because the news is some of the best news we've heard he's, in ages they're actually i mean he just told us what he's doing silent hill which is great they didn't even do it yet why I can't silent bro hill. you guys he can just wait until tomorrow oh that's mean whatever that's obviously very toxic he's like yeah man 
the news leaked about this thing that's going to get announced tonight, but all the news is true yeah. that leaked. So I'm going to tell you everything now before they talk about it. <laughs> introduced me to the uh, franchise over mean. a decade ago when you urged me to buy well, you guys introduced me to the franchise over a decade ago when you he urged grew up with these games by the way Hill he just off the cuff told 3. us that now at the but time he didn't i mean never it. played the games before see and you guys basically but don't worry i didn't find a clip of him saying, saying it anyway it was really bad and it was jay but he just fucking said it. it was just a random life effects were back i had never played the original so i didn't have a frame of reference to compare i loved the games um Get up in you know, since then, over the years, I pretty much have played every Get major Silent Hill game. So let's think about this. I played Silent Hill 1, 2, 3, 4, The Room, um, Homecoming, Downpour. The only one that I think I didn't play, there's one that's like a rare, rare game. I think it's either like PS2 only or something like that. And it's like really hard to get. Bro, it's incredibly expensive. Apparently, he couldn't look it up ahead um, of time. If you can't find Playing it, this weird not fucking digital, dumb like, segment anywhere. out, this news segment like, about Silent Hill. You can't buy it and just play it. It's Dude, like you can't buy it, but you can buy it if you have enough money. So that but one you can't I never just buy played. Oh. <clears throat> what game is he talking about, and by the way? the other one that I never went through and finished was Shadow. How much Memories, does it cost? If it's less than $100, he's greatly exaggerated. I was playing it for like the game's worth years ago. And I basically played it for 25 minutes. I couldn't play it anymore. It was just so atrociously bad. The controls didn't work. I didn't work. know those games was like, worth this is such a piece of shit. And anything. I would never go back to it I either. I thought they just kind of came um, out. Both of them. Memory, so, shot of memory. I love Silent origins. Hill. I've done multiple playthroughs of certain That's Silent nice. Hill games. Like two, you guys had me go back and Super replay Super man. And I played it on the hardest difficulty. With, and with no ammo, I beat the boss with a stick. Yeah, it's true. I beat the final boss with a fucking stick. I beat the shit out of it. Don't you love the white balance of this camera going crazy again? If he keeps doing this, I might have to turn off the auto white balance. What it okay. Full disclosure about this new webcam. The, the the sharpness is absolutely great. You can see way more detail on me in the backgrounds. People love the webcam. Yeah, it's just and like eighty dollars. Because this webcam is the I'll same exact $80. company and or just a newer model than the older pre one I used to use. On Amazon, it actually uses the like exact the same CPU load sure, as my probably. old webcam. Probably. So it hasn't affected like anything negative on my streams it's all the same basically only better quality problem is the light balance is complete shit i have no idea how an over 10 year old webcam had better light balance software than this new camera it's, it's pretty ridiculous but you know what's ridiculous how thankful dsp is y'all know dsp got this camera gifted to him by a fan how many of y'all know that at least, I guess it's a good thing he's not just bringing it up every day that he shits on the camera, but he's like, yeah, man, this new camera I got is worse than the old one I fucking threw away. I mean, you could buy another camera. He's going to tell you that this one that he's using is the newest one, and it's actually not. The newest one is the Logitech Brio. He got the one from, like, 2017. Logitech needs to make a new camera, like a, a 2022 one, a premium camera, and he can complain about it. It is what it is. Even I guess the trade off is that you see a little bit of color. Look at that. Look at that. You see a little bit of the color fucked up, but at the very least, Gifted you can actually camera. see the detail of what you're watching. Right. So I guess the trade off uh, is worth it in most cases. Big Here's the Kevin truth. in the chat. Once we start getting the full fall days. I remember this one dude. He's uh, long gone now. You remember him as well. His name was Guitar Punk Master GPM. I remember a promise that he made to you and to me. Uh, hold on. I'm a really, really nice guy. So I'm going to keep that promise going through their memory for uh, a little while. It's going to take me a second. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Front page help. Your gifts up to Almighty Underscore Frog has expired. No. Shawnee by Down Bad. They watch Hot Tub streams all day, too. I see his front page.
don't know. I'm working on something. You better take a sip. Oh my god, a gift is up from Shawnee underscore bot to Tevin, the 15th month. With cloudy days, because bas this starts tomorrow, basically. We have full fall weather here starting Thanks, tomorrow. Shawnee bot full for cloud continuing. Cover, rain, basically everything you expect from positivity. the autumn. Once that happens, there'll be no issues with this anymore. The problem right now is that outside, the sun keeps coming out and going behind a cloud and coming out and going behind a cloud. When that happens, the white balance completely fucks up over and over. <clears throat> I wonder if it'll ever be a point where he don't tell us this. So, cool. Um, so we have a lot of Silent Hill stuff to talk about today, and it's all good news. Also, obviously what I'd like to do is talk a little bit about what happened yesterday with Scorn. Oh my god. <laughs> I You think you're going to bring up the money thing with this? Like that he didn't get tips, basically? I wasn't I've getting any tips as well. Since I was like six years old, okay? When it comes to video games and playing games, I don't think I've ever seen a video game go from so He's good scoring over to so to atrociously, pathetically bad. Nice. Yo, is he ever pretending Scorn was that good the first day? Games. What? And I, that's not me Where? being super dramatic. I've on never seen a on game stream. start off so strong not and, his. and unique and turn this out to be such a pile crazy. of dog shit. I can't believe whoever okay, made man. Scorn had no concept that they were ruining their own game like that. Good job. I'm, I'm completely good job, blown game, away that idiots. someone was so ignorant how to, make a good to game. what a gamer would want. Maybe they should learn what gamers Holy want. Shit. They would if we'll they made a game. That, maybe, uh, I don't um, know, three years so, instead of six? let's just get right into it, all right? Let's let's get right into the meat yeah. of everything. Um, today's my final consecutive streaming day of the week, all right? I'd like to get to a discussion out of the way so we tip can move discussion. on and talk about games and game news. Money discussion. Um, this week, I had Build some really great supportive days, and I had some really very slow days for support. Um, it was a mixed bag, to be for sure. Speaking of mixed uh, bag, I got a set new sub goal. Si it's uh, going to be uh, epic. I said Silent Hill, I, I got Silent Hill almost. on the brain. I can't get it off my Everybody mind. Everybody so paid excited. attention, and um, all heard it at the same time. Plague Tale Requiem. Great stream. That's the way it worked. Tons of fun. Graphics were great. Game Graphics got dark. Were great. Game got interesting within the first two hours. Um, support was That's outstanding. I, he said no it was slow. Everything was a positive about that And then that he told us it got exciting and halfway was an through. utter fucking dud waste of my long. time. Not only the game being frustrating as shit, but support basically being nearly non-existent during that stream. I wonder if I'm supposed to go back and watch the footage stream, because of this speech. to me getting very, very frustrated about it. Um, and Monday, you know, I had the conclusion of uh, Evil Within, and I paired that with ba Bassmaster and essentially, you know, very no. slow support there too. He paired because it with I've Monday had Night Bites. Slow days this week. 
I find myself in a Not Bassmaster. Allow me to explain. What's ba- Oh, I shit, he's going to big, big, huh? segment yesterday Fuck. on this very podcast about how I am very, very You're different from the vast majority of content creators out there. The reason is because I've been doing this for 14 years. I've actually been doing it for a living for about 12. All right? The reason that I can still do this today the way that I do this, all right, is oh, because of you. He's talking about when he shamed people for making that bag and then proceeded to say, oh, I don't You're even have anything to give a shout out to because I didn't get any contributions. And then he talked in circles until somebody gave him $5. That's what he's talking about. Because you guys okay. show up, talk about real word of mouth to promote and support my content. It's not because I run ads. It's not because I have paid partnerships. It's not because I schmooze everyone in the industry and kiss their butts to get early copies. And that way I can have reviews that get inflated. I like that he think of early, new things you know, and find new things to, to add to his daily discussion. All the stuff and all the of them are negative. Of content creators these days are doing. The thing about schmoozing and shit. Here, that's like brand new. Kind of channel. It's just a new. <clears> I see myself. A new way to hate on everybody. In the very same I don't fucking act nice to people, man. We're all gamers. He don't act nice. He don't schmooze. Jenner. We don't even know what that dude said to Sony. We all, we, we forgot his name. But we don't even know how that dude acted towards Sony. We're all very much fans oh, well. of You're video games for our whole lives. We love playing games, sharing our experiences of games. And the reason that people come here to my channel is for honesty. You know when you watch anything on this channel, it's not a paid advertisement. It's not me skewing the truth for you guys or sugarcoating literally anything. Oh my God. Because I have no reason to do so. I can't lose a sponsorship when I don't have one. I can't chance not getting a free copy from Sony I don't know if you know this. Because I don't get free copies. I don't apply for them because I'm not part of that industry. I'm very much an outsider. And because of an outsider, like of my content is very 79. different from the content that those kind of people put out on the internet. Pretty cool, dude. All right? So yeah, I did nice. a big segment about this yesterday. Help. Put out on the internet. All right? So I did a big segment about this yesterday. Explaining that the reason that I'm still able to do, be here and be honest with you and transparent and everything is because you guys support this content the they way you do. Mail, man. All right? With so, the best pretty Gex pertinent on the that website. I talked about that yesterday morning. Because then last night, I'm playing Scorn. The game completely exposes itself I as agree, a terrible brother. game. If I could I'm give 7,000 VIP stream. badges now, out. Now, what happens? The people who are here to watch it and enjoy are kind of upset. They're like, man, this sucks. We thought Phil liked this game, and now this game is falling flat on his face. Well, it, That's it, disappointing. It, it, he didn't even talk about this until now. Now he's developed this discussion that his viewers had with him. And it sounds so condescending and cringe and weird. Oh, we thought Phil liked this game and Phil isn't having fun now. Bro, he put words in people's mouths and they make him sound like a toddler. The same way he talk about Cat and make her sound like she's really dumb. In that really specific way he'll talk sometimes. Well, what really happened was, I feel like the people who were here to watch it and, <laughs> and enjoy the third person thing is are kind insane. of upset. They're like, man, this sucks. We thought Phil liked this game, and now this game is falling flat on his face. That's disappointing. But what really happened was, Very the fucking troll scumbag for me who were and for Phil. had all Wait, their viewers streams. come over, and all of a sudden, I'm... He didn't bring up restreams earlier. He just said that, like, the trolls told each other that Phil was upset, and then trolls showed up. I mean, fuck, dude. What are you even mad about? You're mad about people showing up because they didn't tip. You want you want trolls to give you money, DSP, so you can complain about a fucking chargeback. And then I bring it up right after. Because he's not going to bring them chargebacks up to date, fam. I, I can't even put that in a prediction anymore. Oh, my God. These phone calls, man. They just won't stop. Getting like 500 views on the stream, the most but half the people are just trolling in the chat. They're being complete dickheads about the game. Like, oh, you just suck. Uh, at the game. You what just you fucking suck. idiot. Watch the game. Just look at the fucking game. I honestly I'm didn't not even really see that. But it, it probably shit. happened within two Everyone hours. Everyone has said as soon as the gunplay begins, I only begins, watched this the last 20 minutes because I'm a troll. It's not just me, but that's the funny thing. Whatever oh, I look, say. Now, other people, we want to talk about what other people think about the fucking game now. When it's negative. This dude blows. Other people hate on it, on it too. So you can't say that I'm dumb. Because everybody don't like the game. game like, Why the fuck you even play it? Oh, you just suck at the game. Why the fuck he praised it and said it was cool then? Uh, whatever. What are you, a fucking idiot? What are you, Watch an idiot? the game. Just look shit. at the fucking game. Are you an idiot? I'm not the only Listen person to everybody else. It. It's shit. 
Everyone has said as soon as the gunplay begins, this game goes to shit. Welcome to the stream. Frank 3 Castle, 1994. It's not just me, but that's the funny thing. Whatever I say, oh, because Phil it's said it's not It's a super true. mini live well, level one podcast. Dunce. Go look at Restream anyone else segment. who's played the game. That everyone says the same thing. This game falls apart. So they don't be a up dunce. The game design. Okay? Okay. So it falls apart because they fucking fucked up the game design. Okay? So I'm being honest with my audience. And people, some people like that, and others are just. I love that constantly. this is actually right? the opening. So he's doing this before the gaming news. Now. All right, I I'm played glad. an extra forty-five minutes on my late stream, which I almost never do. You know, I like spending time with my wife when I can. I did sacrifice that last night in order to actually try to get as far. He told us at the end of the thing that he was going to spend time with her. He doubled down in the same video, and he was like, "Which I will do." How the fuck you come back the next day and then tell us you ain't do it? Oh man. This This is like the meanest content creator in the world. Cause think about it. If you somehow care about what this person's going through, and then you didn't watch that video when they said that they were gonna spend time with her, you're thinking to yourself, damn. This dude actually didn't spend time with his wife last night because he didn't make enough money playing games. That's kind of fucked up. Maybe I should tip Phil. But if you fucking watch the other stupid fucking video, you tell us at the end of it, uh, I gotta get out of here. I've gotta go spend time with my wife, which I will do, by the way. So what, what? Then, he, then of course, if you would say that, he would say, well, what I meant was that I didn't spend as much time as I wanted to. I mean, what the fuck? Nobody can do anything as much as they want to do it. We all cope with everything. I could in this game, and it didn't really pay off. And what about what Cat won? You think she fucking give a fuck about this dude sniffing up ass all day? Even if he is doing that? I don't know. Because number one, the game is so bad. I, I mean, we'll see it tonight because I'm playing it tonight. Unless I can't believe all. how bad it's the game design really is. Throw a boss at you. Oh, it's not really a boss. It's a puzzle. Okay, figure out the puzzle. Great, thanks for doing that. Here's a second boss right away. Same exact boss, and now you have no ammo to fight it because you wasted it all on the first boss. Okay, so how about this? Fuck air you, you fucking game designers. Crack, You're actually assholes. Day, no one likes crack, you. <laughs> really? Crack, like, if you really want to piss someone off, that's what you do in a game. It just, there was no excuse for it. It's a terrible game design. So not only am I raging at the game, it's actually my least supported stream of the week. Okay? Which, uh, which made me be transparent with my audience. I said, you know, the raging at the game, degenerate. it's actually my least supported stream of the week. Okay? It's actually my least supported stream of the week. Game. It's actually my least supported stream of the week. Okay? It's actually my least supported stream of the week. Okay? Which, uh, which made me be transparent with my audience. stream of the week. It's actually my least supported stream of the week. I wanted week. some variety. Okay. We which start with which the made me be transparent with my audience. With I said, okay listen, sometime. this morning, we'll some bombs on that. this very show, this podcast, I told you guys that I essentially make a living Welcome off to the of level your one support. Podcast. That's Thing. why you didn't see an ad Whatever. placement tonight. That's why you didn't see me shilling products We have today. no ad and placement. And when I'm going extra, and I'm suffering through an awful game, Suffering that there'd be reciprocation. through an awful game. Oh my god, he's going wild game. on this clip, huh? I would have oh, hoped no. that there'd be reciprocation. That people Bruh. suffering through an awful game. <laughs> I would hope that there'd be reciprocation. That people. This is like, it's like he actually wants somebody to say, "Why are you being entitled, bro?" Just so he can say, "Entitled? What the fuck do you mean entitled? I just want to fucking pay my bills and take care of my fucking family. You call me fucking entitled?" You don't want fucking entitled. You fucking man. It's like he wants somebody to do it. What is this? This is like, I always bring it up. He's like literally way worse than anybody else who's made fun of. Especially the $5 lady. You know the $5 lady. Or at least the fucking clip. Roderick. I hate it over there. I could play the sound clip uh, extremely easily. And then you'll be like, oh yeah, I remember that. I remember that voice. Five dollars a month. 
I'm now working. you have hours of time to watch me. Okay. And not five dollars. Okay. He hated on that lady too. He's way worse than her. Ad placement tonight. That's why you didn't see what me if he shilling products today. And when I'm going extra, well, and I'm know suffering. What? No matter what, he's better because he doesn't show product and have ad placement. And he's probably, no, she's probably a millionaire too. And DSP hate millionaires. Into an awful game. I didn't know she changed it. I would hope that there'd be reciprocation. But it would make sense. Would I mean, it is literally okay. a bad bunny already. That extremely popular something. There was something. Recognize full state extra today to try to get through this shitty game for us. It sucks that the game sucks now, but this is, you know, we really appreciate Phil's effort. Remember when right? uh, Amber Lynn and had to change that. her name and that didn't because happen. of, like, so a fucking 80-year-old porn star? And if she's not 80, she looks 80. <laughs> I'm being extra toxic. I know that lady watching right now. Uh, what the hell did Dingus say? You? Yes, you, streamer. The choice of Swollen Dingus' unhealthy lunch. Oh, sweet. Wingstop, CC's, Little Caesar, Subway, Taco Bell, Burger King, Popeyes, Raisin Cane's disqualified. Because uh, you had it yesterday. Okay, so we got the cheap choice. Do I want to think about this? CC's. Isn't that pizza? I think that's pizza. And Little Caesar's is pizza. And Subway is Subway, Taco Bell. Okay, so Subway's is banned. Little Caesar's is done. Uh, Popeyes is a uh, mixed bag. I don't even eat Popeyes, but I'm not going to ban him from the list. I'm going with uh, Taco Bell. Specifically Taco Bell. Because somebody's going to say, what the fuck, you ate Taco Bell? And they're going to make fun of you for it. So I'll say Taco Bell. And get something uh, not extravagant, but not. don't just get a taco. Come on, man. And get those little cinnamon things. They still make them, I think. I used to eat them in the 90s. Somebody know what I'm talking about. Every time I bring them up, somebody say, oh, that? And then I'm like, oh, yeah, that. So they still make them. They have to. What happened last night? I vented my honest frustrations. I was like, yeah, I'm disappointed. I stayed late. I was hoping we could maybe beat those. it or I at least get really like far in it. And basically, all I got was trolls shitting on me on the make stream. I didn't, the no one, you know, came yeah, get a crunch wrap. I can't believe I didn't just name crunch wrap. Get a fucking crunch wrap the stream extra That's it. because I worked my butt off last night. It was the opposite. It was basically people being negative. Broken mailman lying to us. No stream tonight. Going to be painting the bathroom walls. Don't you do that in that game, right? The, so I I talk about that honestly. Flipper. Yeah, house with flipper. all of you. All right, because I'm a transparent guy. That's how you I'm not going to You say I'm not going to stream, man. I'm going to be cleaning my house, and then you play house house flipping. Your coach, shit. I'm not going to make shit up. This is my living. And if I have a stream that's slow, it very much negatively affects me and the business and everything around me. It does. All right? And last night, that Even stream if it's not was a living, major a pain in my ass. Still it really it, it, it annoyed the fuck out of me. I walked out of this office so stressed day. out. Like, oh, this no. game sucks. Now I got to keep playing it to finish it tomorrow. He tried and to I don't degrade know other people support so that much. stream now because the game sucks so bad. And, and, and on top of that, I know what's going to happen. Dude, I do this Trolls are just going to shit all over last night's stream. Which is, of course, exactly what happened because these people are predictable mouth droolers whoa there's nothing smart about what they do oh. they literally just run with every trend they can so they clip my stream last night fills oh, the trolls wearing fills supreme? this fills no. that okay the trolls wearing gallery department they been stopped wearing supreme they go on with the what the, what the trolls do over last night's stream which is jet. of course exactly what happened because these people are predictable mouth droolers there's nothing smart about what they do they literally just run with everything. Yeah, why didn't he record the segment? Because technically he's kind of talking about something that's like 10 minutes long he didn't record. Whatever, man. Trend they can't. Yeah, they go with the trends. All of them go with the trends. So they clipped my stream last night. <laughs> so Phil's ungrateful. It. Phil's this, Phil's that. Okay, guys, here's the deal. I'm the incredibly grateful say that, right? for everything you guys hey. do for me. Monk ass. You were, again, I as it. I said, literally in a giant extended segment yesterday. That's not right. The reason that I am able to that's put right. out the style of content that I do Feels ungrateful. Without Feels ad weird. interruption, without shilling products, <laughs> without product placements and referral codes, without having to frustrated with chat for not supporting. Dude, it's like he's free. reading the comments. The reason Wait, I don't right? have to do any no? of that. Fuck.
All right. It's like he's like it's because you guys support that content from. the way you do. There are many other oh, content well. creators of my size that Here don't go. get the support I do, and that's why they can't make a living doing it, and I can't. There we go. I'm very grateful for that. I totally did you enjoy 100%. that? Percent. Did you enjoy that? Understand that. All right. It's I other do. people that can't fucking make it like me. Wow. Thanks, bro. Really. And I'm going to be transparent and honest with you, no matter what. Really, I don't even care. I don't even care that the trolls see. And the thing is, he don't talk about the people that are actually factually smaller than him across every platform that do it for a living. But they're not yelling about it, and he don't know who they are anyway. It's fucking tons of people that are smaller than him, and whatever do it for a living is, they do that. And he's just like, oh, it's other streamers that are my size and smaller, and they can't do it for a living. I mean, it's other stream. I don't even know what do it for a living mean. They just fucking wake up and stream and go to sleep, or they pay all of the bills with it. He wants to brag, and then he's begging. He's begging and bragging. Uh, are going to be so stupid and are going to say nasty, negative stupid. stuff about me. I don't care, because th what they say is white noise. What they say is out there. It doesn't affect us who are actually here to have a good time on the streams and, and understand and enjoy the content. The truth is, everyone last night that What's trolled the, me and what? everyone who the made truth? a stupid video overnight, ah, Phil's ungrateful. They're never, never going to support my content regardless. They're scumbags. Uh, They're there to just bring down others around yeah, them. Sucks and leads never Every support single time DSP. something like this happens, they it's jump, very unfortunate thing. right? They absolutely jump on the bullshit. It's, it's a joke. He's probably talking about it's like so the apology or something. I don't they know. They really, the they have absolutely really no weird. originality. They all just parrot each other and do the same sheepish content. They have nothing to say. They literally have nothing creative it's very or interesting abstract or unique to say at all. I don't even know They're what he's talking about. They're just the same dunces I can't repeating tell. the same diatribe and over and over in a nothing. circle. And ah. they're that stupid. So, okay, he might be done here's with the truth. Yeah, but last just night said the I truth. was absolutely Now it's the truth again. This game, which I'm going to talk about in a moment, literally destroys itself. Hopefully you can get the truth. Shame, this is a game that has tons of potential. And to see it completely squandered by bad game design choices, I can't imagine who was running this project and thought this was good gameplay. I mean, you, you have to be stupid. Um, that upset me. And then the fact that I went extra late, sacrificing time with my wife to go later and try to get further in the game. And instead of saying, okay, let's reward Phil, all I got was a bunch of hate dropped on my lap. It fucking pissed me off. And I was very honest with my audience about it. All right? I would hope you don't take that the wrong way and think that that's me being ungrateful. I'm incredibly Ow. grateful. The reason that, again, that I have the ability. You know to what this reminds me of? This reminds me of something I recently watched. The thing um, when he called people lazy for not watching them play Pokemon. And he was saying it to people at whatever, which made no fucking sense. He's complaining, like, dude, we literally watched the clip. We just watched it. I didn't even know it was going to be that important at his stream. But we just watched it. And he said, within 10 minutes and over the course of 10 minutes, that he was upset that he streamed an hour extra and that he didn't get any money with streaming an hour extra. And that was it. And he said that over and over and over and reworded it over and over and over. And now the next day, because people made him think that people are upset about it, now he's sorry, but he's not. Maybe the content that I like and I love. This the might be a Brian Griffin apology. A lot of following on the internet anymore, but I'm able to make what I make and do what I do is because of you and your support. You understand that? That and I know that. I'm not stupid. I'm not ungrateful. I'm not going to sit here and absolutely demand anything from anyone. Oh my god. Yeah, last frog in a party head with the prime. 5 months. Let's fucking go. Thanks frog for the massive positivity. During this dark day. Prime. These dark days, not even this dark day, these dark days, but uh, sometimes it's a little bit brighter. This night stream suck. Yes, I very much hope today goes much better for Duh. me because I need that support today to have my day off tomorrow <laughs> and to afford us, Gotham man. Nights on Friday, which we're about to talk about. I love him really actually in real life pretending he's going to try to earn money today to buy a fucking Gotham, Gotham game. I can even call it a Batman game. The Gotham game. No, uh, I don't even like, okay, imagine, picture this, picture your cat, pretend your cat right now, and some somebody walked up to you and said, 
yeah, your husband is hoping that he earns enough money to buy a game and pay for the day out he has with you. Would she be crying downstairs or no? Uh, it's, a, it's a now a it's what very if. suspicious. If I mean, you get to play it on Friday. Strange. He's now had now. multiple days with lower support, and there's nothing I can do about that. Nothing right? he can do. Reality, he can't control right? us, man. So, please He's understand. Say it every time. He hates that it. Last night, when I'm being transparent, this saying, sucks. Man, this really sucks. I worked there you, extra there you go. I'm frustrated. That Told last you. night, when this I'm sucks. being transparent, saying, man, this really sucks. I worked extra hard. I'm frustrated as shit, and I got nothing for it. That that's just me venting and being honest. This is not me blaming. This is not me being ungrateful or, or upset at the audience. This is just me saying, this is my life situation. And it kind of sucks. Um, you know? Didn't he say he was pissed off? Like, verbatim. I'm pretty sure he said, this pisses me off. I'm not going to watch that fucking video again. Oh, that's that's it. That's reality for me. You know? But just because I'm transparent and honest, you know, it's very, it's very annoying that now, oh, wow. Well, yeah, this is the dude that brag about how smart he is and how dumb everybody else is. And he brag about how he's 40 and he's wise because he's 40. And he brag about how he used to be a valedictorian. But I guess, you know, there's no such thing as he used to be. So he brag about how he's a valedictorian. And he's obviously dumb as fuck. But besides just being dumb as fuck, he always say stuff and then say he didn't word himself correctly. He didn't choose his words the right way. Sorry, you guys. I can't express myself correctly. He actually told us he can't express himself correctly before. Dude, that made me so mad back then. Maybe. May. I think he was like 38. Like what? You can't. And this only happens and when it's a bad thing being said, too. Why does he never say a really good thing and say, fuck, I didn't mean to be that nice. I'm sorry, bro. Why did that never happen? You could say that for the whole of humanity, probably. But why the fuck that never happened? <laughs> He's never positive by accident. Man, I'm sorry, dude. I was I was being too nice by accident. I was like, yeah, I'm going to uh, take you on vacation. And I can't. I'm sorry, bro. I think that's what Edie Bot do. <laughs> you could blame that maybe on alcohol, though. God damn it, Someone dude. out there didn't kiss their their audience's ass constantly every moment. Wait, what? Let's now say he's ungrateful and he's, no. you know, this is that. No, it's not true. Re no, now he's deflecting. It's very annoying that now, oh, wow, someone out there didn't kiss their their audience's ass constantly every someone moment. Someone out there is Let's nice. now say he's ungrateful Let's and he's, you know, this is that. No, it's not true. No, it's not true. Really, it's just not Matter true. Matter of fact, it's maybe you're and the I'm toxic tired, one. But there's nothing I can do about it because this is what there's YouTube allows. Slander. They just 100% allow it. There's so many videos last night, out of context, have nothing to do with reality. Big ups. But they will just say whatever they want. And so, of course, I have to wake up today with people saying, are you aware Arizona that Megan? Reddit said this and this? Oh, God. We got to pause on the face. Whatever they want. So, of course, I have to wake up today with people saying, are you aware? <sighs> oh, man. Reddit talked about it. Rip. That's why he's really upset then. This that's what make it even weirder that he didn't complain about that dude talking about him in that video. That got like three million views or some shit. Y'all know what I'm talking about. That uh I think I remember his name. Sunny V2. That guy. He's complaining about like a Reddit thing that probably got what a couple of thousand people saw it maybe. And the last time he complained about something that was like six thousand upvotes somewhere. But we can't fight every battle. That's how we lose all of the wars, dude. So it makes sense. I just, uh, I think about it with the small brain sometimes. Let's see. Big ups to the almighty underscore. Plus, don't fucking say clussy here. Uh, also, doesn't this whiter than Elmo's school? Paste, get paid on Friday. He'll be all right, maybe. Oh, uh, no. He also told us he might get, get paid on Friday. Wait. He told us he's gonna get paid on Friday. So, yeah. Basically, he's... I hope he tweet off Friday. Sorry, you guys. I didn't get paid today. Uh, the payment's late. But then the thing is, if you do that, like... I'm pretty sure YouTube payments are more stable than Twitch payments. As in, quote-unquote, everybody get paid the same day. But it's kind of like that with Twitch, too. DSP basically can't really lie about websites not paying them or being late on payments. But what if they are? I never got paid late by any website. Even fucking stream me. I got super lucky with that.
some people just straight up didn't get paid. And, you know, they had their viewers pay for stuff on that fucking stupid channel. And they didn't get paid by the site. But I guess uh, I'm, I'm super lucky, man. That oh, Reddit said this like and this no, ready, <laughs> ready. Do you think anyone with a fucking brain cell goes to fucking Wait, Reddit at this point? No. Oh, no, no one wastes their time on that nonsense. Right. What are you crazy? <laughs> There's a reason that people flock to Reddit. It's people of the same mindset. They got about two brain cells between them that they rub together as they post. No one cares about Reddit hate threads, Shit. right? Who gives a fuck about that? Help. I don't. But so you know. But then I gotta put up with it because now today I want to do a bunch of great streams. We're gonna continue with Plague Tale Requiem. Right? What's going We're going to have a fun username, segment right here. We're going to talk about the future of Silent Hill. Man, I'm pumped for the future of Silent Hill with all the news that's coming out today. This is excellent it's, stuff. Wait, it's possible right? I already have it. This is exciting. And it was just wrong. But now I got to deal with all the Oh, like oh this shit that happened last time. I don't fucking care. But at one point, I'm, it was more I've been than doing this for 14 years. Every day, it was kind of the same shit happens. Yeah, it is. It's the I same scum, tired nonsense. I don't even need to know about it. The less I know, the better. But yeah, it bothers me. It bothers me that. I okay. can't just be real with an audience the because God forbid someone on the internet is real. That means that oh they're ungrateful God, and negative and toxic. Real, what the fuck are you talking about? Really? What are you talking about? That's not what I'm I said last what night this means and what at all. About a lot. I had a whole segment <laughs> yesterday about how I'm different from I'm all the other content real, creators bro. because don't I don't have it. any of those promotions, ads, me. or shilling. You're it's you guys that support my content. Then I have an incredibly frustrating stream with a terrible game and people don't support it. Of course I'm going to have a negative reaction to You're that. What else degenerate. did you expect would happen? I'd be, then I promotions, ads, or shilling. I it's you guys that support my something content. Real then I have an incredibly frustrating stream with a terrible game and people don't support it. I have a frustrating stream. I don't need, like how was it frustrating? First of all, how was it frustrating? Because the game was better because tips were low. He don't even really let us know. We don't even know. We got to make an assumption about nothing. And then he say the game was bad. Okay, fair enough, whatever. And then he say people didn't tip. Well, why the fuck oh, would they? Poster boy. Why the fuck would people tip a self-admittedly frustrated streamer that's playing a self-admitted bad game? I don't even know if I could say self-admitted in that case. But why the fuck would you tip it? Especially with this dude who spent the last seven years telling people that they support him if they like the game. I'm, I say seven years talking about him getting tips and cheers and shit. And that is probably wrong. But you get the point. You guys support me because you like me. And then it turned into you support him because you like the game. And now he's saying that he was frustrated. Why the fuck would you give him money then so he can say I'm not going to give you a shout out? He's an idiot. Somebody gave him $2 at the end of that rant too. And I pointed it out. And he didn't say anything mean. He just said, complain more, it's endearing. But DSP didn't even read it. He didn't even say, thank you for the $2. What the fuck? Nothing's good enough. Feels of bad. course I'm going to have a negative of reaction course, to that. Of course he's gonna have a negative reaction. He was frustrated and he was playing a bad game. Why didn't you tell? Her two words. Slim. Yeah, what else did you expect would yeah, happen? I'd be happy and I'd be throwing glitter and I have unicorns and rainbows. What the fuck? But again, you have to be a, uh, someone some. with a brain cell in your head to understand why something would happen head. like that as opposed to, you know, constantly it's a terrible game right and here? people don't support it. Of course I'm going to have a negative reaction to that. What else would you expect would happen? I'd be happy. I mean, I could say, of course, people won't tip that stupid stream you just told us about. What do you expect to happen? And I'd be throwing glitter and I have unicorns and rainbows. What the fuck? But again, you have to be a, a, someone with a brain cell in your head to understand why something would happen like that as opposed to, you why know, something would happen like what? someone's butt, which I don't do. Why, you guys why he would be frustrated? I don't know what happened. Like five things did. So that, that all being said. Oh my god. Okay. <clears throat> Dude, I love that five. I uh y'all saw me. I know I do apologize to anyone who did feel offended. As a matter of fact, that was the fucking scorn stream. Fact, oh my god. He did it. Brian Griffin. The classic. I uh I apologize. I, I do apologize if, to anyone who did feel offended. He gave us like actual political apologies. He's a fucking let's player. And not even a popular one, and not even a good one. And not even one that get a lot of attention. And he definitely don't get attention for playing any games.
I apologize if I offended anyone and for who I offended during my rant. Last Man, night. I was in a you know, save, I, okay. save the drama for your mama, Playboy. I, uh, you know, I do apologize to anyone who did feel offended last night. I wasn't attacking anybody. In fact, mostly I was angry at these shitheads who came by. I thought he wasn't angry. Because everyone's like, oh, wow, your stream's doing... I feel like he told us he wasn't angry or he didn't say he was or something along those lines within this segment. And now he's picking who he was angry at. And guess who? It was the trolls. Well, no, it wasn't. Those are, Half those viewers were trolls who came over from a restreamer. And they were... Is this made up? Like, is this factually made up? You better take a sip. I don't want to look into this. Was I around last night? The hell was I doing? Nobody was restreaming scorn, man. No, nobody was talking with a microphone restreaming scorn, right? What's Ann? What's Dingus? Who the fuck was doing it? Who sent a thousand people at DSP stream to call them bad at games? <laughs> DSP watching Dingus streams. It's like, what the fuck? Fucking stupid restreamers. He sent it trolls to my fucking stream. It might have been Roderick. It could have been Roderick. It could be literally anybody. Anybody. Anybody and everybody count. Especially in DSP's dark, twisted reality. Oh, man. And the thing is, just like how he talked about he spent time with his wife and then he showed up today and told us he didn't spend time with his wife, he said his restreamer shit and it sounds scary as fuck. If you don't know anything or care or paying attention or you're just listening and you're a guy that likes the guy, you're like, whoa, he got restreamed by like a thousand people. You're going to be thinking that fucking CNN was making fun of this dude. You're going to think he's getting like actually buried every day. It's awful. And I don't even know if it happened at all. Just here to shit on me during a very frustrating part of the game because they knew they saw the frustration building in me and they're like, whoa, Phil's staying late. and This is a rare thing, right? <clears throat> so ignore all the nonsense you know just because i want to be honest with you and transparent and tell you what's really going on in my head you know doesn't it, it, here's the thing i tell you exactly how it is i do i'll tell you exactly what i'm thinking how it is that's that's it there's nothing else to it but then what those idiots do is they extrapolate upon it. well you see because he said and did this it really means this no it doesn't really mean anything what it really means is they have an agenda their agenda is to cause as much drama around me as possible because when there's drama around me they have more content to put out and the content's always negative and toxic never a positive what whenever have they said a positive thing about me when is the last time dsp talked about a positive thing on a level one podcast technically the only positive thing he's going to talk about today is going to be when he leaks silent hill information that the actual people that made it didn't even talk about and he admitted to it and told us that they didn't, like, he's basically scamming them. Like, on purpose. Mm. Whatever, Damn. man. That shit good! I complain all the time about how generally negative DSP is. He talk about nice stuff and positive stuff, and he make it negative. And then, like, okay, just listen okay. to him talk about the, the last few gaming news stories. Like, damn, dude, nothing interesting, nice, cool, positive happening in gaming? Is it nobody raising a lot of money for charity? That could count as gaming news. Some jackass raising like $100,000 for charity. He could talk about that. If he could talk about some bitch lying, li literally lying, to get attention and to make money. He could talk about somebody doing something nice, just a generic nice thing. But I, you, know, you know what? I know what the positive news was. The positive, not news. The last positive segment when he talked about that dude who gave sony an attitude or whatever i'm wording it different than what he worded it but that dude when he talked about that dude and how he's not gonna go back to sony to get review copies and that's still a negative story it's a dude that was like you know acting some type of way and he don't want to deal with sony anymore but it's not like i don't know it's not this it's not, it's not positive news you know what I mean? You know what I am saying? Oh god, escapist guy. Yeah, I love escapist guy too. We don't fucking know who he is anymore. DSP's never gonna talk about him again. But he acted like he wanted to go out on a date with him the other day. Uh, big ups, hate army. For the 333. Back to back to I didn't back hear him when it played. Back to back to back.
like Drake. 15 whole hey, minutes Tommy, ago. Hopefully it's still alive. Forty-year-old man with a business degree You're and a forty-year legacy face. of being a professional gamer on the internet is mad. People said he was bad at video games, <laughs> and people have been saying he's bad at games for a long time. And I thought it was all right to say he's bad at games too. Wait a second, I just thought about this. DSP. Every time somebody fuck with him, he say specifically, it's one thing to say. Uh, it's one thing to say it feels bad at games. It's another. So how is it not okay to say it's bad at games now? DSP. Oh, you do have 2,000 views. What? Yo, look at this. DSP is getting like a billion members. What's happening right now? His stream got really weird in the last 20 minutes. Well, more people can't talk. There's no point in scrolling up. <laughs> right? Get there so they do their negative guess. toxic shit. I'm not skipping and ahead. Views, and Why does he have 2,000 views though in real life? To the next thing. They're, what's the next thing we can talk about? What's the next toxic thing? You know, yeah, that's how they are. That's how they like operate. That. And that's sadly the the, the, the the vicious cycle of YouTube. Doom, promotion. 50 more. Team Ico Gamer, 50 members, 50 members, 50 members, 50 members, 150 members. This is such a clown show. People are going to be really annoyed about this. And the way it happened is like, it's not even, I don't know, it's not that entertaining as, as even as, I don't know, it's weird. It's just kind of weird. All at the same time, the same pre stream, the same day. I guess at least it's over. Yeah, he can, he's probably going to say that too. At least we got it over. I'm going to assume that's enough to hit his goal, right? I'm not going to do the fucking we'll ad, man. The toxic video over the math. positive one. So please understand that, and uh, it's so you know, weird. please know that it's like I'm incredibly grateful for fun. all of you. All but right? I guess now we're not let's get doing this out this of the way. Fun. What's going on right now with me this week? All huh. right. And then he's gonna take his day off tomorrow, and then come back Friday and have a hundred members less. So what is he gonna say when he come back with a hundred members less after getting 152 days before that? It's gonna still be fucking awkward, and DSP still gonna neg everybody. What the fuck? Well, I've had multiple days where support was Maybe slow. Emil can come back. I was hoping that it would be the opposite. Emil I was give 100 on Friday. The um the release of Score on Friday. Hopefully dude gifting 150 members yesterday. happened during All a right. pre-stream. That we were going to see an increase. But and in based truth, on we did. me we looking at the clock, viewers. it did not. That's happen. happened. Okay? But there has not so, been a general rip. increase of support. I'm going to have to All watch right? gameplay. And because I've had multiple days that were slow, Monday was very like slow. That shit's a while um, from now. Here's the situation. I'm an hour behind. This week, I had certain things I had to do. I had to raise enough money to pay a big. This whole chat is just people right? getting a I member, have accepting a member. I'm good to go. Holy okay? fuck. I had to raise enough money for my day I, off. Bro, I can't wait to see DSP's reaction. Well, if somebody spoil it, they're getting on out. How expensive my grocery hours. bill is tomorrow, which I don't know what it's going to be. Um, <laughs> Listen to him, too. Listen to this statement. Why are we talking about money bruh, for my bruh. day off tomorrow? Well, depending on how expensive my grocery bill is tomorrow, which I don't know what it's going to be. He says grocery bill in that really, really cringe way. Like he's not going to just go there and pay and buy stuff. I don't know how to word it, but he's saying it like he's getting fucking hello fresh. And then he say he don't know. You get the same stuff every week. How you don't know? Bruh. We, he just needs Snow Carl to give him a dollar fifty and say, "You should budget every day, every week when you get groceries." And then he'll mock him and say, "I do budget, idiot. I budget all the uh, time." Because I haven't made the list yet. I'm actually gonna make the oh, list tomorrow. Oh. There you go. That's why I gotta listen. I gotta listen to the whole thing. So, okay, what's the point of what he just told us? Then it's actually no point. It's literally no point in what he just told us. Utility bill. All right, I have that. I don't know how much this is going to be because I didn't make the list yet. Well, go fuck yourself then. Make the list and come back and ask for money, jackass. I'm good to go. Okay? It made no I sense. I had to raise enough money for my day off tomorrow. Uh, well, depending on how expensive my grocery bill is tomorrow, which I don't know what it's going to be. Because um, I haven't made the list yet. I'm actually going to make the list tomorrow. Um, I may or may not have enough for literally tomorrow. Literally on his off day. At, at the very least. What it is is every week... Yeah, I don't when know I what's going off, on on his channel right now. It's pretty weird. What I like to do is have a certain amount of money We're never gonna in the bank. Out. Don't ask. So I have here's anybody. here's what I have for the day. So now off of that, I can say, what am I gonna go grocery shopping for for the week? Because I can afford. Don't stress your brain. Out. What what pet supplies can we get this week? What this? 
I'll give you a perfect example. I ran out of a few things around the house, and I've refrained from buying them. Because yeah, I don't he's gonna immediately be weird. need them. This is extra Or they're weird. not immediately important. But I need them, but I don't can't get them till I have the money for it. Are you talking about needles, dude? Why are you being this fucking weird? Who's this weird about anything? What is this? every what week, DSP? When I have a day off, I what I like to do again. is have a certain amount of money in the bank. Uh -huh. So I have, here's here's what I have for the day. So now, off of that, I can say, what am I going to go grocery shopping for for the week because I can afford? What what pet supplies can we get this week? What this? I'll give you a perfect example. I ran out of a few things around the house. I ran out of a few things. And I've refrained from buying them. And I've refrained from buying them. Because I don't. So you still don't have them because you ran out and you didn't buy them. Immediately you need take them. A sip. Because I don't immediately need them. Or they're not immediately important. Or they're not immediately important. But I need them. But I need them. But I don't can't get them till I have the money for. But them. I can't get them till I have the money. <sighs> it's some stuff I have that I don't need, but I could get it if I had the money. But I don't have the money, so I don't get it. Why even talk to people if you're going to talk to people like this? He's actually speaking in code. And he's, of course, not going to say what he's, you know, for him. You see? So, uh, there's stuff like that. Okay? And in addition, you know, my wife and I have what's the one point meal out of him talk when on our day like off. That. It's essentially our date, which sucks. We don't even have money. Again, this is the second week in a we, row. Cat is included. Pumpkin patch and do, do fun stuff. And he's including Cat with this weird shit that you know she didn't want to do. Going to a pumpkin patch? was something that only he always talked about and he always made Panda Lee do it. I don't think Cat wants to do somehow the same thing, but what if she do? Maybe hype it up. Fucking pumpkin patch. Up there, I wanted to go to some stores and buy Halloween accessories for my costume. Can't do any of that this week. We're just staying home. Again, second week in a row. Can't Good. afford to do anything. Good, have fun. You know? So we're staying home. Maybe next and, month uh, they can go to the pumpkin patch. We're gonna probably order a meal in. They can go a that's month our, late. That's our date, our they get date the, night. Get the member money. stay home and order food in so we don't have to cook. You know, that's my reality. Um, and then, on top of all of that, which is something extra this week, I have to afford a new game for Friday. And as I discussed yesterday, we determined that it's going to be Gotham Knights. Okay. Yeah, it wasn't so, in a Wii in there. I need not only... He like, actually, like, didn't stream and came back and said, I'm not going to tell you what the game is. And then he drummed it up and told us the game. So it wasn't a Wii. There's enough money to have my day off tomorrow, but then an additional $70 plus Man, tax or whatever it is to buy Gotham Knights for Friday. About this stuff. All right. So I'm not there. I'm just not. I'm not there Imagine right now. Imagine saying um, plus tax. I need to have a good day today. fucking greasy Being asshole. Being transparent with all of you. Plus tax? I need to have a good day today for support. Who are you? I need to basically be hitting my goals for tips. Hey, man, um, how much that game you know, going to cost? I'm playing oh, Storm. It's like it's $70, not gonna be you know, probably, plus tax. But we're going to finish it early. Oh we're going to do like a Q&A segment for the second half to basically finish the week. I hope maybe people would support that even if you don't like score. You know what I'm saying? That's the deal. I need to have a good day, a good supportive day today so that I can have a nice day off tomorrow and afford Gotham Knights on Friday. If I don't, if today is a slow day, I'm not getting Gotham Knights. I just have to wait till I can afford it. And there's nothing I can do about that. That's my reality. You know, I wish it wasn't. I wish I lived in a different world and things were better. It's not. That's where I am right now. You know, this was, this was going to be a week where I was hoping for an increase and I did not see the increase. It was pretty much, you know, some days were great and other days were bad. So it evens out. And then it ends up being just a normal week where I'm barely getting by again, you know? Um... Sorry, I Man, wish things were better. I wish really I could talk about this segment. on stream, but that's just exactly wow. how it is this week. Okay, so if you can support today, how long did it please do. Last? How? Hit me. Or and it took that long. It took that long to say this. Wish things were better, and I wish I didn't have to talk about it this on stream. It took that long. That's just exactly how it is this week. Okay, so if you that can long. support today, to say this, please do. How? Hit me. No. Or it didn't take him that long to say that. So if you can support today, please do. How? Tip me. Or the flip side of that, because some people are so stupid, they're actually thinking, oh, we're going to tip Phil and he's going to go blow the money on something stupid like mobile games or or liquor or something. Oh my game, God, donate some Xbox Live credits. You know, email me, darkside.hotmail.com. Shoot me a code. So what? Like you literally never buy alcohol now? Because uh, unless you buy in, in Ace of Spades or something. You're not going to be spending actually all of your money on alcohol, right? That I can um, enter on Xbox Live so and, and get some money off of the game or whatever. Up, up that that goes directly to it. It can't go anywhere else, right? This if you're so untrusting, because people have spread so many fucking slanderous like rumors and, and, and just conspiracy guy, theories about me all over the internet that are all false, you're and you really don't believe, don't believe me, that's, I mean, you can't spend that on anything else, Okay, move. Come on, Because that would help. All right.
He could not do that next time. You're a fucking degenerate. If you don't trust me and you still want to give me money, it's an Xbox so there you credits. go. All right? What? Um, I'm glad I got it out of the way. As oh, you, you know the deal. That's $8 or more tip, you get the Magic 8 Ball. You can ask it a question. Like, um, when I have uh, other avenues for people to support, besides just sending a fucking tip through PayPal, I don't even think, damn, when somebody send money, uh, money this way, they're going to do it because they don't trust me. But him talking about the Xbox credits and shit is literally him saying, but without saying, yo, if you want to give me some money and you don't trust me, Spider you can send Man. it to me this Spider way. Man. What else What else could you take this as? If you like, oh, Phil's going to get the money and fucking go on a boat to Hawaii. Uh, well, if you're one of those fucking idiots, if you're literally a fucking idiot who believe the other idiots, then give him money through Xbox credits. Anything is appreciated. Anything's appreciated. I don't look a gift horse in the mouth. You don't look his right wife now, in the today, mouth. Right now, today, absolutely, tips is what I need help with. To afford my day off tomorrow and buy Gotham Knights for Friday. Okay? Fair enough? Good? So now sad. we can move on. Not have to talk about this for the rest of today. I know it was yeah, a long segment from the beginning of the it. show, but I just want to get off my lot. chest. Good. I'm glad he at Let's least talk about the schedule. was a lot. From today, the beginning, too. It is the continuation of Plague Tale Requiem. It had a slow... You can skip the schedule, I guess. Have a good day. Relax. Chill. Have a good time. Be safe. If you watch content on my channel, enjoy. Get caught oh, up. Off day thing. We got That's tons weird. of new like the Street Fighter 6 beta. I cannot wait to play more of this game. I hope that there's going to be more betas coming up. Hopefully an open beta. Get to the area where like Scar and the other Lion King characters are. Um, my Ruin says he's already updated his game. And on Xbox Series X, the game runs at a full smooth 60 frames per second. Cool. Whoa. So we're going to see some significant graphical improvements when we play it again on Saturday night. Okay? Um, should be exciting. So... Yeah, I hope you'll be here Saturday. If you like chill streams, that's going to be fun. 200 All right. members. Um, Sunday, again, we're going to be playing Gotham Gamer. Knights or Plague Tale on the first stream. And literally Sunday no one night, else. If you, you know what? Maybe I shouldn't say that. If somebody gifted one in between, they would have went away. So I'll, I'll be nice and say maybe somebody did. But, yeah, it's probably nobody else. You can believe it. We might be having to do a, really, uh, a series finale or season finale of, of Bassmaster. Do you want to know why? Because Bassmaster 2022, which I've been playing since the summer, it's been a downtime thing, Sunday Night Bites, is being removed from Game Pass in November. So we only have like two weeks left to play it before it's gone. That sucks. Why? I really have to ask this question. Why? All day it's going to be a the question. Battery. <clears throat> Dingus, what the, the you know what, Dingus? Don't okay, fucking um, say what that is. Only other real odds and ends before Don't this game is man, I'm excited shit. to talk about I'm not gonna, this morning. No, um, literally don't. Obviously, we are now in the second half of October. We are in a press now. We're gonna get in order to hit this goal. Members. For three days if Yesterday you spoil we got over 500, anything. and then overnight a bunch of members. And I'm not trolling. They laughed. You will be the one trolling. Back down under six, uh, under 500 again. Because I'm literally an hour behind on this dumb video, and all I'm watching is this dumb video. If you want to see, um. So me if you want to really see special event. me be here. Uh, All right, I'm just going to ban this idiot. Don't tell me he got a bunch of view bots and he got anymore. gifted a thousand um, subs. If you want to see a really unique event in November, Dark Side Fills, Black Friday Adpocalypse, where I'm going to be watching a series of retro advertisements Members. from the 80s and 90s of all various different kinds and reacting to them. NDC. Also going to be watching some international you content. You know what so NDC you can compare how those ads are different in other countries. Look it up on... Uh, this will be a really unique event. I've never done anything like it before. I think it would be one of the, the, the website that explain you know, what black doing. people say. I really want to do it. Like, I actually genuinely have a desire to do this. I feel like this would be fun and entertaining for me and you. All right. But I need to have support with members. And right now, okay, we don't need to see him do this, I guess, huh? And I was no. hoping again this week. He's going to do this. Content. We can listen Maybe to this. He won't do it tomorrow, at least, right? And either give memberships or, or renew, renew their one memberships. One fucking member person. These people are boring as hell. Maybe 20. And then all of a sudden, other memberships lapsed. And we're back to square one. Uh, um, we're running out of time. And then next this month, point. he's going to lose I know for a fact on the same that in late September, then what? someone did a big member bomb again. at the end of the month to hit no. the goal so we can do all the Halloween events. <clears throat> oh. Okay. So if we don't hit, uh, the, here it is. Emil says it was September Thanks, 23rd. Emil. So, yeah, what's going to happen is Emil come, even come October 23rd, Emil talk to say this. Um, we're going to lose this a ton of members. Weird. So, yeah, uh, it's, really it's not good. Place. I was really hoping. Um, <clears throat> I was really hoping. What is this? I truly did think he wasn't going to hit this goal. But I mean... I don't know who this is. Just get rid of this. One idiot. person okay. given 200 <laughs> members is basically um, so, unthinkable. What was I going to say? 
Um, so there you go. Now I've got the real bad. I thought trolls. this dude was a we're small uh, streamer. I'm keep banning them the more I see them. Um, <laughs> Something he tried to say when he's coping. Yeah, we're gonna have a member bomb expire. Yeah, because it was emails member bomb. Um, so we're gonna. Yeah, need I, I guess. I guess it was emails member to, bomb. Yeah, I'm just Good job, dude. What was I gonna say? Um, now I've got the real bad. A bunch of trolls. <laughs> we're fucking being stupid in the chat. I'm just gonna keep banning them the more I see them. Um, why well, even have this? this yeah, we're gonna have a member bomb expire. Yeah, because it was emails member bomb. I guess it was. Um, so we're gonna need some traction and some support if we're going to hit uh the goals for the month so if you've been waiting to become a member it'd be a great time to do it right now if you you know your yeah, membership nobody lapsed, did. great time to renew it no nope. looking to support somebody this just channel, gifted 200 right? once literally one you know, give some memberships the now would be the time get. before all of those uh his whole stream gonna be that notification i guess you know it's gonna uh, be like when touch showed now up. i'm distracted what are you guys talking about Dude. <laughs> these people are distracted the shit out of me on the podcast, podcast today yeah, we're i got a million something. things Nobody can even read those messages, and it's really, Keep really hard like to I go said, back and read them if you want to. Before we get to game news, because I'll mention it a couple times, right now, I do need support with tips. He's looking We're down not at only my day off tomorrow, but to afford Gotham Knights on Friday. If you were going to support the stream today... I thought the tip segment was over with, and he was going to talk about gaming and news. He literally talked about the schedule because the tip begging segment was over, and I'll look at him and look at what he was doing. So he promoted himself. So, okay, okay, okay. He asked for money. Like, straight up, he's asking for money. And then, he's like, all right, you guys. Now that that's over, I got that out of the way. Let's fucking ask for money. Now that I got that out of the way, you guys. All right, all right. Let's ask for money. We'll see, okay? I guess um, we'll see. So there you go. Uh, aside of that, that's really the housekeeping stuff, like I said. As before we hit to game news, because I'll, I'll mention it a couple times. Right now, I do need support with tips for my, not only my day off tomorrow, but to afford Gotham Knights on Friday. If you were going to support the stream today, the obvious preferred method of contribution would be a tip. That would help a ton right now, okay? Game news. Let's do it. So, the good news is the Silent Hill stuff. I'm trying to remember if I had another story I wanted to talk about. Hold on. I, I might actually I just skip the Silent Hill thing. The Silent Hill stuff is great, and I can't wait to talk about it. Oh! You're a oh my bitch. god, we do have more to talk it's about. It's him oh. fun police in so it, too. We have to, sadly, we have to have a follow-up. It's making right, it way, to way To the story about Bayonetta 3. <laughs> this sucks that we have to... <laughs> so is he gonna just tell us the lady's a liar? Do this. Does it suck? Now, Does it suck because he's stuck up for this stupid fucking person? He's stuck up for a liar? It's like him. Now oh, entered shit. the realm of drama consequences of Bayonetta and Bayonetta 3 is because she was offered only $4,000 as a flat rate by Platinum Games. Even Don't worry, I'm not going to skip this part. Wrote her you know directly what? and said that's all that they're offering her to be... We're going to do a poll, an interaction poll. It might be somebody that don't want to sit and listen to him poorly explain Silent Hill spoilers and then get excited because, I mean, come on, there are going to be new games and new stuff DSP can talk about on the stream every day. Hey, look, other people ended up gifting members. See, I can't talk down on them too much. Some dude gifted 10. Whoa. Uh, yeah, we're going to do uh, a lane poll. Skip the Silent Hill thing. Or nah. Sorry, you guys, I'm typing with one hand. Because uh, I'm holding a microphone. That's a lot for a uh, fake low for additional vote. Skip Silent Hill thing, yes or no? I'm picking yeah. The voice actress, she felt her work was more worth more than that because she had worked with this character. Because all in all, it's gonna be him taking the fun away from it. If you give a fuck about this, why the fuck would you? Why the fuck would you fucking fucking? If you give a fuck about this, why would you listen to DSP actually spoil <laughs> it? Doctor Jones with his. With his own words. And then he got even less than what you're going to get if you watch the event for real. Like, we've heard DSP talk about E3 after we watched E3. He's going to talk about something based on spoilers and, like, somebody else talking about it or something. So, no. N no. The course of two games, and in her mind, she had kind of created a lot about the character with the way that she I don't know what's always going acted on with the DSP character and represented the character, she had inventions and the like. And felt that this was insanely like underpaid. I say, don't think about it too much because we're literally, literally never gonna figure out. And so she was making this video to basically say, but "What if we did?" I think you should boycott the game. I think this is messed this up that the industry is treating people like do. this. And you know, I'm in a situation where financially, you know, I'm, 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 you know, hard up. 
I don't even have any money for a car. So if they try to sue me for violating the NDA, there's really nothing they can do. I have nothing they can take from me. But this is a situation where I was You're counting on degenerate. being treated fairly. And this would have helped me in my life. And now I don't, I don't get it because I wasn't going to take $4,000. It's disgrace. It's disrespectful. I couldn't believe they offered me so little. Uh, boycott the game. So, of course, everyone believes her. Um, it's like but then I yesterday, by, by Bloomberg breaks a story like, claiming oh, they shit. have completely Damn. contradictory information. Is that, that how they DSP actually feel? have Does seen he, did he, did he check his view count? written offers that was offered to Ms. Taylor where it was going to be a minimum of did four say, voice acting sessions. Views. What's a minimum, going on? Four. And each one. we got to get the gameplay. Okay. Each one was going to be. Landscapers are outside. Um, at least three to four thousand dollars. So she's claiming, okay, she's literally claiming. <laughs> you want to showcase gameplay? I was offered a flat rate of a one-time <laughs> fee of four thousand for the entirety of the game, uh, but apparently there is concrete. Think about it. People showed up to. Okay. Whoa. Think about this. What if we live in the reality where DSP cur like correctly clickbait it in silent hill news got all of the views <laughs> so people showed up because they wanted silent hill to get spoiled they wanted the news to get spoiled they're like fuck yeah i don't know who the fuck this dude is level one podcast let's fucking go i'm in and then when he started the gameplay they're gonna say wait a minute i was just here for silent hill news and they're gonna leave that's what happened that's it dsp had i had no fucking idea this dude got the Silent Hill community on lock the whole time. He played all the games he told us, except the really rare one. Holy fuck. Evidence according to Bloomberg. Look at his chat right now. I'm watching it, what, an hour behind? But uh, they're having a lot of fun. That she was offered Always at the minimum $12,000. But I mean, shit, if you get 200 plus gifted subs, there's going to be people posting your emotes there at that point. They're trying to get excited. If not even more, depending on each, you know, voice acting session, how long they ran, the and then they might have buckets. additional ones on top of the four. All right? Now, of course, you could still argue maybe even that's not enough. I don't know. <clears throat> I'm not a voice actor. I don't know what, what a competitive Everyone rate would be considered vote. for voice just acting in 2022. All right? I can tell you, $4,000 for a whole game is just not enough. That I can tell you concretely. That's ridiculous. There's, pe I'm not even kidding you. There's people who, Bruh, this dude is going over and over and over and over again on a number that was made up by this person. Like it was made up. This is like, I don't know, man. It's like if Amaranth was to say that some game dev offered fifty dollars and a free game key, and then it came out that she lied, and then everybody that talked about it and was on her side when she was lying was to say, well, yeah, but if you offered that, it's still low. Yeah. I, I guess, if you say so, but that didn't even happen. So who fucking cares? Just fucking move on. Can you talk about the factual part of the story, sir? Or you don't even want to talk about the factual part of the story because he fucking, like, supported this bullshit and this actual lying person. For what? Actually, for what? For no monster fucking reason. There was no reason. Uh, fucking putting out one video to advertise like League stream. of Legends on the internet right now yeah, that are like getting no paid more than $4,000 to make to the video. I'm not here to be that And guy. this woman was going to get paid $4,000 to voice act an entire game. That's insanity. Yeah, but that didn't okay? happen with her, though. But she lied. If so why are you even talking about this? Bloomberg has truthful information, which they're claiming they... This is so mean. The first time he talked about this... The first time we talked about this, when he was on the lady's side and he was believing it because it was negative and drama too. And it made the gaming company look bad that he don't want to buy the game of. He don't want to buy Bayonetta 3. When he first talked about it, he said Bloomberg. Because I remember I was like, Bloomberg? And he didn't say what he's saying now. Listen to how he worded it now. If Bloomberg if has truthful information if they have truthful information he didn't say that when he first talked about this story but at the same time when the story first came out bloomberg reported it the first time so they were wrong i guess but not really because somebody lied to them if they have truthful information which they're claiming they do this, this is totally now throwing a monkey wrench into the situation is miss taylor lying 
if she's lying, monkey wrench. why did she lying. lie? Because she wasn't going to get the voice acting job. She, she already to turned it down. The game. She didn't have a job right? for her anymore. She wasn't going to get any money out this? of Platinum Games for, for what violating else? the NBA what else is, making what this else video. Could this be? It really it seemed like she had nothing to old. lose, and she was genuinely trying to get news out about how the industry is working and that it was really no, bad the way that it works. She lied. Mistreated, she didn't you know? get mistreated. Um, she lied. If she I got have no idea the truth about it. what she was after if she's lying. If like, she lying. Seriously, I just... Okay. There was absolutely we got to wait more. nothing to, we gotta get to a lie full about the follow situation. Up to know it. We need the fucking you know? lie detector test. So I just kind of scratched my uh, head. Like, I don't get it. If it, if what Bloomberg <laughs> is saying is true, Bloomberg. All right. Um, we need a lot of tech that's not Bloomberg. You let us down. Too I don't many get times. it at all. I'm insanely confused. Damn, he's doing a really good job of telling us this story. At a story. loss. Maybe. I fucking went back was by accident. No. I do. No. I ruined the whole video. I mean that the guy who voiced Buzz Lightyear in the new Buzz hey, to now be going to conventions the same and sign out one video to advertise League of Legends. What? Do I have nothing they can take from me? You know, we're, we're about to be hitting non-stop new releases. We're playing some now. Um, what did I skip and to? is Miss Taylor lying. Okay, no, miss. you don't own the rights to Bayonetta. You are the voice of Bayonetta. Yes, to some extent, you've created that character creatively. That what is true. What about the Japanese voice actor, But when actor, you say something way. like that, you got to be like, wait a minute. They're that irrelevant. doesn't really make much sense. You, you're not owning Bayonetta, you know? it's This is this reminds me of the situation with David Hayter, where he had always been the voice of Snake in every version of uh, Metal Gear Solid. And then all of a sudden it was announced they were going to have Keith, Keith or... See, arguably, that's more important. And I don't care if you argue, and I'm not going to tell you that you can argue, because that's worthless to tell you that you can do that. But we all know, don't everybody call Metal Gear Solid games a fucking movie? Who called Bayonetta a movie? Who say Bayonetta cutscenes are too long? Who say characters talk too much in Bayonetta? Factually, nobody? Huh? What? MGS4, the last cutscene is what? Oh, man. I had a tweet in my, uh, it might be in my history, because I'm not looking at David Hayter tweets. Uh, it, it, oh, my God. Okay. This is actually literally the perfect thing to look at. Big ups. The Will Helm stream. I know you like that. You want to Welcome try to a that. weird stream. Like a the SP's having a very weird day, but it's technically a very good day. He got a bunch of likes now after he specifically asked for them. Uh, he got almost 3,000 views. He had like 200 likes, not even that long ago. And now we got 800. So there you go. We really got to actually ask for him. He got uh, 200 something gifted members pretty much at one time. So he hit his goal. I'm in the past, so I didn't see him hit his goal yet. So technically, he's having a great pre-off day. 50 more? No, this got to be old. Something like popped up wrong. <laughs> that dude's done. 200 at one time. So he's trying to compare the Bayonetta lady, voice acting, to fucking David Hayter doing Solid Snake. Now, we got Metal Gear Solid 1, which is bigger than whatever Bayonetta could fucking pretend to be as a series. Then we got Metal Gear Solid 2, and I can say the same thing about each individual game. And then we got three. And then you got, I don't know if he voice acted other games that was Metal whatever related. And then you got Metal Gear Solid 4. And then he was done voice acting for him. But anyway, this tweet from David Hayter. Metal Gear Solid 4 holds the Guinness World Record for a longest cutscene in a video game at 71 minutes. Y'all think the Bayonetta lady talking that much? To be even halfway fucking compared to David Hayter. I can't even call it a Bayonetta lady anymore. The voice actor of Bayonetta from Bayonetta 1 and 2. Get the fuck out of here, man. Don't even talk about Kiefer, that. I can't say his name. Yeah, Kiefer you can't Spirit. say his name. You gotta be like, wait a minute. That doesn't really make much sense. I don't want to sense. say his name You're either. not owning Bayonetta, you know? It's This, is, this reminds me of the situation with David Hayter. And uh, another point I was trying to make. Like, I'm not, I don't know. I don't think I'm that cringe when it comes to games or caring about games a whole lot. I definitely, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a doomer when it comes to games. 
But when MGS5 was coming out and it wasn't going to be David Hayter, I didn't hear anybody else talk about it, hear anybody else's opinion or read anybody else's opinion. I just read literally that fact that he wasn't going to be the voice actor. And I was disappointed. And I was like, this isn't even the same dude. It's not the same dude. It's just not the same dude. And I stuck with that opinion. It's just some guy. It's some guy playing Solid Snake. But it's not the real Solid Snake being portrayed on the screen. I didn't even notice the Bayonetta voice is different. Like, I don't have a thousand hours playing Bayonetta 1 and Bayonetta 2. But when the Bayonetta 3 trailer was first coming out, and when any of them came out, I didn't even notice the voice was different. And I noticed David Hayter was fucking not David Hayter anymore. I noticed he wasn't the guy anymore. I don't know, man. I'm hating on that lady. She ain't as important. Hater? Don't bring Where he had always don't been the voice of Snake in every version of Just don't. Don't uh, do Metal Gear Solid. And he can't and bring anybody else up because it's nobody. It's nobody else. Because he don't have anybody else to name. He should have brought up the voice actor for the original Chie. I don't know who it is. But he should have looked up her name. And then had a Chie voice discussion. All of a sudden it was announced they were going to have Keith, Keith, or, Keith or, I can't say his name. Kiefer Sutherland be his voice in Metal Gear Solid. Imagine being a base Fire Emblem fan. And the voice actors change all the time, literally in between games. They all have the same Five, voice. And everyone was like, they oh shit, like well, what happened to, to David Hayter? Well, David Hayter was obviously very upset that he didn't get to voice Snake. But he didn't then shit all over Kiefer Sutherland and everybody else involved with the project and say, oh, that's not Snake. It's the, you know, Tim Allen had voiced Buzz Lightyear in every single Toy Story movie. He did not voice... Buzz Lightyear in the Buzz Lightyear movie. And when asked about it... I mean... Y'all think it's kind of a fair comparison? I don't know. It's not to me. I don't give a fuck about the voice of Buzz Lightyear. And Buzz Lightyear, over the course of all of the movies, don't talk as much as Solid Snake do. In one game. And Bayonetta don't talk as much in, as Solid Snake do in one game. In both of those games. And Bayonetta ain't been around for like 30 fucking years or whatever the hell. And Buzz Lightyear don't have 15 hour games where he talk for five hours long or whatever the fuck. Buzz Lightyear is saying to infinity and beyond and he's saying thank you Woody. And he say that like five times. Like I'm putting everybody down. I hope you bring up more names. You need to bring up somebody good and or somebody I don't know. He basically said, but I can't listen. Shit on him. I don't think that's really the, the real Buzz Lightyear because the real Buzz Lightyear is a toy who's a character in now, the original to toy. be fair, if I listen to the new... Uh, if I fucking watched the Toy Story movie still... Sorry, you guys. I didn't watch the last Toy Story movie. If I watched the last Toy Story, toy Story movie, I probably would notice the difference and say, whoa, this dude don't sound like Buzz Lightyear. But guess what? Sadly, I'm not watching Toy Story movies. What a fucking L for me, right? Story series. Y'all think DSP like even completely... watch him? You know what? A different know. spinoff, which is fine. And, and I don't mind not watching the characters. I'm not watching it Toy Story like... movies. And uh, no, it's more than that too, huh? It's another thing. It's a Buzz Lightyear specific movie. I ain't watching that either. Sorry, I didn't watch that either. Fuck. I didn't watch Toy Story 3. And didn't that come out a long time ago? I'm pretty sure they made 4. And if they didn't make 4, then big ups to Toy Story 4 coming soon. Like it's the same Buzz Lightyear to me, right? Right. That doesn't mean that the guy who voiced Buzz Lightyear in the new Buzz Lightyear movie can't go to a convention and sign autographs that says he was Buzz Lightyear. You see what I'm saying? Like, there's different ways to go about this. And what a lot of people are now seeing, if they're looking at the situation and if Bloomberg is to be trusted, which, I mean, can you 100% trust him? I don't know. You know, you would think... Dude, you could, this you is mean him. and lame and toxic and trash as fuck. Because when he first talked about this story, he told us that Bloomberg reported it. He said nothing else. He put no seasoning on that statement. He just said that it was Bloomberg. And now we treating Bloomberg like the enemy. We hate Bloomberg now? A new source like- Fucking find a different source then, dude. Find somebody else that covered their fucking story. Just literally do that. Because it's all the same people copying everybody's shit anyway. Like technically DSP's reporting on this based on Bloomberg's report. So if I talk about it, I got to tell you that DSP told me that Bloomberg told me him or do I end it? Like, when do I cut it off?
like that. Maybe not. I don't know. But if this is true, three, four, then five, three, seven, four, this seems to me like this is a situation and a loof one. where this is just like really sour grapes. You know what I'm saying? Like really, really sour grapes. This is the um, statement where she's I'm making so upset today. about how the industry treated her and that she can't be paying that right? anymore. And by the way, apparently no one else is offering so her voice jobs. So I can just kind of hang out and chill. She wouldn't be I broke. I feel like I'm doing stand-up comedy, right? So obviously she's so upset. That she treated her and that Pretty she good can't statement be from DSP. anymore. And by the way, apparently no one else is offering her voice jobs because she said she's broke. You wouldn't be broke if you had she work, right? Be broke if she had work, right? Work. So obviously she's her voice jobs because she said she's broke. She wouldn't be broke if she had work, right? So obviously she's so upset about not having uh, a job anymore in the voice acting industry that she just wanted to like destroy everything around her, you know, kind of like 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 uh, like the Joker almost in fucking Batman. Oh, I don't. Yeah, I just want to tear everything down around me. You know, there's not even a purpose behind it. I'm just. Yeah, he didn't need to compare you know, it to know. a movie character. Is she the Joker? We definitely don't what need do to compare this to a movie character. Is, is Real Hel life people is like Helena the way Taylor this lady the Joker all the time. That's the and question. I don't know how we got the there. <laughs> if <laughs> if Bloomberg can be trusted, why the fuck do they exist if they can't be trusted at all? I don't know. This dude still act like TMZ lie. Yeah, I'm pretty sure is. they don't. I remember when he used to. There we go. That's all you wanted to hear. All right, so our story is over. Y'all yeah, remember when you okay. when TMZ used to um, like actually? The second story. This is I'm kind of. I'm pretty sure they don't anymore. Like the dark Nether ages. Realm has announced. Get this, a new Mortal Kombat game. Hell. Wow, new Mortal Kombat incoming. This is excellent. This is very exciting. Yeah, it's a mobile game. Oh no! No! <laughs> yeah, they announced it and everyone went crazy on Twitter. They're like, oh, new Mortal Kombat game. But what if I like mobile games though? And you've spent a lot of money on mobile games, DSP. Why are you pretending to not like this? To fucking fit in? Hello, fellow children. You hate mobile games just like me, right? This dude fucking sucks, man. Did they read the he actively used to play a Mortal Kombat mobile game, but that was years ago. I mean,. It's probably going to be the same type of gameplay. I'm not looking that up either. He's not going to just, like, technically advertise shit to me without advertising it to me. I'm not going to look up a mobile game because of him. Fine print mobile I game. Oh! Oh! oh. <laughs> <laughs> so, Help. the reason that this is newsworthy. This is almost like if Dingus was watching. Not even watching, because DSP can't give us that level of entertainment. We got to pay to get him to watch a fucking video. Like, actually pay. It's like if Dingus was talking about games, right? Which he never does, obviously. And he was saying, you guys, I saw a trailer and they showed gameplay. And it was like, the next Grand Theft Auto was here. Whoa. And the whole time, everyone was like on the edge of their seat. What system will it come out on? And then it said, Nintendo Switch. <laughs> Bro, oh no, the Nintendo Switch. Oh my God, it sucks, dude. That's like kind of what dsp doing but it's not even it's not even a lick of sarcasm but i guess technically because you spend a bunch of money on mobile games don't mean you like them and because you play them don't mean you like them but do game devs make games for people who like games we didn't we don't know you think netherrealm making games for people that like games you think they want to maybe I don't know. People that like games might not give you enough money or something. People that like games probably don't play mobile games. I don't know, man. It's a lot of things I can ask and a lot of things I can say. Mortal Kombat has had mobile games before. I've actually played a few oh, there you go. See, years back when you told us. Mortal Kombat I didn't have to say 9 it. or 10 launched. It was 10. They actually had a tie-in mobile it. game. But it was you shitty. It. Oh, it, it was, was shitty. Just, you, know, you tap this. Okay, so if it was shitty, why did he brag on fucking Instagram about what he had in the game? If the game was shitty... Why did DSP post on Instagram screenshots of the game to show what fucking characters he had? If it was shitty, why did he talk about it on his free stream? He talked about this Mortal Kombat mobile game on his stream. He wanted to record footage of it. Why was, how was it shitty? He spent money on it. It was shitty. Just like I said, uh, because you spend money on mobile games don't mean you like them, dude screen and the guy goes huh, huh, huh. press a button he throws the fucking spear you know all it's, of the game crappy play. you know it's not meant to be anything that you invest a lot of time in it's a really neat throws the, he's checking throws the you, data. Know, you tap the screen and the guy goes huh, huh, huh. press a button he throws the fucking spear it's it's crappy you know it's not meant Take to be anything that you invest a lot of time in. it's a really time waster game um 
nothing exciting or anything. You know, mess with it for a few hours. Like, okay, I see what it is. You'll never play it again. Um, but in this case, this one is actually going to be a full-fledged RPG. It's called Mortal Kombat. Mortal Kombat. That's what they're calling it. Mortal Kombat. So people are up in arms that they put the L in there. No. Mortal Kombat Onslaught. It's set to launch next year. They're, they're touting it's going to be a full cinematic experience. Okay? Okay. So he's going to repeat, like, vague lies from game devs that we don't even personally know, and we never see them talk. And they probably didn't talk about this game either. Maybe it was a fucking screen that had text on it. I don't even know, man. But did you like when he uh, had to point out that he messed up how he said a word? If he did that every time he messed up a word, every pre-stream would be two hours long. No, three hours long, because they already uh, like an hour and a half. Every level one podcast would be three hours long. If every time he said a word wrong, he went out of his way to like say that he said it wrong. Say, see, said it wrong. Like wrong. Like uh, donkey. Like donkey wrong. I said it wrong. Right. Ha 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 ha. Like some shit like that. Every time. That's interesting. That's interesting. That's very interesting. No, it's not interesting, dude. Why are you advertising the mobile game though? Did you get paid? Silent how much Hill. you get? How much you get paid to advertise this? Advertise. See, I did it again. That's because I just thought about it. How much you get paid to advertise this mobile game, DSV? The fuck is this? Meaning it's going to look a lot similar to, say, recent Resident Evil outings like this. Actually, oh, God, he's talking though, about Silent it's a, Hill. It's a remake. remake. So, well, it's a remake. We're skipping all of that. I don't want to hear him talk about Silent Hill. Just watch the thing when it happened tonight, man. If you care about the games, you're going to watch the stupid stuff tonight. Why would you watch DSP actually spoil the game? Not even the game. Spoil what a game's going to be. We don't even know what a release date. You're just going to, like, extract fun. Hold That's on what here. he's here for. We oh. all have jobs in life. I'm going to be so mad. You know when I was younger, I had a bad hairline. Like, I ain't going to check, no. though. And I'm not yeah, denying it. I'm not stupid. Um, I'm getting some fun stuff. So we bit. have someone named Bo Jangles who tipped me $3 and insults me again, saying, how are you broke? He's not going to talk about them chargebacks, though. When you get support. How are you Because the money goes to support. bills, it goes to back question. taxes, it goes to current taxes, it goes to everything, you know. DSPU, it bro. It goes to important stuff. It I goes didn't to know personal that. stuff. Uh, you know, like, you know, I hate to say it, med some medical stuff, you know. It goes to you things that are none of your it. business um, at all. But you guys well, tend to, like, then, like someone like you tends to try to Maybe pry into my personal it. life. It might be common um, sense that the money you get try goes to get, towards you know, information everything? out of me that you're not going to get um, about my personal shit. And then when I okay, won't give it, going people extra. just make shit up He's instead. basically giving a dude So, you know, what instead want, of me sitting here and saying, okay, guys, so here's the truth. Like he's not, Behind the scenes, I got I this going on, I got that going segments, on. So people like, like, oh, I didn't know all that personal shit about Phil. Yeah, because you don't need to know it. It's not your business to know that stuff. You know what I'm saying? So then what happens? Yeah, oh, well, since Phil won't tell us it's absolutely everything about his life, too. now we're just going to sit here and speculate and make up conspiracy and it's always theories the same and literally way. slander him and make up shit, you know. And, and it's all nonsense, but I'm not going to sit here and, and debunk every dumb fucking thing that he someone says every day. should talk this much to the person that gifted um, him 200 so members. Then start I wonder how much he talked nonsense, about that they gifted you know? him members. He probably just like, fucking okay, talked about what he's going to so do week, for it. So this week, where did my money go? And Gee, let's see. Yeah, he never does that, um, right? Earlier on the week, never I paid a bill. what he's going to do for members. He paid a bill. Okay, actually, last week, last, so last week, week, I had my day out. What about earlier this week? It wasn't a day out because we didn't have a lot of money. Last so week. it was groceries. It's not a day supplies, out because they don't have money. A few things I had to buy that we had run out around the house oh, that I had to get when I was out. This segment is so torture. And then one, we ordered an amino. It's also pignosis. Oh, my God. Leaving the nonsense. You know? I gotta hit the beginning again. Like, okay, so this week, where did my money? This week, where did my money go? Money go. Gee, let's see. Let's see. Um, earlier on the week, I paid. This week, where did my money go? Okay, let's see. Earlier on in the week, I paid a bill. Dot a bill. dot dot. Okay, actually, last week. Okay, last week. I had a day off from work, but I wasn't really off because I didn't get to do anything fun, and I did errands. Uh, so what? last week, I had my day out with my wife, but it wasn't a day out because we didn't have a lot of money. So it was groceries, pet supplies. I had a few things I had to buy that we had run out around the house that I had to get when I was out. Um, and then one, we ordered an amino. Dude, he could have ran out of gin. What the fuck? This could mean, a, this could mean anything.
And you like his uh, arm position? He's actually got hands-on hips right now. Actual hands-on hips. Bruh. Meal. I told you about the meal, right? Think I did? The brunch that we had it was really good. Um, Damn, and then I bought my Halloween costume. So awkward. And I bought one Such other thing online for the house that we had run out of. Him saying, then I had a meal. I told you about the meal, right? Like, like, like he's checking in with this dude. This dude that gave him $3. And he's named Bo Jangles, and he basically pointed him out as a troll. That's who DSP is talking to right now. He's talking to a troll that like, gave him three dollars named Bo Jangles. to the bill paid earlier this week. Last week, here's to the day off this week, and to the bill paid earlier this week. No, here's for the day off this week, and to the bill paid earlier this week. Last week, goddamn, big ups, D Trash man. Thanks for the seventy bits. Okay. And the muscle. Then over the course of this week, where did my money go? Well. You know, any bills that so came up. So now we back to earlier this week in reality of him telling the story. Which there was one. Um, and I was saving all week to pay another utility bill that's actually due tomorrow. And then all the other money was saved up for my day off tomorrow and to buy Gotham Knights. And it happens that because uh, there was two slow days this week. Hey, what about them charges I didn't, have, I didn't make enough this week, pimp. You know what I'm saying? Um, Did they go away somehow? Even though specifically when he had the chargeback discussion, I feel like that was like Sunday or something. Whatever day it was, it was less than seven days ago, right? Specifically when he had that chargeback discussion, he was letting us know how it wasn't going to go away overnight, how it was going to be a thing for a long time, and it was going to stay a nuisance on his account for a long time. So why he only talked about it that one day and never brought it up again? That don't make a lot of sense. Man, this sucks because it's going to affect me long time, man. Long term, it's going to affect me every day, every day for the rest of my life. And you just don't talk about it. And like 20 years later, he's still around. What can you do? What can you right? do, man? Um. <laughs> this, this is the dude that during that chargeback discussion went out of his way to tell us he wasn't making it up. He the one that went out of his way to tell us he wasn't making it up. Nobody else was even going out of their way to say he was making it up. And he was the one. Man, this dude so fucking sus. Uh, it's a lot to accuse someone of lying about chargebacks because you're basically accusing them of lying about their fans not giving real support. But goddamn, bro. It's just like, I, you know, I don't know what else to say. Um, that's the truth. BSP. It's There's no conspiracy here. Oh yeah, there's no conspiracy, right? by the way. I'm I have sorry. a lot of debt, sorry for sadly. Giving, sorry, sorry if I put a conspiracy in your head. I don't want to do what DSP do when he just say shit and then don't try to make a statement. So I do, I do think he made up those chargebacks that day. But it's really fucking toxic for a streamer to make up chargebacks, though. But only DSP would be that level of specifically lame and toxic. So that's how life works. Even though I, I declared bankruptcy two years ago, I still have a giant mortgage. I still have condo dues every month. I, mean, I, mean, I other still have a car payment. I this still... dude lied about having a fucking pit cat that he tried to compare to having a real life son, a real life human son. Like, would you lie about having a kid? You know what? He probably would. And then he would say he did it to protect his family, which is what he said when he lied about having a cat. It's the same dude that talked to a journalist and lied about what the journalist said. And only, he didn't even really come out and say I lied about what he said. But we only got the truth about what the journalist said because he locally recorded the conversation. Like, he just straight up recorded it when he was talking to DSP. That's how fucking sus DSP was. When a random journalist had a discussion with him, he thought to himself, I should record this. That's how fucking sus DSP is. So why the fuck should anybody believe him about anything? This dude would lie about what his mama said on a deathbed. And then if he don't, we still would accuse him of lying. Because he's so... He's awful. I have health insurance, I still have homeowner's insurance, car insurance, I still have taxes, back taxes, because yeah, one of the major things that's really hurt me is that even though you do, like I went through a bankruptcy, it didn't just wipe away all the taxes that I owed and didn't pay, because I couldn't afford them. So I have years of back taxes that are accumulated, and they don't just go away, they keep accumulating interest and shit, and I have a back tax plan that plan that I'm pay paying, just go away, they keep accumulating interest and shit, and I have a back tax plan that plan that I'm pay paying, but then what happens is every time something goes wrong financially, like <clears throat> I told you with the copyright strikes that hit me two months ago, and I lost, no exaggeration, about a thousand dollars of revenue here on DSP Gaming that month, actually, like <clears throat> I told you. 
with the copyright strikes that hit me two months ago. I heard him say lost And I lost, no exaggeration, about $1,000 of revenue here on DSP Gaming that Why is he even bringing this up, dude? Like, realistically, even if this happened, in the way he say it happened, we got to move on, bro. You're talking about money that you would have spent by now anyway, and you got money from people because you talked about that money that you didn't get. Like, Jesus Christ. You know? You know what I'm saying? When that happened, uh, guess what happens? I, I, I'm $1,000 less, so what do I use to pay stuff? So, okay, he got 200 gifted members today. Can he not talk about this ever again? When he didn't get members because of the copyright strikes? Like, this, what amount of members gifted equals out the complaining about not getting members for that month? Eventually, he got to not complain about it anymore. But he's DSP, so he still complains about it. Right? Right. So because of that, now what happens? Things get paid less. And when things get paid less, you owe more in the long run. Again, this is I want to point out, he's having this discussion with a $3 troll who he called basically like stupid. And the name life. is Bojangles. I ain't taught you what you know. Bojangles. Bojangles, a $3 troll. He's talking to this dude this whole time. It's an endless cycle with me. You know, I can't do much about it. With my income fluctuating, one month is great, and the next month it's way low, and I don't control that. You know, I don't. There's nothing I can do about that. Um, that's kind of the, the the nature of being a content creator like me. I don't have sponsorships. I don't have partnerships. I don't shill products. I don't. You know what I mean? I don't have those opportunities. Is that real and because life of that, drive? every month it no, goes like this not. with I'm my saying. income. It's too and shaky and weird. I can't control that. So one month is things are good. But then it just, I have to try to play catch up with the stuff I didn't do the last few months. And then I have a slow month and now everything's slow again and I can't do anything and now I'm back to square one. So that's what it is. You know, and again, I'm not telling you everything. I'm not going to sit here and be like, oh yeah, so I have a medical bill this month. Oh yeah, so this came up this month behind the scenes. And I don't tell you everything. Right now, I've got a dishwasher sitting downstairs broken. I can't. Use I don't tell you everything, but I'm going to bring up this thing, thing that, that I brought up, up to, to get, get sympathy. sympathy. To, to get, get sympathy, sympathy again. again. Oh, yeah. Use it. And I actually talked to my parents about it, and they're like, you know. Bruh. It's broken. I can't use it. And I actually talked to my parents about it, and they're like, you know. What, what could they, they say? say? What could they do? Dishwasher repair is expensive. Oh, uh, you get might the end fuck up out. Three, Did you Remember, Remember when, when DSP told us 500 to 1,000? He specifically told us 500 to 1,000? Which, a thousand dollars? Can't you just buy one? You know, you could buy a new dishwasher for four hundred dollars. Now you can buy one for four hundred, and his parents told him that it costs two hundred. Bro, it's like fixing a fucking Toyota. And I was like, no, I actually didn't know that. Like, dude, why, why fix it when you could just buy a new Honda? And they're like, yeah, you can get like a mid-range dishwasher for around four hundred dollars. You may not even want to call a repair person. You might just want to buy a whole new one. Your dishwasher is eight years old. And maybe you just need a new one. And I'm like, well, that's great. But where do I get $400 from? <laughs> right? So right now, I have a broken dishwasher that I can't do anything with. I have a bathroom that last year, all right, started having issues. Remember I told you guys about this, that the, the handle broke in the shower, the master shower. So I go to look at it, and it's not just a handle. This is really weird because, because he just... just we're went out of his way to say he's not going to tell us about stuff and then he's telling us about stuff again he's doing this for a dude they gave him three dollars whose name bojangles and he called him a troll what the fuck but the pipe in the wall is leaking which has caused rusting of the pipe in the wall and so that's a major issue that whole wall needs to be busted out and that pipe his eyes his eyes and his eyebrows and his ears wiggle over and over and over when i looked into it i found out on the other side of the shower the seal under the glass window, you know, the side of the shower, had been worn out and water had been seeping into this crack for years. That water had gone down the side of the shower and destroyed the floorboards in front of the shower, bubbling them up, making the tiles crack. So in order to fix my shower, not only do I have to have the handle replaced, I have to have the whole pipe in the wall replaced, I have to have all the tiles broken out and then rebuilt, then I need to have the whole floor removed in front of the shower and likely repaired or replaced, and then have all new tiling and new sealant done. Uh, so this went from, oh. I was, I was gonna, gonna uh, fastly. fastly.
pick my microphone up and say, I hope DSP isn't actively, like, being openly weird or nervous. Because, fuck, people can give people a lot of members all the time. I'm a small streamer. Extremely small compared to DSP. And I've gotten a lot of gifted subs at one time. And we never had the conversation like, yo, yo, y'all think they fucking gonna charge back? Because that shit is, like, toxic. I'm, I'm not here to tip. It's, it's like toxic. toxic. Here to get shot if, if you gave somebody a lot of money, how, how would you feel? feel? It's just me if they, the person, the person you gave the money to, would be like, yo, y'all think this dude sus? sus? Yeah, I got my bits on me. I ain't but to his view count? count? Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna be a little nervous. I got a sock right now. So maybe he's nervous about that. What? 4,000 views? Yeah, I got my bits on me. I ain't trying to tip right now. I ain't trying to tip right now. And if I'm out being me, I got a sock right now. How many times can Sean and Bill Laden? How many times can Sean and Bill Laden grinch? Sean and using a laptop for something else. Holy shit. He's walling out. He's walling out. And look at the chat. The chat's. Look at the chat. The chat's flying. Yeah, this is the most viewers DSP ever had. In any scenario, any circumstance, any situation type deal. And we're never going to be able to look at it and say, oh, yeah, it was cool. Because it looked kind of cloudy. But look at all the likes. 1.9k likes. DSP's blowing up. I gotta wait till this song ends. I'm gonna give you a feel theory. Let's get it. Yeah, I got my bits on me. I ain't trying to tip right now. I ain't trying to tip right now. And if a mob band me, I got a sock right now. I got a sock right now. Yo, you was leaving on site. If I turn on the stream right now, on a stream. Me and Ed Gang, we ballin'. Y'all free gang right now. Gang, gang, You know what? That's a really good point. I ain't trying to tip right now. Did he blow bubbles? And if a mob band me, I got a sock right now. Yo, you was leaving on site. If I turn on the stream right now. Me and Ed Gang, we ballin'. Y'all free throwin' right now. Did DSP blow bubbles? And if he did, he got to blow bubbles 19 times because he got 1.9k likes. So I think, I guess we're going to skip forward and see a bunch of bubble blowing eventually. 4,500 views. Uh, okay, this is my field theory. DSP got a huge shout out from literally the biggest content creator ever that none of us ever heard of. It's like when Sunny V3 made a video about him, but it's a positive thing. So some dude with like 20 million followers, he made a nice video about DSP, made a YouTube short about him. And he said, guys, go to this guy's channel and give him a like, just give him a like and give him alert. So he's got 5K views. And uh, I think the dude that gifted a member has already gifted a bunch of members before. At this point, they're just like, you know, it's just the lifestyle. Team Ico Gamer. I definitely heard him say that name before. Holy shit. Man, I wish it was interesting to see he like to see him get members in his chat, but it is not. 50, 100, 150, 200, 250, 300, bro. That's like a crying segment on any stream. Maybe, maybe not mine. Maybe. But DSP is like, oh, yeah, thanks, man. <laughs> oh, thanks, man. I can't wait to see his reaction to it. I can't wait. But that's, dude, you give, you give just about anybody that much, and I don't, I don't think they would know how to really respond. This so is I like maybe a couple hundred respond. dollar repair to, oh, this is probably like a $5,000 repair. <laughs> that's what it went to, you know? So am I doing that? No, I don't have that money. I don't have any, any money for that, you know? What can I do? Nothing. I have no control whatsoever over it none you know so that's my life phil how do you make so much money but you have no money because that's life when you're an adult you know that's why that's, you know what kind of cope is that if that's life when you were an adult why wouldn't the dude know that that asked the question aloha i like 
at the end of this, we basically get the confirmation that he's still talking to this dude. A $3 tip from a troll got this long ass discussion. Very matter of fact, that's exactly how it is. Very that's, chill. You deal with stuff. So we don't even use that fucking shower anymore. Just fuck it. We can't. We have, luckily, we have another shower. It's a basic shower. It's a tub, and we have a built in shower with it. And we just use that. We've been using it for a year. Well, where am I going to get money to fix this, right? Like I told you guys, the only way I'm going to get out of this situation is to tough through this situation for several years. Things are going to be tight for a while. There's nothing I can do about that. I can't change that, okay? But if I tough through it for years... You like how he's years, big into somebody right, that trolled him, basically? Back somewhat. <laughs> I could go to a... It's, just, hopefully it's like actually pitiful. Say, Feels hey, bad. I need to refinance my home. I got equity in the house. I couldn't do anything with it for years because I declared bankruptcy. I have a great segment now my credit's when back. he get I'd his like gifted do, members like to refinance too. and use some of this equity to or do at least when I get like to the part on him getting to get the members. All of my back debts that I have problems I can't pay. Immediately pay them all off, right? Then maybe use some of the equity to fix the shit in the house that's all Hello. busted, right? And then not have the daily problems. Welcome to the stream, have, Peter Peck. Right? Not have to worry about all. Oh, I can't actually and symphonics um, afford to and let's get it 1k cat man this name never made me laugh until today whatever is prime big ups tevin can this segment be archived on god damn it by the way we have over god damn 1100 it. viewers on the stream look so it's obvious someone if you, who if you, if you say that and uh, this stream wasn't being so suspiciously weird, I would have just instantly said no. Now I have to say I don't know. I was on another stream, <laughs> told their viewers to come over here. I have absolutely no idea who any of you are. Uh, this stream welcome, sus but absolutely none of you can talk. Because this now, the thing is, it's nothing to really archive on my end. Like, I'm watching him an hour behind and we don't even have his chat. You gotta go watch, like, raw, raw DSP. And you can see his whole chat throughout this bullshit. Cause they were having so much fun and everybody was literally talking It's the most his chat has ever moved even like right now when it's not moving that fast is he on break okay it's not on break channel is sub only for a good he reason. literally can't go on break um Dude, he got if it wasn't sub only people would come over here and troll <laughs> they do uh they come over here. okay so this is when it started shit, you know <laughs> how much he had 1100 by the way we have over 1100 viewers on the stream so it's obvious someone who was on another stream told their Imagine thinking Boogie relevant enough to do that. There's no way he said that. You're a first time chatter, so you gotta be a troll. It's if Diaz, that's you know, fucking stupid. Um, afford How did you fix this Steam Deck? You know. <laughs> okay, maybe I should. By the way, we have over 1,100 viewers on the stream. So but you know how you said it was broke? Stream, I thought about it. Literally, when I hit stop stream, uh, I thought about it. But and mine broke the same way. Talk. It was plugged up, and it just stopped working. And it flashed reason. over and over and over. Um, I hooked it up to a different only, computer, same thing. I hooked it up to the wall, do. same thing. Uh, they come over here with and I eventually burned it. I literally burned it. I have absolutely no no idea where you guys are from. Welcome, So I guess. So, big you fix yours. Obviously, someone told someone to come raid. We're at 1,400 viewers. Yeah, that would and be ridiculous. No that, that like DSP, they you know what? That's the sad thing. He's he's not lost. He's not dumb. He's not uncultured. I can never think of the word of for anything or about anything. But he's lost. He's so fucking lost. If he think the Boogie. Look, like if Boogie, if Boogie raided DSP, if Boogie rated. Yeah, gullible. We can go with gullible. This is the same dude that's telling us about emails he get that I'm pretty sure are phishing emails. And he's like, yeah, man, I got a sponsorship offer, but I'm not going to accept it. If he think fucking Boogie is even cool enough, important enough to send DSP like stable 5,000 views, it doesn't even make sense. I don't know, man. I don't know. Maybe Boogie is just like balling and I'm hating on him for no reason. But yeah, if, if Boogie actually rated DSP and we get factual evidence, I'm gifting 20 subs to this channel. And 10 of dingus. Because we know that ain't, it's literally no way. Boogie. Boogie probably ain't even fucking stream today. Can't talk. You're a fucking you degenerate. Boogie. All right. 
We've got uh <laughs> Boogie. Yo, Boogie's literally uploading begging videos because he wasted his money on crypto. One more tip. Should have been buying wheat. This is someone Boogie. who is an anonymous tipper. <laughs> says, ask the eight ball. Will I box Rich from Review Boogie. Tech USA? Well, I already uh, know the answer. All right. Wait, what? Is an anonymous tipper. Says, ask the eight ball. Will I box Rich from Review Tech USA? This is a troll question. He literally times people out for asking this and saying stuff about this. Now it's an $8 question. Well, I already this know the answer. Suck. All right. But I'm going to go ahead He's the wishy-washy uh, one. He's called people wishy-washy. He's <laughs> the fucking wishy-washy one. Where is the guy? MSI DS502 gaming headset. I need to follow him, but I kind of don't want to because he might show up over here. Don't say anything. For under 60 US dollars. But allegedly he's streaming on Twitch now. Again. I rolled my eyes really hard when I said again. So like I he's getting no idea. He just Absolutely hates no us. Absolutely no idea who sent people over here. Welcome to anyone who's over here. We're... See, I didn't even know the stream deck had an operating system. Quote, unquote. 1,700 viewers. So I could have fixed mine that broke then. <laughs> who the hell sent these people over bad. here? Who are you people? The only way you can talk I right wonder now, if this DSP view think. thing going to have a continuation of the story. Not, sub, like tomorrow, will he have 2,000 right? people and his chat going to be lighting up? Because if so, that's going to be unbelievable. No, he's not streaming tomorrow. Oh, it is decided. That's funny. So. Apparently, I am going to box. That's it, funny. Say, according to the Magic Ape. Of course, DSP is right. officially off tomorrow. No, if you're one of these newcomers, now we have 1,900 <laughs> viewers. <laughs> Where are these people coming wow. from? Wow. Where are these people coming from? I have no idea. I don't know what this place is um, supposed to be. And man. no, someone literally just said to me, you should you should run an ad. No, I'm not going to do that. That's fucking Yeah, run some fucking ads. I don't know who, who these viewers are, where they're coming from. It was I'm a really good... I don't know who rated it. I'm not like But that. it was some, like, uh, really popular person it, rated right, Edibot one day. Thank you. And it was, like, actually 300 people asking her to run ads. They showed up saying, okay. we run it. We love ads. Please run an ad, By please. Way, and she got derailed. It short. was like a five minute segment. She had to figure out how to run ads. She had to figure out how to manually run an ad. She ran an ad and they were like, yes, let's fucking go. Ads, let's go. It was a great day. I don't know. Why can't DSP get rated like that? I don't know who this is. Yo, run some ads, pimp. Guys, they don't know how to. Gandhi just did a super chat. Thank you. Um, there you go. What a Brian did another website. $10 tip saying, I'm not insulting you, but no, your hairline really does look like an N64 controller. Well, oh, wow. I didn't hear Thank that. N64 <laughs> controller. Hey, it's funny, at least. Thank you for the tip as well. Um, it should tell you who raid your YouTube channel on your dashboard. You think a month from now he's going to be shitting on the dude that gifted them all the members? Like a touch situation? I just assumed that type of thing would never happen again after it happened the first time. And gifting members on YouTube so is different than sending YouTube. bits on be, uh, Twitch in like a bunch of it ways. It could be a Twitch streamer, right? Who just sent their people And I'm pretty over. sure I heard I him know. say that name before. It's I'm not, assuming not he's an dashboard. honest customer. We're at 20, we're at 2,800 viewers. <laughs> he got Where a are these people construction coming from, company or some shit. Right? 2,800 viewers. Obviously someone told uh, someone to raid me. Somebody else stream. Uh, he should have went to the purple platform. Here. I got a $1.25 tip. From Tickle My Pickle Nipple, who says Epic. hello. Thank you, Tickle My Pickle Nipple. You can't one of the 5K new nipple. viewers tip and not have tickle a dumb fucking nipple. name, maybe? Thanks for the tip. That'd be nice. <laughs> need to We're bring some uh, some new some new vibes in this place. I don't think I've ever had a raid this big ever, right? I like how we can't even, even really a call it a raid. On YouTube Gross. Not once. Have I remember when, bro, remember when he got raided on Twitch? I got a, it's one of my clips. Uh, it's a really old clip. He got raided by... Somebody might know. Like, uh, Kill Deer, no. That dude, no. He got rated. Fuck. Um, if I see it, if I keep saying it, I'm gonna remember. Well, he got rated by a lot of people, but it was a really big, it wasn't Dan's Gaming. I'm, that's not the one I'm, I'm remembering. It was another guy. Cause he got, he got rated and he clocked out right after. It wasn't Destiny either. See, there's, this are all other ones. So I can't say he got rated and it was a big raid. And it was a generally positive raid too. Yeah, I think that was it. Chaotic, great, chaotic. I'm gonna say that. It's that name. It's 100 percent that name. That's the name I'm thinking of. Unless it's not. If it's not that name, it's somebody else. It's that name though. That's the name. Cause there's no other way I would know that name. 
because I never watched that dude. Yes, yeah, that dude. And if it's not, we lost. I should look it up. This used to be a YouTube video. Like a really, really, really specific YouTube video. Hmm. <laughs> I forgot this was a thing. When they had their friendship. <laughs> and he didn't want to play that game with him. Fuck, maybe it wasn't this dude then. Shit. Because you got that, that one guy. Uh, he got two names. And I could never think of either one of them. Moist Critical. Did DSP ever get rated by Moist Critical? Because I don't know if Cryotic rated him with like 2,000 views. Of like more than a thousand. But he got rated. It was on his birthday. DSP, I mean. He got specifically rated on his birthday. And right after he got rated, not 10 minutes after, not 20 minutes after, like within 10 minutes of the raid, he's like, I'm sorry, you guys. I gotta go. And he ended the stream and he typed in his chat, some things are more important than money. Real talk. It was such a good post. And sadly, we're never gonna get to hear him say it. Verbally, we're never going to get that statement, but we got that screenshot of DSP saying, some things are more important than money. Real talk. Imagine you raid somebody, by the way, and then after you fucking raid them, they end and then say some things are more important than money in that chat. What the fuck's wrong with you? What? Oh, only DSP. Only DSP. I wonder if the person that raided him stuck around. I never thought about that. Like the person that raided him, if they stuck around. I'm, I'm hoping that that was the next day and he was in pre stream chat and it wasn't the same day. But I'm pretty sure it was the same day he said that shit in his fucking chat after he clocked out. Some things are more important than money. Real talk. He got raided on his birthday. So I don't know where everyone's coming from. And didn't want to hang out with Sorry anybody. You can't talk because it's 24 hours. Yeah, he never appreciate any raids he get though. At least any raids he ever got on Twitch. Uh, Sometimes he would get them so though, and they wouldn't be tipper, genuine. Tip me a dollar. But what if they like were? The problem with Scorn's combat is and even if it is like genuine, genuine, DSP don't appreciate it anyway. Kind of game you to be methodical and strategic, but it's not how you so play why games. the fuck would you be genuine with them? Mechanic the gun has. Feels bad. You're trying to spam it and complain. The gun doesn't do damage and eats up your ammo. I don't even know what that means. What is a focus mechanic? You realize the game doesn't explain any mechanics, right? You know that, right? So, how am I supposed to understand a mechanic? I'm looking forward to the overall discussion of him right? talking how am I about to understand the gifted members a and the view count. When, like, once it happened. He didn't get the gifted members yet. How am I supposed to understand a focus mechanic that the game doesn't explain? But the view right? counts happen. Maybe YouTube's trying something new. I don't know. And they're advertising him to, like, 100,000 people. Anyway, thanks for the tip. Um, maybe he got, a, tip. he got a boost train. He says, maybe you should advertise Manscaped and do a DSP tries it. Hilarious. And have your wife be a testimony result. So See, the tip. thing is, DSP would do that for free. Thank you, thank you, Team Ico Gamer, for re-upping your membership here. Well, the viewers hey, are leaving. Hey, Team Ico Gamer. As I that said, was when he re raid, Everyone came in, realized he got a really good shout out. Sub mode. He's already and, uh, done. You know. You know. Should I? Should I for a moment disable sub mode just to let these people say who they are? Hmm. Guy, all right. If you're one of the people who just came in in the raid. I'm going to very, very quickly turn off some mode. I'm just very curious where you came from. It's probably going to be something negative. I almost guarantee it. Interesting. Just for a second, let's see who they are. And now I'm just going to turn it right back on when we figure this out. What okay, should we do this? This will be an interesting experiment. Okay, let's figure out what's going on. Ready? Oh, Ready? Man. All right. So don't leave because now people are leaving. I'm going to allow you to talk for a moment and tell me who you are. All right? What, does he the want that fucking work. driver's license or something? Okay. Uh, you saved so, that for your discords, DSP. All right. Ready? This will be a fun experiment. I'm going to try to turn it back on as quickly as possible. <laughs> Ready? Here we go. He's going to probably respond to a bunch of messages, but it's a bunch of messages happen. from people that were already there anyway. They're not okay. people from this raid. <laughs> Maybe they show up and say they're from so Boogie Strings. They lied if they did. No one's saying who they are. Where'd you come from? Who are all you people? Identify where you're from. Now you may speak. I didn't turn it back on. No, I did not. Absolutely not. It's not back on. 
Wow, Team Ico Gamer just gifted 50 memberships. Thank you, Team Ico Gamer. That's huge. Wow. That is some gratefulness. So that was the first 50 gifted from Team Ico Gamer. You heard his reaction. <laughs> oh, man. He got 4K views again, too. Almost 4K likes. Uh, okay. All I'll say is okay. Oh man. I gotta find a tab I even had. I have too many tabs. I'm watching all of those millionaires all day. Let's see. I gotta check behind the scenes. But this is a perfect segue. Since the guy started getting all of his gifted members, this is a perfect segue to talk about my brand new, updated, latest and greatest sub goal. I can't wait to see who wanted to get a shout out to this suspicious lady. Doobie, bro. No, it's not Doobie, bro, either. Let's see. Doobie, bro. It is Doobie, bro. Okay, I won't say anything. I'm not going to judge you or this lady, even though I want to. I'm going to move forward positively and advertise myself. As a matter of fact, get this bullshit out of here. You're advertising these people. They need to advertise my stream and gift me subs during my uh, advertising segment. I'm too nice to y'all. This fucking stupid shit out of here because y'all distracting, uh, distracting from the point, which is listening to me tell you to give me money. Nah, it's not that important. That's just called me being flustered. And now somebody's gonna be like, oh, Tevin was... Shut the fuck up. About to piss me off. Okay, what else I saying? Oh, yeah. Guys, I have a new sub goal. Whoa, man, pretty cool, right? Tevin got sub goals on his channel? What? I didn't know he even had a fucking Twitch channel. Pretty cool, huh? The current sub goal that's already been hit is to commission and get created a kit or shoe live 2D VTuber model. And I don't know if you guys know this. You probably don't. You literally don't. But I went to this VTuber stream yesterday and got a very positive shout out. So I may be able to uh, 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 grinch my way into getting a really, 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 really good VTuber model. Because they'll have connections and shit. This could work, you guys. This could happen. Everybody post prayer hands in chat. Everybody post prayer hands in chat. And, and hope I'm not uh, mean to the VTuber person. I'm going to message them and they're going to say, um, they're going to say I rubbed them the wrong way and act like that dude acted with Sony. But yeah, I went to uh, their stream and they were like, whoa, Tevin, you're like super cool and literally the best person ever. And I was like, whoa, I think the same, but in reverse. And they were like, what? Dude, that's super cool. And I was like, yeah. And they were like, you know what? You do VTuber stuff, don't you? And I was like, yeah i want to get some commission soon and they were like basically that they were like oh shit well i could have you talk to this person and these people and those people and these people and those people you want to look at my rigging we could check the rigging we can look at the rigging look at my rigging and they zoomed in on their belly button so this could be the beginning of something super chill but that's the old sub goal like, I had to derail myself even more. The current and extra chill sub goal. Guess what, pimp? Guess what is returning? Driving streams. And guess what else is returning? Overwatch streams. I know. These are the things everyone wants. These are the things everyone's been asking for. So the brand new... The brand new sub goal for 808 sub points is Overwatch 2 streams. 
consistent Overwatch 2 streams because tons of people have been asking for it. And uh, return to driving streams. Because everybody literally loves driving streams. And it's about to be like winter time. So it won't be 90 degrees when I'm going down the street. And I'll be able to buy a new phone because my current phone basically broke because of the driving streams. But it's all right. I bought it because of the driving streams. Anyway, that's the epic sub goal. Don't get too excited about it. I can't even type this and he can keep the microphone down. But I'm gonna figure it out. We're totally gonna hit the goalie, guys. You'll see. I'm gonna retype this too in a better way. I gotta make a dumb command. It makes sense. The cats agree. Hey. And the Overwatch characters. But not the random ladies. Not the random ladies. I gotta make sure I bring this back so I don't be confused about not working with it. Because that's exactly what's gonna happen. Somebody's gonna say, Tev, everything's muted and it don't work. And I'm gonna say, what? Oh yeah, I remember when I turned it off. <laughs> what? <laughs> Nick, stop it. Nick, what the fuck was that? We play other people's streams and Nick there saying sus stuff. Okay. Like he deserves. Okay. We're gonna move forward. And absolutely I do. But that's not the focus of my content. Someone sends me oh, Happy birthday, oh, happy birthday. Oh, shit. Long mosh pit. What? No. The wait, 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 wait. Let me let's look at okay. Monk Mosh Pit Redeem is my B Day or something else. The in it's my B Day. Will you take a shot in honor? Okay, hold on. I, whatever. It's their birthday. He showed up at the perfect time. I just announced the newest sub goal to return to Walmart streams and or driving streams and Overwatch 2. And I was just thinking, damn, I wonder if it's somebody's birthday. And then you showed up. <laughs> that's, not, that's not the best segue. I'm trying to think to myself, what could I do? Because yesterday... We had a birthday redeem, but maybe it was kind of today. I don't know. I don't fucking know, man. We had a birthday redeem, and uh, I ended up chugging a Bud Light because I didn't have any alcohol. I think I, I think I got something, though. I think I know what I could do, but it might take a while. Let's see what he's saying. So a lot of people are getting gifted memberships right now. Okay, so he's got his gifted members coming in. He gets fucking 300 from one dude. Like, goddamn, is he going to cry? Hopefully he cried. And he got 4K views, 4K likes. Holy crap. He's literally the most popular gamer in the world now. t Michael Gamer <laughs> just gifted another okay, 50 okay. membership. I got to listen to these. Damn. t Michael Gamer is up blowing it fit. up right now. It's a 77% chance I can get something. I gotta go on like a mini adventure. It'll take like five minutes. Thank but you, might, Michael Gamer. Be to we're, we're gonna be take a really shot close to the monthly goal now. After that, we're gonna be like ridiculously close. Frank, you don't like this new microphone. This is a Frank message. I'm literally holding a cheap microphone. Get the hell out of here. I don't even know how this mic sounds. I just know it's like audible. But I'm uh it's like a low drag stream that's terrible in. You tell it you told low drag you hated his streams. Get out of here. 
Right? The thing is, no one is saying where these. Who are you, Raiders? Where are you from? Where Frank's are the Raiders from? By the way, are they still here? Uh, there's still 2,300 people on the stream. Where are you guys from? You could talk. I turned off the sub only mode. But yeah, I think I can get something. But no one's saying where off. they came from. It's gonna. Oh like, my come god! From Team Michael Gamer gave another, another 50 oh, membership. 50. Holy shit! I guess shit. you can't get the 100 at once. So a ridiculous amount of people. This will be very exciting if it happened anywhere else. So I want to see how exciting it is on DSP stream. For some reason, the Raiders are leaving, even though they can talk. <laughs> now, you know what's funny? You know what's fucking funny? He's getting 150 at this point. Gifted members from someone. One person. And he's upset that possible, not even real people are leaving. He's actively trying to see if they'll say something because he don't know if they're real. And he's upset they're leaving. And he's not even giving fucking attention to the dude that's giving him all his money. What the fuck? And technically, it's just me being an asshole and noticing what he's doing wrong in a situation. But fucking Christ, man. Uh, I've seen a lot of streams like get fucking like bullshit good or bad and then get other bullshit good or bad and not like point out the weird shit or the bad shit when they could point out the good shit he could just point out the gifted members and then like 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 chill and then 10 minutes later say oh I guess they were all fucking bots or something because nobody talked but he's just on the edge of his seat he's actively not giving the dude attention that's giving the members it's pretty good. Thank you, Team Microgamer. Well, the membership Next arc month are going up. Ding, 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 ding. Ding, 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 ding. Epic. That's how you. That's how you go. I don't know. No one. No one is saying where they're from. This might be DSP's weirdest response to getting a lot of money ever. But I don't expect much from them. Thank you, Team Ico Gamer, Thank so much. Gamer. We're up to 81 in climbing because we have. And if you don't have fun responses account, to people, we've got 81 you don't already. Think you, do, you can cope <clears> by having notifications like me. And DSP don't have that. So here's what's funny. Now, now we're <laughs> and you know, when he got these gifted members, somebody might have noticed maybe me saying that. I don't know. I said in passing, like, oh, we're going to see the notification the rest of the video. Oh, uh, no. Apparently, if you gift 50 members, no notifications happen at all. Oh, my God. This is like the most unfortunate viewers, stream ever. Okay. Literally. And no guess what? It ain't DSP's fault. You know, it's not his fault. You know, it's not his fault. But I've seen GIF notifications happen, so it is his fault. He could just make them exist. Why the fuck? What the fuck? Did it happen once? For 50? Or what? I didn't, I didn't see it once. Oh no my one gosh. Rated, we'll say who they are. I've turned oh off the limitations on the chat. Boogie. There's no Show up in chat. The fuck? For you not to identify where you came from. And not one person has. I guess none of them have balls. I don't know. Oh, wow. Nice. Right? It's got to be extra not, weird. Anyone could talk right now. I turned off the limits. It's great that he's not giving a shout out. Oh, yeah. I got to go and see if I can. You think it was bots? Maybe it was I got to go see if I can find me Because that was a really take huge a increase out of nowhere. It went from, you know, the 400 I had all the way up to 2,800. And now we dipped by 600 already. Right? PewDiePie? Was it really PewDiePie? You're fucking degenerate. Well, if it was, I'll give him a shout out. If it really was him. But... It's weird that no one is identifying themselves. Degenerate. Why would you not identify yourself? Right? You're a fucking degenerate. I don't You're know. This is very confusing to me. Right now, anyone could talk. I think, no, no, I'm right outside the door. I don't think he thinks I left. I hope not. Yeah, the homeless. The homeless stream. Yeah, it looks like the member goal is going to be hit for the month, which is outstanding. If it is, and I think it will be, thanks to Team Ico Gamer. Thank you so much, Team Ico Gamer. Now the viewers are going back up. Now we're back up to 2,300. We have 100 likes, so we'll do a celebratory bubble blow for everyone. By the way, here we go. I do a bubble. I blow bubbles at 100 likes, which is really silly, of course. Blady and Drain Gang sent us? Who is that? I don't know about that. Who the hell is that? Viewers are going back up because I turned off I turned off sub-only mode. 
I like to have a discussion with the people who are showing up. By the way, so thank you to Tickle My Pickle Nipple. Jesus Christ, what a name. Uh, who did that tip? You a few more tips have come in. Howard Stern sent you? Baba Booey, Baba Booey, Howard Stern sent you. Oh, that's exciting. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Howard Stern is a streamer guy. these you days. You better take us out. Uh, let's see. Shit! Gifted subs. Help! Which is one now of the someone took the dollars just told Buskis like sent like That I really, really <laughs> hope. <laughs> That's probably the most unlikely sale. <laughs> Toe Buskis sent them over. I don't think so. What's funny is no one will actually claim it, right? Jet. Help. Well, this, this guy who tipped earlier said, the guy who had asked about my personal information basically is like, you know, when you're crowdfunding, it's nice for the crowd to know, you know where, the crowd, where the funds go. That's tr completely false. Just because you're a crowdfunded individual, um, all you're doing is supporting my ongoing efforts to make content. That's it. You have absolutely no right to know anything about my private life or where money goes at all. I don't have no actual responsibility to tell you guys anything about what's going on in my life right now. Nothing. So, um, got another dollar tip. Uh, yes, this is an anonymous tipper talking about Bayonetta 3. Yes, we literally just talked about it. Sorry, you came in, you must have come in a little late. We already talked about the Bayonetta situation. Um, Nim rated me, their Twitch streamer. Nim, never heard of Nim. What, uh, what kind of a streamer are they? Nim? If that's the case, thank you. Again, I, I kind of want to say thanks to whoever rated. It's nice to have extra viewers. People are saying people subbed too. Did they? I didn't even look at my subs. Actually... Here's a, here's a good opportunity. Want to take a look? I, I got about 300 subs. Yeah, about 300 of these people who rated subscribe to the channel. Groovy. Wait a minute, did you just... Team I Go Gamer just gifted another 50 memberships. Holy shit. So when the dust settles, we are actually going to hit a new record number of members on the channel. Thank you, Team I, Team I Go Gamer. Thank you. This will help tremendously next month. It will. This will help a lot. So thank you. And this means we're going to get to do the Black Friday Adpocalypse Spectacular event that I really wanted to do next month. You're a fucking degenerate. This is sweet. Team I Go Gamer being very supportive. You're thank you so degenerate. much. Thank you, man. He says, I love you. It's the least I can do. Appreciate it, man. You're a fucking degenerate. And ever, no, trust me, everyone else, goes. thank Team Michael Gamer goes. if you're getting a gifted membership from them, from him right now or them right you're now. You're a fucking degenerate. Um, you're a fucking because, degenerate. Because, yeah, it's a rarity that we get that much support out of nowhere. Holy shit, right? You're but I don't know who, who the raider was. Is it really this Nim pl person? Or I don't know. We're at 2,900 viewers, the most I've ever had on the channel. 2900 so i would like to i would like to have a conversation with the newcomers if you guys are here and you actually came in from Dude, another stream I gotta uh, get my i'd like to know who it was and have a conversation i, I was like listening on my phone them. that was nice of them to send people over but i don't hey, know now i can hear my stream and listen to how it sound king yeah i saw the it actually don't sound different mayor channel there was another tv there was like it's two probably because i'm using the same stuff the besides well. the literal microphone got memberships is one of those type of deals all right, uh, first things first. I was about to sing Biggie lyrics. I thought about it like five times. Decided against it. Anyway, I have alcohol. I can take a shot. I went and uh, scrounged up some Jose Cuervo. You know how people go next door and get sugar from their neighbor? I got some Jose Cuervo. So I got a whole shot of Jose Cuervo. I need to really find a Bayonetta 1 soundtrack, man. Bayonetta 2 soundtrack? Uh, no. It's like five songs. Anyway, Frank Castle with the five gift subs while I was looking for the alcohol. Big ups, thanks for the massive positivity. 
everybody in the chat, post prayer hands. They get this up to Yukimura Sonata, uh, Woodward the Falco, Professor Friendship, Ness Dork, and Spider K. Me and this Frank dude, we got something to talk about next time they show up. It's extremely important. Big ups. William the Alchemist. They're in the chat right now, talking crap about me. All right, Frank, you're on the list. I was talking about it earlier. I don't know if you heard it. But I may possibly, it's like a 20% chance. If I was to be really nice, I'll say like 40. So it's like a 30% chance I'll get like uh, help and connections from another VTuber that has a super sick VTuber rig and an amazingly positive stream. As a matter of fact, you know who I'm talking about, right? I think you might. He was uh, there. You know, what the fuck? I don't got to be weird, but you know what I'm talking about. That, that lady. So uh, I was writing the list like two days ago because I wanted to try to get it worked on before this month over with. And like, it's like fate. I write the list and the next day I find this person. So if I get a bunch of help from them, I'll be able to make literally the best live 2D VTuber thing ever. And even if that don't happen, you're still on the list. The VTuber accessory list. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. I still got to put more people on it and do some uh, final whatevers. But basically people that gifted the most subs or more than like 15 or 16 or 17 or whatever. It was supposed to be more than 17. The people that gifted more than 17 since uh, September the 1st, they get put on a list. And they get to pick a thing that I put on the VTuber. So if you want them to have like a super custom fancy eye patch, you can say, yeah, give that bitch an eye patch. And when I get it made, I'll say, yo, could you make them an eye patch too? And then they'll make them an eye patch. It'll be like, uh, you know, a, an accessory list. Come on, man. It makes sense. So you'll be able to guess, not guess, you'll be able to pick a thing whenever you come up with a thing for the VTuber accessory list. I don't have a deadline yet, but I guess I'll eventually have a deadline for it. Deadline to be determined. But so far on the list, we got Edie Bot, Colbin, Riohan, Mark Twain, Frank Castle, DJ Filthy Rich, Alpha Elite, Mad Adder, CJ Bound, Dominic, Spaghetti Teeth, D Trash Man, Guy with Two Names, Zitro, Zealousy, and like I say, it's other people I gotta put on the list. I just uh, don't know who they are yet. A <laughs> top head in a monocle. Nim? It was the streamer Nim? I think I was. Yeah, it was basically just, dude, I, I can't get over how he got 200 gifted members at this point from one dude. And he, and the dude was like, I love you, man. It's the best, it's the least I could do. And then I think he gifted more after that. But anyway, he got all of that from this dude. And he's just worried about who rated him. Or worried about if the views are real, where are the people coming from, if they can like the video. He blew bubbles. Did you notice he didn't bring up if he blow more bubbles? Why didn't he blow more? Five I don't know. Subs. D trash man Which with the five get the gifted subs. You can get in life. It's like being kissed on a forehead. This dude lost his mind. <laughs> Big ups. Thanks for the massive positivity. <laughs> D trash man. Uh, five gifted to Hawks Worthers. Uh, Lil Trey, 15. Almighty Patty, the fourth month. For the sub -bomb of five uh, Killer subs. one, fourth month. Can we get and Shere King, the 11th month. I gotta change gotta Brian time in one day. He always like talk over himself the same way. But uh, Big Ups, you also get us one step closer to bringing back Walmart. True and authentic Walmart driving streams. So that's gonna be terrifying. Well, shout out to Nim if that's who it is. I have no idea who that shout is or what kind of content Nim. they put out, but that was nice. I swear. I don't know how the hell I wasn't rated it once. I'm not here to tip. I'm not here to get shout outs. Man, I didn't send get the subs. It's just me and my gang. Oh, shit, we get the music video. AEG. Almighty Egg Gang, what up? 
Everybody right now, literally. And if a my band me, I got to spam almighty AEG emo. Thank you, Mad Adder. Four to seven, get the subs. To I'm still jarring. Uh, Nico Nico New. Big Bag. Rex Forehorn. Horn. Back 412. D Gary. And Hornado U. Y'all free throwing right now. I talk tips. I think, oh, I should have had a microphone for this. I should redo the video with the microphone. It could be like a Sean and Milan concert. I can put on a backpack. Yeah, we still got to take the shot. Uh, shit. Hold on. Well, I guess we're already holding on to this zone. Monk Mosh Pit. Hopefully it's still here. We got to, okay, it's still here. We got to do the Monk Mosh Pit birthday shot. So if you're watching, get your water bottles and your Diet Coca-Cola. What? And your Why Pepsi, and uh, va vanilla flavored almond milk. Cause we're about to take a shot. I got Jose Cuervo. You better take a sip. How you doing? People know I'm safe, even when I'm not around. Let's get it. Yeah, I got my bits on me. I ain't trying to tip right now. Trying to tip right now. And if a my band me, I got a sock right now. I got a sock right now. Yo, if you was leaving on site, if I turn on the stream right now, on a stream. Me and Ed Gang, we ballin'. Y'all free throwin' right now. Yeah, I got my bits on me. I ain't trying to tip right now. I'm looking for the VTuber. And if a my band me, I got a sock right now. Since William S. He is a fellow VTuber. Turn on the stream. What the fuck happened? I have way too many times. Help. At, at this point, I might as well play the clip. I just don't want to... <laughs> you know, we're going to play the clip. We're going to play the clip. It's funny. It's funny. They just and if I play the clip, it'll basically be showing the VTuber at the same time. So you can see how cool he look. But like I say, I have way too many tabs. Oh my god, I know where it is. If you gift I never deleted the clip. It becomes more powerful. That's why. Big ups Van the Man with the 100 bits and the monster wheels. We have a level 4 hype train. I don't know if they counted the 5 and the 5 and the 7. Or if they counted just the 5 and the 5 and the 7. About to beat your last record. Keep up the sport. You told me this last time. You told me this last time. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I gotta look up my own clips. You better take a sip. <laughs> I named the clip Four Dingus. Y'all ever seen Kill a Volkswagen Beetle cheap. with monsters? Listen, listen to the pop. The pop when Almighty Tevin showed up to the street. Level two, I really appreciate it. Bruh. Don't mind, don't mind, don't mind Galactic, he's shitting, pissing, what? and crying Maybe I right did now. something wrong. No, I okay, dropped I my right. cheese on the no, floor! No, I did something wrong, help! Fuck! We gotta you go back, chat. Little... I knew I named it for Dingus. Dingus, where's the clip? Dingus? Dingus got the clip. We lost. We lost. Y'all literally got the end of the clip. Hell! Wait, I know what I can do. I'm actually hyper-intelligent. You may be wondering what I mean when I say that. Guess what? <laughs> Guess what, idiot? I know how to do everything. Everything. I'm going to search what I said in Dingus chat. I'm, I'm stalking myself. Huge what happened? I'm not here to get shout outs. 10 gifted subs? It's just me and my gang. AEG. We All broke the hype up. train. Big up Shriya Han, thanks for the massive positivity right and the song right while I try to look up this, <laughs> this stupid clip. So, I had to go to Dingus chat and then do user and look up my own shit. But I'm pretty sure you can just type in the chat, right? And then check a message. Yeah. Type and click on your own name. If you for some reason want to read your own messages from the best, it makes sense. Y'all free throw right now. I talk tips. 
I don't know what y'all cheering about. I don't know what y'all cheering about. Matter okay. of fact, as we stream. No! No! no. no. It's gone! What? What? No! 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 We lose everything. 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 Just count the egg gang, bitch. You know, we got clout. We got clout. Everything. Like I say, I'm hyper intelligent. See what they about. What? What? It's following I'm hyper intelligent. I can figure everything out. Socks with accounts right now. on the couch right now. Good God. I just have to search my sea of tabs. Let's get it. Audio warning. No! No! I got a sock right now. I really will have to go to market with stream. Me and gang, we bought. Fuck! Gang, right this now. wouldn't happen at a dinga street. I ain't trying to tip right now. I ain't trying to tip right now. And if I'm my band me, I got a sock right now. Look, I can explain. I can explain. Y'all ever seen a Volkswagen Beetle? How was I supposed to know? The archive would be gone. How was I supposed to know? Y'all ever seen a Volkswagen Beetle? We can't do anything, bro. We can't do anything. I would literally have to go to Mark Twin stream and then find him watching the fucking clip. At this point, at this point, we've lost all context to it. I can only show what they look like now. That's all I can do. Jeez Louise. My life has been ruined, chat. Ruined. Ruined. It was such a fun, warm welcome. Oh my God. Almighty Tevin's here. My fiance loves your streams. Oh my God. Everybody, Almighty Tevin's here. You gotta follow this guy. <laughs> it's okay. I'll remember it for the rest of my life, even though the memory has been taken from me i wonder what this clip is i'm not checking that she looks sad at it see every time you clip stuff just know it may be one day gone you gotta clip it and double clip it you gotta local clip it that's how you really make sure you keep it and uh save it on a local hard drive Team Michael Gamer. He gifted even more. He gifted 200, I think 300, and then 310. What a cool guy. There goes. Oh, get the fuck out of here. Dust to settle. Whatever, dude. I don't even want to talk about it. There goes your, huh? The 10 gifted subs. Did I even read these? I never found a clip. It's all right. You just have to know. Just pretend you know. Real high, no. They were there. Uh, Dingus was there. Uh, Frank was there. All right, I guess the dust is settled. By the way, let's get racks. Literally everyone. Oh, yeah, the audio is too low. I'm going to see how many members we got. I turned it down for the VTuber segment. Wow. And we got Google Guys. This. this was completely unexpected. A giant raid. This and wouldn't on top happen of that, on a Vim stream. Shame on a gifted member. The fuck is Vim bottle? Thank you. Whatever. That um, person's not even real. Here we go. I think they were making up names in this chat. Let's see. Give this up to Tired Hollow, Pim Pam, Cool Guy so, Johnson, JPG Gamer, J Davis. Uh, Six hundred and ninety-six shit. members. What the fuck? He's almost. Oh my god. Is he gonna set a new goal? We have far exceeded the goal. <laughs> now, if it was like the 16th, 15th of the month, he would probably be setting a new goal. Uh, speaking of new goal, this stream for the first time has hit a level six hype train, which was literally impossible a few months ago. They changed how hype trains work. But a uh, level level six hype train. Pretty cool, man. 
uh, what other ones I didn't read? Iron Torch, Dark, Satsune, Pelly, and Fine Lines. Big up to Johan for the 10 gifted subs. Monk Mosh Pit to 200 bits. Features and came to 100 bits. And Orange Juice to 100 bits. And if you don't know, that's just SS Sniper Wolf reacting uh, hilariously to a TikTok. If you don't know who that is, it's because you sadly never got clickbaited. And you also don't watch the best TikTok reactor on YouTube. It's okay, I don't watch either. Team One day it's gonna be a redeem, or she's gonna be part of every stream. We're gonna watch an SS Sniper Wolf Black TikTok react video every Apocalypse, day. Apocalypse, as I'm calling it. You're lucky it didn't um, happen yet, because I don't think anybody's gonna like tremendous. it. Thank but it's gonna so be much. hilarious. I, I was disgusting. I'm sorry, guys. I mean the burp there. <laughs> Friday ad spectacular. Adpocalypse, as I'm calling it. She's the um, most consistent YouTuber in the history. That of is tremendous. Thank you so Probably much. Probably unironic. I was disgusting. I'm More sorry, consistent than the guy. So that is excellent. So many of you are now going to enjoy having these emotes and, and everything during phone the cups next busy, funny. busy month of gaming. All the releases coming out. I thought this I was about to drink soap just now. Next month, thank you for that. Um, it's just the cup. So there you go. So was it Nim? I'm surprised. Oh my god, Nim isn't in the chat. Monk Mosh, but you still we still got to do a shot. Every time I look down, I see the Jose Cuervo, and I'm like, wait, oh yeah, you've been at a whole time. I got a plate of fake gumbo sitting next to it. As in, I don't even have rice. It's just pieces of meat on a plate. It's gonna be delicious. All right, uh, big ups. Everybody currently watching, streaming, and chilling, and interacting. Uh, we're gonna take a shot. You better take a sip. We dedicate the shot to Mug Mosh Pit. It is their birthday. So if you hit post some birthday or birthday like emojis in the chat. Make sure I don't waste any sip. Uh we got William the Alchemist, D Trash Man, Tired Hollow. Take a sip. Mad at her. Ragnarok off shot. Uh something here. Take a sip. OMG Zelda. A gang seventeen thirty eight. Aloof one. Better take a sip. Me my Phantom Man. Take a sip. Uh, orange juice. I wish I had some right now. Peaches and Keen. Uh, Base Shy TV. I can't even scroll. I got a, a shy glass in the other hand. Come on. All right. We got the happy birthday wishes shy glass. So make sure to make a wish on a delicious cupcake. <laughs> this is Jose Cuervo. Been a while since I drunk some. But it's only one shy glass. So it'll be super chill. We can also dedicate this shot to uh, the future of positivity, uh, Silent Hill, and to Konami and Team Ico Gamer. They probably had a few of these already today. Uh, make a wish. 7654. 7654. 3 to 1. And big ups, Jose Cuervo. I toughed through it. It was like, uh, yeah, like eight point nine out of ten shot. Rating that was very nice. So I see more people are leaving again. So by the way, he's just gonna bring up people who are on the stream right now. Want to stick around? We're gonna be playing Plague Tale Requiem in just a moment. I'm actually gonna end the podcast in a, in a few minutes here and uh, just kind of use the restroom quick for my start. If you guys are interested in Plague Tale, stick around. It's a great game. After the first few hours, the first hour was slow. After that, it picked up really big, and it's like scary and really well done. Graphics are great on the series. I need to play a hockey game. If you want to see a fun game? Stick around. All right, it's a really good spooky game for the month of October. Um, if not, just thanks for coming by. That was very nice of you guys to come by, and you actually were pretty good. There was a few, you know, jerks in the chat, but I turned it off of sub only mode, and for the most part, you guys have been nice. <clears throat> Thank you for that. Uh. Jade Van Zyl just re-upped the membership for two months. Says, how's it going? It's going weird. I was not expecting this this morning. I was not expecting to get... So, based on uh, what DSP just said, actual from, people were uh, in the raid. Nim. What kind of content And it was do? Nim Can who raided. Can tell me a little bit more about this streamer? Hmm. Alleged Twitch streamer. 
who who is Nim and what kind of content do, uh, and do they do? I if they're a Twitch streamer, that just make me ask. I mean, it's only one day and one stream, but that make me ask. Well, why would they waste their time on raiding DSP? Was it a was it a real raid? Was it based on positivity? I don't want to say they because I don't even know. I don't name. even know how it's spelled. What kind of content do they do on uh, the name Nim? Sound like um, uh, like Twitch. a Dota two player or an Overwatch it's not player? Nim? Then who was it? It's not Nim now. We lost. Why will no one be me and something air both lost? No. <laughs> We on an even playing field People for the wasn't first time man. ever. What's up, Jade? How you doing, man? What's up, Jade? Jade, take a look around. What the heck's going what on, fuck man? Fuck Jade. How's it going, man? <laughs> what is going on here? Could they be bots? People are saying it was bots. I thought it was them. I hope we could get the name dropped. Now, now I just can't believe anyone because now everyone's saying something different. You know. They aren't real. They'd be chatting. It's just a, bo a bunch of bots. You think so? So now based on the chat, nobody talked. What the hell? Email just Email. gifted 10 memberships. Hey. Wow. Wow. They have some mail. Here we go. Wow. wow. Well, more people are getting memberships. Right Emil now. sees competition. Pretty crazy. I know what's going on here. So now with that, we got another channel. 10. Yeah, we got another 10. So now we're over 700. The most I've ever had on the channel. We're now at uh He actually beat his record. He beat his record today. 706 memberships. Thank you, Pretty email, cool, for that. He's going to talk mom. about this Obviously, longer on a like, daily rap than he is on an actual bomb. stream. I appreciate that. Oh, shit. So I got my number, mail. Like, 706. Just now. Because like we I'll know, sadly, there will I be a I got something super chill. I want to remember the most I've ever had on the channel. So, uh... Mental prediction on am I getting scammed? I got another tip, dollar twenty-five tip. We'll figure out the hallway, but I'll be back. Spawn killers tip me that I got out of surgery. I'm in a sling, not much pain. I'm glad to come by the stream. You certainly came by at an interesting time, right? Take a look at the stream. I don't even know what's going on. I, I don't know where these viewers came from. So I'd, I'd like to entertain the viewers, but I don't know who you are. I can't entertain you if I don't know what you're here for. <laughs> right? Where did you come from? Pray hands and chef for spawn killer. And then I got another two dollar tip. This one is from. Oh, uh, an anonymous tipper saying, "What do I think of Amaranth? I don't think at all of Amaranth. I've never seen a single piece of content from them because I don't watch that kind of stuff. You guys know I Bro, am. Bro, I just took my headphones off. What the fuck did you just say about this lady? To Twitch. <laughs> Um, oh, uh, um, I did not imagine pretending you didn't see Amaranth, by the way. Wow, that's like saying you didn't, you never saw a dandelion before or some shit. Anonymous tipper. Yeah, I never saying, saw this beautiful thing in front of me. I don't me. think at all of Amaranth. You're blind. I've never seen a single piece of content from them because I don't watch that kind of stuff. You guys know I am strongly opposed to Twitch promoting that kind of content i don't i don't believe in it okay i just don't you know i, I hate it i hate that, that 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 it gets promoted and whatever you know but but that's not what we're talking about it's not the point of the podcast today we already talked about that at length in the past i just don't like that kind of how did he talk about it if he don't even watch it the content I'd according to him life. to talk about to talk about him and he's way less important than amaranth just because that's the way the internet works according to him you got to watch his shit in full context to have an opinion on it bruh I feel like it's predatory. <clears throat> Big up's predatory. Uh, I guess that's okay. it. All right, I'll be back. <laughs> All right. Now the views are going up again. This is so weird. Barrel Shroud says, did we unlock a new emote slot? I believe we did. Um... But there's a problem with that. The way it works on YouTube is when you unlock the slot, you have to get an emote in there right away. And if you don't, you lose the slot. So we'd have to talk about what the emote would be and add it like right away or else I don't get it. And we haven't even, we certainly weren't expecting this to happen today, right? This is completely out of, out of left field that we were going to get this many, uh, emotes, right? So, another dollar tip. F 
from Lee saying what happens with your YouTube, what happens with your monthly YouTube payment money? I've already explained this a million times. As soon as that money comes in, here's where it goes. My mortgage, my car payment, my health insurance payment, my car insurance payment, my homeowner's insurance, my monthly tax payment, my monthly back tax payment. Um, I'm just trying to go in my head. I'm trying to mentally go through the entire list of where it all goes. So the money comes in within usually about a week to a week and a half. It's all completely gone. It just goes to all the big bills um, that I have every month. That money is already accounted for by the time it comes in every single month. <clears throat> Another dollar tip. Why am I afraid of sexual content? I'm not afraid of con sexual content. I'm not afraid of anything. All right, that's not true. I am afraid of, I have a rational fear of heights. I don't know why, because sometimes I'm just afraid of heights when there's no reason to be afraid of heights. But outside of that, I'm not afraid of anything. So, oh, I got a dollar twenty-five tip. Third Eye the Third sent them. No, Third Eye the Third did not send anyone to my channel. Third Eye the Third does, you know, doesn't even exist. <laughs> All right. So, has the dust settled? Has the dust cleared here? I think it has. Um, we're now at 2,929 viewers, the most I've ever had. But surprisingly enough, these people are not talking. <laughs> Which is weird that no, none of these people who ra raided are saying anything. Audio object. Well, first of all, thank you. Uh... Astro Noah Hot Not. Can't even say his name who re-upped his membership. He's a DS positive. Let's go. Thank you for that. Um, totally not a sock account that a super chat says. Could we ask these insane number of viewers who are on the stream right now if you if you like the stream to like it? That way we can prove they're not bots. Alright. If you're one of the 2,941 viewers on the stream right now, can you prove you're not a bot? By giving the stream a like. Only if you like it. You don't have to like the stream if you don't like it. But right now we're at 130 likes. So if we see a big jump in likes. Then I guess we know these people are real. And if we do not see a jump in likes. We know they're all bots. There you go. See what happened. Audio Object had done a super chat. Thank you for that. Asking about the emote. Arcade Cup did a super chat. Thank you for that. And then Totally Not a Sock Account. With that super chat. That's the latest one. Let's get that up on the leaderboard. Okay. People want me to start the game. We can, but I have to pee first. <laughs> I really have to pee before we start. <clears throat> Alright, here's the deal. We'll end the show. I have two epic things I can respond to. Because I'm still in the middle of doing something. So, the emote thing. Even if... The, okay. I just gotta... I don't know. I gotta be lame. If uh, on YouTube... You, you just can't change your emotes. At least the way DSP explained it, and I'm going to just believe it. If you uh, have... I don't know, man. If you need 400 members to get 20 emote slots, right? And then you change your emotes. After you go under 400, you won't have 20 emote slots anymore. <laughs> so he can't change his emotes. Well, he can now because he got 700 members. But once he go on to 700, if he change him, he's fucked. So if he pick like a Thanksgiving emote or a Halloween emote, and he don't have 700 members next month, and he choose to change it, he's going to lose emote spots. Based on how he explained it. He don't even like, he literally loses the fucking spots. It sucks. It apparently actually sucks. And it doesn't help your channel long term at all. If you give subs or uh, members on YouTube. So that's fun. And, uh, what else he talked about while I was listening? He just said it. I gotta rewind. You're gonna have, uh, an echo, dude. Okay. Now, he figured out about it the bad way. People want me to start the game. He already know. We can't, but I have to pee first. <laughs> you gotta <laughs> pee. Okay, dude. Likes? Then I don't. Oh, yeah, the, the likes like thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it. That's what I wanted to say. He says, like the stream, if you like the stream. How would a literally new person like this? It's been some old dude 
looking around wondering if the people watching him are real or not while simultaneously not responding to someone who spent how much like i don't fucking know just do math oh my god he did he get 50 more he didn't get 50 more. i don't know just do the fucking math man four dollars times 300 so they saw somebody not responding to getting that much money while simultaneously paying way too much attention to people who weren't weren't there and and the funny thing is i got pig noses too because i was listening to the stream and not watching and not looking at the chat he he turned off subscriber only mode and people was talking and he was like okay you guys i turned it back on don't worry i turned it back on and remember i said out loud based on what dsp just said people showed up and real people were in a raid and then he read messages from his own chat and they're saying nobody was there and then dsp point out that nobody was there so now it's bots you just told me it was real people though basically uh it breaks my heart man this is basically gonna be a day that's forgotten i'm gonna have to i'm gonna specifically go out of my way and clip this whole uh reaction segment and like give it a weird name on the archive channel like dsp gets a bunch of members and gets a bunch of views i don't fucking know because it's a really suspicious stream but it's not important but it needs to be remembered and then you can go back next month and watch the stream and say oh yeah he's gonna lose 300 members astro noah okay no. i'll be back uh i got a special package in the mail so i have an unboxing to do it's like a super suspicious, specific unboxing. Unless I got scammed on eBay. Then you'll get to see me open a box and say, what the fuck, I got scammed. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much what I'm doing. Or at least what I'm working my way towards doing. Can't even say his name who re-upped his membership. He's a DS positive, let's go. Thank you for that. Um... Totally not a sock account that a super chat says. Could we ask these insane number of viewers who are on the stream right now if you if you like the stream to like it? That way we can prove they're not bots. All right. If you're one of the 2,941 viewers on the stream right now, can you prove you're not a bot by giving the stream a like? Only if you like it. You don't have to like the stream if you don't like it. But right now we're at 130 likes. So if we see a big jump in likes, then I guess we know these people are real. And if we do not see a jump in likes, we know they're all bots. There you go. See what happens. Audio Object had done the super chat. Thank you for that. Asking about the emote. Arcade Cup did a super chat. Thank you for that. And then Totally Not a Sock account with that super chat. That's the latest one. Let's get that up on the leaderboard. Okay. People want me to start the game. You can't, but I have to pee first. <laughs> I really have to pee before we start. <clears throat> All right, here's the deal. We'll end the show. We will start with the game. Don't go anywhere. We're going to start with the game right away. And I won't, for now, I won't put it on sub-only mode. If we need to put it on sub-only mode, I will. But for now, we'll, t we'll leave it off. Um, so people can chat as they please, since there's so many people here. Um, to, to chill. Okay. My Ruin wants the DSP shot emote. Like, taking a shot. I could do that right now. We can add that new emote right now. Would you like me to? Hold on. We'll do it right now on the fly. Real quick. Let's do it. Before we lose the spot. You better take a sip. Let's fucking go! Let's fucking go! You better take a sip. You better take a sip. Hold on.
Okay, Dawn. Dawn. Added a new one. There is now a DSP shot emoji added. You now have the DSP degenerate. shot emote. It should be added momentarily. If you don't see it yet, it should be there. It should be DSP shot. I just added it. So anyone who's a member, you now have access to that. Okay. There it is. Demon Shroud is using it. B-Boy Cyclone. There you go. Okay. What was that weird hug? You're a fucking degenerate. Okay. <laughs> really? Really? So my ruin, what thank you for re your membership, this? and he said the shot emote, you got it. Just asking you shall receive. So there you go. Let's I firmly believe control. these are bots now. Here's why. Square we still says we have 2,600 viewers, but we only have 180 likes. So I said, hey guys, if you're a real viewer, like the stream. And only 50 people did it. So I, I honestly now, I am believing these are bots. I think someone somehow instituted a bot rate. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So, he did get a bunch of likes, but now he only got 260 views, so who fucking knows what's going on? But, can he not talk about it at this point? He's still talking about it this far into the stream. Eight of some sort? <laughs> I know they're all bots because at this point because they didn't like the stream. Now, and on top of that, he specifically said himself, like the stream only if you actually like the stream. And I told you, the viewer, what the fuck is that a like? You showed up to a dude wondering if he even real. It's nothing to like. And then he got the likes. So now I'm waiting to see what his response going to be when he see he got the likes. In I'll the be chat comfortable bots. Flooded with people talking. And how is it that the when lights didn't go up? Hey, it's Roger. Roger. You're literally here at the perfect time. As a matter of fact. You hear that weird like I'm listening to myself talk so I can notice some stuff. You hear that weird like doo -doo 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 -doo. little typing, tapping, tapping. It's specifically this microphone. Kind of flimsy. It's a very old microphone too. And it's literally cheap. It's probably twenty dollars. Anyway, Roger, you're here at the perfect time. I'm shocked you showing up this late into the level one podcast. Guess what? DSP got like four thousand views. He got literally three hundred fucking gifted members. No troll. Dead ass. He got three point seven K likes on the stream right now. It was an insane everything i got a bunch of gifted subs on my own stream uh walmart streams are coming back soon uh we took a shot for monk mosh pit birthday and i may be able to get a bunch of help from a really 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 good vtuber to get super cool vtuber stuff and elevate myself in reality but anyway, like I was saying, you showed up at the perfect time. So if you want me to take a shot, I'll take a shot of Jose Cuervo. I got to go to my next door neighbor and ask for some. But I can take a shot. You was watching on your stream. <laughs> Wait, look, this is this is Roderick. He says no gifted positivity for me. All right, chat. Who's watching? Who's watching right now? Literally the first person to go to Roderick chat and post take one sip. of my emotes, I'll give you a sub. I'm making a very specific deal. I'm not even going to post Roderick link. You got to already have it. That's how I know you're a real fan. And if nobody do it, then I'll just do it right now. Somebody could do it. See, William the Alchemist is literally there. It's the guy. Oh my God. Almighty Tevin, what a gift is up. <laughs> it's pulling me late. You're late. But look, I'm a nice guy, so you can get it too. And then I'm done. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking oh my God. Go. Almighty Tevin, what a gift is up. 
to William the Alchemist and Paulie May. Two people brought into the right, the right world. That's it, the right world. Let's fucking go. Big ups. Uh, Paulie May and William the Alchemist. Make sure to post your Roderick emotes far and wide. You get these. <laughs> I love this one. <laughs> yeah, you can see it. It's like perfectly set on the screen for you to be able to look at it. And you can post this little dude. I got this dude in my VTuber program. Which I can't do anyway the way I want to because I'm holding the mic to talk. So screw it. Well, no, I can still do it. They can sit on a head. Right there. Perfect. <laughs> yeah, that Cheetos emo. I noticed that Cheetos emote earlier and I looked at it for like maybe three minutes and drew a conclusion and then left. It definitely looked like something that wouldn't get approved. I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. When I saw it, you know what? That's the last thing I thought to myself too. It was like, what the fuck? That got approved? Because manual approval is all over the place, man. And some people don't have manual approval either. But I don't have to deal with it. I think I fucked up my headphones or my mic out. I don't know what. Help! I don't know, it's alright, I think. Anyway, I'm going to get some, uh, I'm going to get another Jose Cuervo shot. So, two shots. And we dedicate the next shot to Monk Mosh Pit, all the people that showed up since, and whoever they might say want to show up. So I'll be back again. This dude probably won't say anything ridiculous. It doesn't make any sense, does it? Right? And by the way, it, you don't even have to keep the like. You could use it, you could like and then dislike, and it takes the like away. I don't care about the likes on the stream. I was saying I'm trying to prove that these people are real. So, I think you guys might have something. It might be just bots. Yeah. Yeah, sadly. And look, All right. I know about that, Roger. I thought about that, too. And then when I thought about it, I thought to myself, did they, like, eat flaming Hot Cheetos and do it? And then I thought, maybe they did. Because it would... <laughs> I'm not going to have an in-depth discussion about that. But you know what I mean. You know what I'm getting at. It would probably be worse, right? Because I really feel like if it was legit, there would have been people claiming and saying, yes, it was this streamer, and here's what they had to say. Even if it was someone who hates me, if it was someone who was toxic, they probably would have come in and claimed it, right? And the fact that we got no one claiming, you know, uh, absolutely no one claiming uh, responsibility for it makes me feel like it's a bunch of bullshit. You're a fucking degenerate. You know. <laughs> All right. Well, we certainly spent enough time on the on today's podcast. If you you know if you're watching on demand on YouTube, it was weird. Over 200 gifted members between Team Ico Gamer and Emil, mostly Team Ico Gamer. Um, what? Now the likes have shot up to 651 likes. Now we're at 749 likes. Now we're at 756 likes. So who are you people? Why won't you say something? If you're real, why don't you say something? <laughs> why don't you say who you are and where you came from? This is so weird.
I don't know. I have no idea. <laughs> well, I have I don't know what to say. It's the most liked stream I've ever done. It's the most viewed stream I've ever done. Thank you for that. I guess we will end uh end the podcast and get started with gameplay. Great. All right. Well, this is going to be fun. Thanks, everyone, for watching. Happy Halloween. I did not expect to be able to do that in front of over 2,000 people today. <laughs> okay. So now that all of you have probably fucking soiled yourselves, with good reason, I think we'll get ready and we'll start playing the game. And I'm curious if any of you will stick around. It'd be cool if you did. If not, thanks for stopping by. I still have no clue who you are. And unless someone kind of contacts me behind the- It's really funny how people actively, allegedly stuck around and liked the video. He's telling them that they won't. He did something to piss them off. And now people got to contact him behind the scenes and say that they raided him. So now somebody can lie. A popular streamer can lie. Amaranth. No. I need to stop name dropping Amaranth. She's just the first one because stuff. Pokemon. She gonna DM DSP and say, bro, it was me. I told my viewers to go hit you up during one of my BRB breaks. <laughs> A BRB break. The double break. And she just had that much reach. It makes sense. It seems to actually explain what happened today. I don't think we'll ever have a definitive answer. I honestly have no idea, you know, who you guys are. <clears throat> um, thank you, Christian, for reopening your membership. Do you think Resident Evil 5 and 6 will get remade? Eventually, probably yes. I do think so. Okay. Um, I, I really have to pee before we start, all right? All I'm going to do is run my bathroom's right next door. I'm just going to mute the mic, go next door, pee, come right back, and we're going to start with gameplay. So I hope some of you will stick around if you can. All right. Um, if you're real, that is. I'm, and we're going to start with Playtale in just a moment, but I really have to pee before we start. Okay? I'll give me like two minutes. I'll be right back. I'm not. How about this? Just to prove. Just to prove. That a lot of the shit that people say about me is not true. I easily could say, oh, I need an ad break right now with 3,000 people on the stream. I'm not this even going to This is so do dumb. Because people don't even accuse him of like running ads. He tell us all the time he's not gonna run ads, he don't run ads. He don't even really know how to run ads. And then on top of that, if he got raided by somebody, why would he assume that the people that showed up with the raid don't like him and know about him in a negative way? Didn't they like the video? Why? Why? Why is he so fucking like specifically negative about everything and always toxic just to show that i'm not fucking greedy i'm not gonna run an ad in front of three thousand people whoa i mean damn bro you got 300 members gifted you don't need to run ads come on dude it's like one day anyway we're taking a shot big ups roderick they uh personally requested the second shot you better take a you sip. better take a sip i already have a port uh, super delicious, tasty, you and tangy. Jose Cuervo. Let's see. We can dedicate the shot to... You better take a sip. Roderick, A-Gang 1738, Bully Mate, William the Alchemist, you take SP, a sip. SCP Sophie, Something Air, uh, Buzz you better take a sip. Nose Vacuum, Almighty Frogger, Peaches and Keen, uh, Bully Mate, Orange juice, mad at her. You better take a sip. Me, you better take a sip. Vanna Man. Mr. Lion. Yes, <laughs> some of you will stick around. Literally nobody did. <laughs> Peaches and King. Uh Rog in a party hat. Rag in a party hat. And whoever else could be here. And also, Monk Moshpit. 
it is their birthday and that's the reason why i got the first shot so let's fucking go seven six five four three two one got a coca-cola this time the miniest of mini cans probably not good how i actually Uh, just pretend it didn't happen. Talking about that it was obviously yeah. ASMR. Yeah, I'm just gonna use the mic and go pee. I'll be right back. I needed, needed some Coca Cola. Up to two straight shots of Jose Cuervo. I still got this super secret unboxing, too. It's a special item that I didn't tell anyone I was going to get. It's uh, gaming related. And it came in a big box. You better take a sip. Big ups, Shroom Dukum. Just got home from work. You miss, um, I don't know if Epic will work, but you missed a very suspicious DSP pre stream. In a nutshell, he got 300 plus gifted members, all from one person Team Ico Gamer. So, holy fuck, that dude's insane. He got almost 4K likes. He had 5,000 views at one point. Uh, he said they were all bots. He said they were real. They got a bunch of he got a bunch of likes. He said they were bots again. Nobody talked in the chat after he turned off sub only mode. We're never gonna know what truly happened. But what if we did? Well, yeah, he got a bunch of gifted members, like a lot of gifted members, and uh, a bunch of views and a bunch of likes. But he only got likes after he specifically said, "Guys, okay." Here's what we'll do. To prove you aren't bots, after, this is after he turned off sub only mode, by the way. After he turned off sub only mode and specifically said, if you're not a sub, please talk. I've seen people get rated and have like 20 extra views and they'll turn off follow only mode and be like, oh yeah, follow only mode's off and the chat light the fuck up. And DSP pretended like people were talking, but then they didn't, I don't know. Basically people didn't talk when he turned sub only off basically but then he turned it back on why did he turn it back on he blew bubbles for 100 likes he didn't blow bubbles again i thought he blow bubbles so if he get 200 he blow he blow bubbles twice he blew bubbles once he got oh, he got 4k likes okay he got 3.7 likes but he should blow bubbles what 37 times then right that's it's kind of funny how once he get a lot of the thing, he doesn't do the thing he does when he get the thing. Like, uh, I mean, if he was to get $8 over and over and over and over and over, when is he going to cut off the eight ball questions? Yeah, DSP been having fun today. Well, I would assume he's been having fun. But now he got 300 views again, and it's just fucking Baxter's in his chat probably. So what the hell happened here? And we still don't know who rated him. We're never going to know. We're never going to know if it was even a person that rated him. It may have been a bot attack. Thankfully, if it was a bot attack, he at least got a bunch of fucking members during it. So that's something. <laughs> 4K likes, all of them views, 300 fucking gifted members. Uh, that's enough to make a grown man cry. Enough to make a grown man cry. No way he started begging when he got raided. I don't want to rewind though. Nah, he didn't cry. He didn't even really... Dude, this is the worst part about it. I'm pausing on basically something I should be skipping past. This is the worst thing about it. While he was getting all of those gifted members, so, like specifically why? Not why. While he was getting those gifted members. 
he was only talking about people not talking and only talking about the raid. Who's raiding? Who is this? Guys, who are you? Who is this? Who's raiding you guys? Are these real people? All oh, right, guys. So I got another 50 gift of members. Okay. Started. Is it real? One, are they real people? Are they real people? What's going on? Obviously, when you get it's a like, raid like this and you don't even know if it's real, there, there could be some. The person that gave him all of his money basically didn't it. get any attention. I should say this up front, everyone. He gave Obviously, way more I hope attention to a dude that gave him three dollars and trolled, according to DSP. He's, he's he trolled with three dollars and people that are bots. Like he talked to bots way more than he talked to a dude that gave him three hundred members. He ain't say shit to him. He ain't even fucking read. Of course, he didn't read the names. It's 300 You can't read 300 names, right? What a fucking joke. I remember when DSP first got gifted subs on Twitch and he didn't read the names. And me, because I'm fucking special and I have to read everything, I guess. I was like, why don't he read all the names? He get all the names. Shout out to you, read me the name. And like now he gets like 20 gifted members and he read 20 names. But then if he get 50, he don't read 50 names. And it's like, if you read 20 because you get 20, you might as well read 50 if you get 50 because of the same reason. Is it not going to be, is it going to not be fun to read 50 fucking names? Probably not. But, you know, we, we pre-K teachers for a reason. We have to, we have a lot of kids in the class. That's not the case. Uh, I never really have this <laughs> many viewers. It. You I don't, don't want to read me if names. it's legit or not because no one's really taking credit for it. Which and he definitely didn't want to read, he didn't want to read 300 names. But he used to not read them at all. And now he reads them like almost all the time. But I think he read them all the time because he know he get. Well, not even like it. It don't take much thinking to understand DSP and anyone else get less gifted members than they would have gotten gifted subs. I don't fucking know why it's less money to gift a member in DSP's chat, but it's less people that want to be a part of the YouTube yeah, economy, I guess. Like, it's people that watch them that probably are willing to spend money. Like, Swaggins. Swaggins still there. Maybe Swaggins spending like five grand on some random fucking arts and crafts streamer. And maybe he just don't want to spend money on YouTube. That's how it be sometimes, dude. Um, about it, I would hope that no one's trying to pull something, you know, but we'll see what happens Imagine if but DSP i was warned mixer. my wife just in case i said Holy. be diligent if you hear something call he told cat to be diligent if you hear some wait wait i wish i could make the volume louder this is already loud as it could be what the hell is going on here i mean we'll see i don't know who raided me if it's legit or not because no one's really taking credit for it which makes me kind of suspicious um about it i would hope that no one's trying to pull something you know but We'll see what happens, but I already warned my wife just in case. I said, be, be diligent if you hear something. Be diligent, cat. Something, call me, you know. If you hear something, call me. Uh, he's asking for help from the wrong person. <laughs> Big ups, me, my. Oh, man. Have a good, have a good night. Everybody in the chat, post bedtime emojis and moon emojis and sleeping emojis for me, my underscore. Who knows what's going on? I hope it's just innocent and it's not something fucked up. I don't know what that segment was, like this was from yes, DSP. In the past, I've had horrible things Get happen Kat to me. Get Cat to call him. And I can't, Kat, know, I to always be a Kat's more. gonna know something going on before DSP, dude. How? Worried about it, but it is what it is. She's you gonna know something going now, on in his world you know, before he knows what's going on. You know, it's not something This shit crazy. Uh, you know. Hey, it's oh, Nova. Right? Nova and Forza. <clears throat> okay. You had the perfect time. What, do I, what am I on two, about? Uh, pretty terrible things have happened. I had two Jose Cuervo shots. Uh, I got a level six hype train. First time it ever happened over here, dude. DSP got 4,000 likes, basically. Like 5,000 views. And 300 gifted members. He had a really weird stream. Put me and my family. Let's just put it that way. Let's okay? just put it that way. Okay. I might take um, another shot, a half shot. So let's see. But Trill only if Nova one. says yes. If Nova uh, say yeah, remember, I'll take another shot. Months, it says congratulations, Phil. Thank you, Trill. Only if Nova say so. On, but thank you. And I got and an Dark unboxing. Chris, just, it's a very uh, special unboxing. A when he starts the game, Chris, I'll do it. I appreciate that. Because I'm like way behind on okay. watching this bullshit anyway. Um, I received a dollar twenty. I was gonna just like watch. When did this really start? Realistically, when did DSP free stream start? One p.m. my time. 
It's 5 p.m. my time now. I just thought he was going to complain about trolls and say he needed money and then beg and then say what game he was going to play. And it's turned into the weirdest fucking DSP pre-stream ever. If I didn't watch this, somebody was going to tell me about this later today and I was going to be annoyed. Hip. What the fuck was this pre-stream? <laughs> he says maybe Emerald 7 sent them. Emerald I'm 7. I'm pretty sure it's not Emerald 7. In Why isn't it Emerald 7? I haven't heard of him in many years. And what? Battle Duck just re-upped his membership. Thank you, Battle Duck. Oh my god, you can give him a lot of money and not even be mean to him after, and he just assumed you don't watch anymore anyway. Just because you didn't give him more money after that. Holy fuck. Whatever, dude. Whatever. Whatever. Big ups, Griggy Gob. You heard the perfect time. I was just saying how I ended up watching this for way too long. I mean, DSP didn't expect this free stream to be what it was either. Obviously. Uh, that was I gonna do? Oh yeah. I'm taking another take shot because of Nova. The first shot was because of Monk Mosh Pit. They had the birthday I'm redeem. Lurking. I had to go next door to get some Jose Cuervo. So now I'm you about to get some more. Uh, I got a special, uh, super secret, unique, robust unboxing. I could show you the box. I can be that guy. Don't don't get too hype. It's not gonna be like something I can send to you but it's something I'm going to open on stream because I got it in the mail during the stream. Like I say, oh fuck, I meant to mute the mic. I just threw the mic down. <laughs> I meant to push the button to mute the mic. Anyway, that's the box. That's the box I'm gonna unbox. So it is a real box. I actually got it. Uh, but I'm going to fix the shot. We're taking a Nova Enforcer shot. So give me a second. All right, we're going to get started. All right, guys. I was in a video of the most hated YouTubers. Do you have any idea how many videos I'm in like that? Like, I think there was just a, one the other day, too. Someone said something about I mean, I'm in those videos like every fucking day. <laughs> like, no exaggeration. I'm in a countdown of the most hated, the worst YouTubers, the, the biggest jerks every day. I'm in one of those videos. And every day, it just reiterates the same nonsense on the internet that's not true about me. Literally, none of them ever have anything new to add or say. They're all just baloney. Okay. Yes, we're over 700 subs, Derek. Welcome to the stream. We had a crazy raid, and then we had a bunch of gifted subs. So, all right. So I'm about to get started. All right, guys. Hope if, I know many of you probably are, are are bots or were raiders or whatever. If some of you would like to stick around, I'd, it would be great. Watch me play some games today. See what you think. If you hate it, you hate it. It's fine. Just thanks for coming by. Now, I'll say this up front. Supporting this stream, how can you do it? If you like what you see today, liking the stream helps. We have over a thousand likes. This is the most liked video I've had probably ever on YouTube. I'm not even kidding. And probably the most liked stream I'll ever have. So liking this stream would help. Um, we already just got a ridiculous amount of memberships. So we're pretty set there. If anyone else wants to become a member, by all means, that would help. Um, today, tipping me would be tremendous. Uh, to help me afford all of the games coming out in the next few weeks that I have to buy for the channel. So tipping today would help tremendously if anyone wants to do it. If you tip a certain amount, like $4.20 or more, I actually play a nice animation and I give you a shout out on the stream. All the tips we just got are like a dollar, which is why you haven't seen any animation at your tip because they're all been small, too small for that. But just so you know, um, that would be a great way to support the stream today if you liked it, okay? Just if you like it, all right? Thank you. Now, in the meantime, let's get started. The music is loud right now. Lower it I don't know why it got so loud. Here we go. A burden of blood. Well, vests are eligible today. We hit $150 in tips, all of them. It's very cool today. I can wear any vest, no limitation. So, you want to see a ridiculous vest today? Today would be the day for you. 
this one self, but said I could have gone back out. Mark says Carl did a super chat to people saying Papa Lou sent them. I'm fairly certain it was not Papa Lou. But thank you, Mark says Carl. Fairly certain it was not Papa Lou. <laughs> okay. And sorry for the, the late start, guys. Obviously, this crazy raid was unexpected. And uh, now we're going to start. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Plague Tale Requiem, a game that is a sequel to an indie game from some years ago that I actually really enjoyed and was blown away at how good it was. Um, the sequel so far is quite Quite good. The graphics are ridiculously good for what it is. Like I didn't expect the game to look this good. It looks gorgeous on the Xbox Series X. Uh, last time around, we had just escaped the city, and we're on the look. I think we're going looking for nightshade or something like that. You know, your brother sadly has the uh, sickness coming back to him that allows him to control rats, and. So we're I come back and I hear Sonic and him. my right now, voice. The members of the order is treating him. Yeah, whatever, I don't know what was right? going on. So we're going to continue on where we left off. I accidentally left my, my speakers on. Hold on, let me turn that off. I missed him saying and something, so I got to rewind a little bit. Do it. If you like what you see today, liking the... Hmm? All right, guys, about what's going Those on. Fucking stops. Just intentions behind it. I should say this up front, everyone. Obviously, I hope that's not the case. Uh, I never really have this many viewers. I don't know okay, who made it, if it's legit them. or not. Because no one's really I was about to call them the Which bots. makes me kind of suspicious um, about it. I would hope that no one's trying to pay what things happened to me. And I, um, pretty terrible things have happened to me and my family. Let's just put it that way. Okay? Okay, Can't let me know if something's um, going on. Let me know if the ops outside. So let's see. Trill one. Trill one. I uh, became a member for 13 months. It says, congratulations, Phil. Thank I have you, a Trill different one. shot glass. You're congratulating me on. But thank you. We got and the Darkside Chris Mexico just, uh, became brand? a member. Shot glass. Thank you, Darkside Chris. I appreciate Exclusively that. Okay. Or Jose Corvo. Um, I received a dollar twenty-three tip. Who says maybe Emerald Seven sent them? I don't like. I think there was just a, one the other day too. Someone said something about. I mean, I'm in those videos like every fucking. Day. Oh, like, this. Emerald Seven involved here. Remember the video I when I was like, yeah, he's, he's gonna like, fucking complain about being made us. fun of in that video. We're gonna get. He didn't. And now he's downplaying it a couple of days later. So I guess that's him talking about it. I hear you're a friend of. Unfortunate. Well, they can follow. Ups, uh, uh, lyrical miracle. Thanks for following Leo. Starting. All right, guys. Oh yeah. Any idea how many videos I? Okay, this is it. I was in a video of the most hated YouTubers. Do you have any idea? It wasn't how many a video about like most that? hated YouTubers. Like I think it was, it was just a, one else. of the other day. Someone said else. something about. I mean, I'm uh, maybe it was. Like every and he was in the something else. <laughs> like the no something else is the Sunny D whatever the video. Most hated, the worst Bro, YouTubers. like the okay, I get it. He's trying to downplay it, but that video got three million fucking views within like a day. Within like a fucking day. The fact that he didn't talk about that and he talked about fucking tweets that get 6,000 likes and he act like his life was affected by it, it makes no logical sense. It actually just makes no logical sense. But I guess you can say, well, according to him, he's putting one of those every day. So that's why he don't care because it happened every day. But some negative idiot shithead make fun of him every day. And he still complain about that every day. The, the biggest jerks oh. every day. I, mean, I think he tried videos. to throw us. And forward. every day, it just reiterates the same every nonsense day, on the internet. DSP think about, about how the trolls are going to react to whatever. Literally, none of them do. ever have anything new to add or say. It's on the internet. That's not true. Was this what Dingus was talking about? Daily, oh, daily no, quest, ready to turn in. Play none of game them pass, ever have anything mind. new to add or say. It was some shit. Uh, Dingus said about okay. Game Pass. Yes, we're over 700 subs, Derek. Welcome to the stream. We had a crazy raid, and then we had a bunch of gifted subs. So, all right. So I'm about to get started. All right, guys. Hope if I know many of you probably are, are, are bots or raiders out. or whatever. I had the camera. If I was some like... of you would like to stick around. Yes, Derek. We have over right. 700 so members now. Watch and play some games today. See what you think. If you hate it, you hate it. It's fine. Just thanks for coming by. Now, I'll say this up front. Supporting this stream, how can you do it? If you like what you see today, liking the stream helps. We have over a thousand likes. This is the most liked video I've had probably ever on YouTube. I'm not even he kidding. He got like and a probably lot the of most likes, likes stream I'll ever have. So liking the stream. What a would weird help. stream. Um, 
We already just got a ridiculous amount of memberships. So, we're pretty set there. We can't Anyone ask else for wants that. To become a member, by all means, that would help. But please tip um, me because today, my day off tomorrow. Today, would be tremendous. Uh, to help me afford all of the games coming out in the next few weeks that I have to buy for the channel. So tipping today would help tremendously if anyone wants to do it. If you tip a certain amount, like $4.20 or more, I actually play a nice animation and I give you a shout out on the stream. So all the tips we just got are like a dollar, which is why you haven't seen any animations for tips because they're all really small. You like amount, the like fucking music, by the way? Nice actual loud music. I actually play a nice animation and I give you a shout out on the stream. All the While tips we just got are like a money. dollar, which is why you haven't seen any animations for tips because they're all been small. We should have saw some animations for the so 300 know. gifted um, members. We saw no notifications. That would be a great way to support the stream today if you like to. For 300 gifted just members. Just if you like to. All right? Wow. Thank you. Now, in the meantime... Holy shit, start. that's heartbreaking. That makes me so Maybe sad. As a streamer, it breaks my heart to see somebody get 300 gifted something and not even 50 of them get a notification. Man. It's like the second EDVOD name drop during a stream. But I remember one stream, she got, well, she she always get a lot of gifted subs. I'm jealous. But one day she got like a lot, a lot of gifted subs. And it was the same notification over and over and over and over and over and over and over. It played maybe like 80 times and she wanted to turn it off. I don't think she turned it off. I don't remember. But could you imagine? My God, it hurts me like extra like extra in a specific way. 300 oh, fucking subs. Lower 300 lower members. No, no notifications. What vests are eligible today if we hit $150 in tips? No one. It's very cool today. I can wear any vest. Bro, you no should wear a fucking vest if you get 300 gifted members. You should put on a vest for that. Do you want to see a ridiculous vest? He's not going to do anything today special. Day for it. That's great. Oh, man, man, man. And this dude tried to make Morris fun of review text for having default notifications. Papa Lou sent here. them. I'm fairly certain Papa it was not Papa Lou. But thank so that's you, what Marcus people Carl. was talking about. I saw people say Papa Lou name in his chat, and I was like, wait, what? Fairly certain. Papa, Papa Lou's Lou. here? <laughs> the real Papa Lou. Okay. The authentic one. And Named sorry for the, Papa the late Lou. start, guys. Obviously, this crazy raid was unexpected. And uh, I wonder how long the podcast really was. I'm calling it a podcast and being nice. Here we go. Four hours. Mm. Uh, All right, ladies and well, gentlemen, welcome back to Plague Tale Requiem, a game that is the sequel hour and to 50 a game from a few years ago. Probably an hour really and 40 minutes. Was blown away so, how good it was. Uh, um, a little tiny so bit far longer is quite good. than a normal the graphics daily are ridiculously podcast good for thing. what it is. Like, I didn't this? expect the game to look like chat. I swear we're going to play the game at some point. We really are. I swear. Cherry jeans. Hey, anonymous okay. with the twenty dollars. So we got. The all rest. right. So, since all the bots are gone, CFP. wow. All right, we had our fun with the raiders. I'm gonna turn it back on to sub only mode now, and then we're gonna get started. All right. You, all right. Sub only mode is now re-enabled. If you would like to chat, you need to become a subscriber for 24 hours or more. Okay. Did I take the shot? I didn't take That's the shot yet. Big up, Nova. You hear it at the perfect time. I don't know if you're right. So that way we avoid We're trolls a and, and, and bot accounts that Good insult God. and do messed up things and try to get me in trouble on YouTube. So there, trolls, there you go. Bots, I just got another dollar tip. Real tip. people that want to say dumb stuff or something. So basically, you they were bots the whole time. They they were bots the whole time. Uh, oh, by the way, I forgot to talk, to talk, do the animation. What about the likes then? Earlier. Here it is. There we go. He basically bragged about so the amount of likes. Another dollar tip from But if they're not real. Uh, fucking don't even bring it up. Congrats on a successful priest. Just let it be a thing. He says, Seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all things shall be added unto you. A biblical quote. Yeah, one whole 24 hours is Thank a you lot. to the anonymous. And the thing is, the if you want to troll, obviously support. you just come back the next day when yeah. he stream at the same time. Come on, man. The dude streams have a fucking schedule. He might as well make it two Paige or three hours. Super Fuck it. My friend's Justin's dog Roxy told her friend. I, I have no idea what that means. But thank you for the super chat. Okay, his first stream is basically six hours. He should make it three hours. To okay. Talk to chat. Are we ready to start? Finally. And that way you <laughs> can, can make start playing? Next two accounts. I've been sitting here for every ten stream. minutes. All right. So we have, have to sub on both. just escaped the city. Okay. We were going out now he's playing the game. He's living in life. He says, reach the, the way he wants forest. to live. So we're it. trying to find the herbalist. Loving it. Um, 
All right. But we the bats are gone. They had their now. fun. Oh. <laughs> here. The I mean, he got nothing to sleep, probably. Thank you to believe when we only have 345 votes for the hat. I got really lucky skipping ahead. Lot of counts I got really lucky skipping ahead to him complaining about this. Back in the old days, like the dark, the dark ages, it used to be a way to get people banned on Twitch was to view by them. That's us. Listen, like the person would be getting viewed by it against their fire. will, and they would get banned. I'll tell you when I'm ready. Imagine. They didn't search them and take their shit. Getting in what? trouble. They threw because them in the cell. Didn't like search them. Positively supporting you, I guess. Waiting. <laughs> I don't know about that. That's pretty lame. All right, so here's the deal. But it's like not positive. You We've know what got I mean. The but I don't think DSP gonna get in voted, trouble. Which is the fine. gifted okay. members guy, I'm pretty. But, it's not you know, a fake guy. It's just the dude with a lot of money. Imagine years. not having a lot of money. Very hard to believe. It's a bunch of broke when boys in chat. They don't understand. The hat. They don't know how it is to have enough money to be able to give 300 members to DSP. So they're thinking they're like, oh man, he must like be a bank robber. That's it. And uh, the likes. And the weird views, I mean, you know, it's only one stream. Nobody, nobody really cares. But could you imagine if he got in trouble for this? He will complain forever. Actually, forever. That makes me believe that bot accounts right. cannot vote, right? Bot Maybe he shouldn't go out of his way to say it's bots, in a stream though. Poll. So, I hate to say it. Out of Especially if he viewers, literally don't know. It's off just kind of dumb. The sub-only mode. And all of a sudden, uh, no one was talking. That was kind of weird. He pretended no like people were. No one took credit for the raid. And now, right? Right. I, I have a poll and only 358 votes on a stream with 4,000 people. Nice. Leads me to believe this is baloney. Oh, so, my God. I'm not really going to worry about it anymore. I'm just going to continue on like this is a normal stream. They've been written off. I don't off. think that this is legit at all. I think someone Hopefully he never tried to talk about this again. Today and try to get some attention like if you get 5,000 views you don't uh, see oh the most views i ever had this was 5,000 because now it's dead of how we've confirmed it i'd love to hear it but it certainly sounds like a bunch of baloney to me it's baloney um, baloney confirmed but in the meantime let's get the bender hat on and i'm gonna have to close let's my window because now i can hear the landscapers coming <laughs> you could probably hear it getting louder actually, and louder actually the dumbest hat okay the bender hat there's absolutely no way that someone who's a newcomer to my stream has the ability to choose a ridiculous hat would not be voting on it. That's baloney. So I don't think that these are real accounts. I hate to say it. Um, He's really ego boosting that hard. He's like, man, there's no way somebody wouldn't want to vote on making me put on a vendor hat. So they have to be non-human if they don't want to take part of this. If they don't want to partake in the, the hat voting ceremony, they must not be a human. Big ups. It makes sense. Oh, uh -uh. it okay. makes sense. There's absolutely no way that someone who's a newcomer to my marked one. You literally missed everything. In a nutshell, uh, DSP got four thousand likes on his stream. He had five thousand views. He went down to like three hundred. He called everybody bots at the end of it. Uh, he told them to like the video, and that's how we got the likes. Uh, he got 300 plus gifted members, so he's definitely hit his member goal. He got 814 members now. 814 members. Yeah, this is a really specific DSP free stream. I just thought he was gonna complain about trolls and call people stupid and do the stuff he always do, and I was gonna be like actually asleep by now, or just doing something else and playing like streams from 2015 but this turned out to be You're the most degenerate. suspicious dsp pre-stream probably ever without actual drama you know what it is it's the most suspicious dsp pre-stream ever without actual drama he got no copyright strikes he didn't talk about chargebacks he just got a bunch of money a bunch of views like look at this this is the remnants at least three point you can't see it. Uh, hold on. 3.7K likes. And at one point, he had 5,000 views. The most I saw him having was 4,000 because I didn't tab out enough or whatever. But he had 5,000 views. 
And he was like, oh, somebody raided. Who raided? No one wants to take credit. Guys, I'm turning off sub-only mode. If anyone speaks up, we'll know they're not bots. Nobody spoke up. But he acted like people did. I got pignosis by him because I wasn't looking at the chat and I was an hour behind. I was just listening to him talk. And he's telling me that people was talking. And then 10 minutes later, he's like, oh, no one was talking. So I guess they're all bots. What? <laughs> so he got raided allegedly or he had a bunch of bots that he didn't want allegedly. But he also got a bunch of likes right after he said, give me likes if you're not a bot. But then nobody talked when he said to talk. But regardless, he got a bunch of fucking gifted subs, uh, gifted members from Team Ico Gamer. And I'm pretty sure this dude didn't like, you know, this is a real person. 300 fucking something members. And on top of that, the whole time he was getting the gifted members, he didn't even really react to them. He was like, oh, 50 members, but oh man, these must be bots. Oh, 50 members, but who rated the stream? He was actually more concerned about what he was calling fake people than a real person spending a fucking paycheck on his dumbass channel. And you know that dude's forgotten about now. When DSP come back Friday and he's 100 members down, he's going to only talk about how he's 100 members down. You're a fucking degenerate. Team Ico Gamer's dead to us. 300 fucking gifted members in one day. Why would you even be that stupid? Why would you even do that in DSP's channel? Just do that. Don't, don't do that anywhere. Whatever, man. It wasn't even any fun. He didn't get any notifications or anything. It sucked. It actually sucked. There's absolutely no I've never way seen somebody get 300 so gifted something and it was that, lit, like, not fun. So many times I open up random, like, subathons of people I don't even follow and then see the whole chat light up. It's like, oh, shit, let's fucking go. You see 15 notifications and shit. This dude, he get 300 gifted members and he's like, oh, thanks. But I don't know if these are bots watching. Man, get the fuck out of here, man. You know it's not a bot that gave you 300 gifted members. Fucking talk to this dumbass. He was talking to bots. He was talking to bots. He's a newcomer to my stream. And if he wasn't talking to bots, to a ridiculous well, I mean, they're all gone and he called That's them bullying. bots. So I don't so, think that these are real accounts. Lost. I hate to say it. Oh. It's okay, though. But it is what it is. <laughs> At least he, I, got, I can't... he got the vendor hat. Nat attacks just resubbed for nine months. Hello guys, Nine I'm months. gonna need Prom. help since Kit is getting too slammed to the wall out and everything and that's my wife. Thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up, please. I gotta read so the beginning of this. Work I'm gonna need best. your help uh -huh. since Kit is getting goose slammed. Booba all out and everything? Oh yeah, he had this one part too. When he, damn I wish I could rewind to it. He basically was like, I talked to Kit and I told her to let me know if something's going on. The way he worded it was really weird. He said it like Kat is another content creator and like she's checking Twitter all day and shit. This lady don't even have a fucking anything. She don't even have an anything. Uh, this is a weird free stream. Really, really weird free stream. Just watch it on like 1.25 speed. Control it, you know. There's funny business that happens on YouTube that can't that's be That's not a lot. Right? Dude. And, uh... Cats, you know, oh my, as a content creator, you put up God. with it. There's nothing I can do about it. <laughs> Panda used to be a mod. Look how that worked out. Cat don't even want to admit to being in the chat when she's in the chat. Because she allegedly watch sometimes behind the scenes in the shadows. And then she cry when people talk about him jerking off. Oh, yeah. And we also did two shots marked one one shot was for a birthday redeem for a monk mosh pit and the second shot was Casanova, i think i thought it was a third one no the third one is happening Casanova. the second one was because of roderick that's it so we're gonna take a third shot i got some jose purple and I still have an unboxing to do. I got a really big uh, special box. And at this point, I might as well open it. So I'm going to take a shot and do the special unboxing. So if you have, hopefully you have your bottled water ready, your Coca-Cola, and uh, what else? your Diet Pepsi, your Sprite, whatever. I gotta change this camera. I got the Mexico 
the Mexico shot glass now. And it looks pretty good, dude. Except this reverse. If you're here, post some A's, some L of G's, and some... Uh, you better take a sip. I don't think it's the third thing. You better take a sip. Okay, we you dedicate the shot to Monk Mosh Pit, no Van Forcer, A Gang, something you better take a sip. Cameras 95, uh, Derpy, take a sip. Strawberry Knight, the low on the score, Broken Mail Man. You better take a sip. Mark 1, Snorlax, Heal Deer Studios. You better take a sip. Robos, Leo Kira, base shot, and everybody. Else. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let's fucking go. You better take a sip. This is why I, this is why I needed the Coca Cola. The shots get too spicy. It's feeling like a a Tevin stream from ten months ago. All right, so. <laughs> the extra shot streams. Yep. All right, lyrical, miracle. Thank you for the prompt. First time. You only get one of those every month, dude. So big ups to the positive. All right, we gotta do this box. Okay, I know what I can do. I got changed my microphone when I open it. You should be able to hear me. I'm using the other microphone, which might sound a lot closer to that. Basically, how can I word it? The shots make me dumber than I already am. I'm pretty sure the mic worked really good compared to what it used to work as because of what do you hook mics into I don't know the thing the thing the mic hooked into I don't know the mic might sound bad now and the, yeah that's it it's not, that's not that either I can't think of it man mixer Mixer might work out. I'm gonna call it a mixer. The mixer that I'm hooking a microphone into is the same. And I think it's fixing the audio a lot. Cause this mic is like actually 20 or 30 dollars and I bought it like 10 years ago. And when I hook it up to my DJ equipment, it don't sound that good. And my DJ equipment you know, it's not uh, cheap. I'm just opening the box on my leg. All right, we got a box. It's a pretty big box. It's a super special uh, thing that I got. Basically, it's like an adoption. I adopted an electronic item. You may be wondering what the hell I'm getting at. But you'll know within the next 20 seconds. And then you'll be like, wait, why you bought that? Don't you already have one? Okay. Do you know what this is, you guys? Do you know what this is? It's big as fuck. I got a suspicious Xbox 360. It can sell a piece, if you know what I mean. It was extremely cheap on eBay. The disk drive does not work. So basically, it's front. This is the funny thing about it. The disk drive doesn't work. It's like it's front declawed. That's the, this thing gonna catch on fire in three days.
I've been lurking and stalking for a super cheap 360 that could do uh, illegal activities. And this is the one. We got the memory card slots in the front and everything. Whoa, man. It's kind of fire how good hardware-wise the 360 is. You got, even on this one, you got the AV, HDMI, Ethernet, USB, two USBs on the front, and then you got the controller separate from the USB? No, the controller is the USB. They went wild with the other models, the other models though. They put like three USBs on the back. Whoa, dude. An Xbox 360 hard drive. Y'all know y'all can uh, put a laptop hard drive in these? If you go back to 2005 and buy a 360 and get like a 20 gig hard drive and get a laptop hard drive and just put it inside of that, it basically worked. It basically just worked. And you save like a million dollars. Anyway, that was basically what I had to unbox. I got a JTAG 360. It's not a JTAG 360. I say JTAG because I'm in fucking 2006 still. It's a RH, RGH 360. So I can illegally download games. Allegedly. I, I can play homebrew games and make my own games easier. <laughs> That's what I can do. So I can't wait to take advantage of those capabilities. And I already have a controller and stuff. A little bit longer, um, Obviously. And I'm going to go on a break. My break of the stream. My only break of the stream. Um, and then it was so cheap. It was like a no-brainer, man. Well, let's go a little bit longer here and see what happens. I've been waiting like months to find one for super cheap. I didn't want to really get uh, an older Model 360. But at the same time, it's kind of funny to have an older Model one. And it could be worse. As far as the model I got, I'm a scientist, so I know the differences between Xbox 360 models. Sadly, it is not a Jasper model. I think it's a Falcon. Yeah. Fuck, I forget. But it's not Jasper though. Everybody know the Jasper is the good one. And then you get to the Slims and that's when you don't care anymore. But somebody's like, yeah, Tevin, I know what you're talking about. Them. It's a 360 scammer in the chat right now. They've been pirating all their life. See, Leo Kira, no. They're a professional pirate. I can't wait to play great games like Crackdown 2. Crackdown 2 might be on Xbox One, I don't even know. I already have Crackdown 1. But it's definitely some amazing games I can play. Like Dodon Pachi. And uh, all the other shoot 'em ups that cost like $100 to buy. I could play shoot 'em ups all day. Let's fucking go. Now, the 360 didn't die. The 360 still alive. I got a suspicious 360 to play illegal games. In layman's terms, it was like sixty dollars, and it's probably gonna break in two years. Good thing they're young and nimble. And it don't read it don't read this either. Like it just don't. Have a view. Look at this. Gorgeous. Why was someone selling Xbox that doesn't read CDs? It's kind of suspicious. But I'll be able to play amazing games like Lost Odyssey without spending seventy dollars. I bought my fair share of three sixty games in the last two years. I think they're whispering even though they've already been detected. All right, Kagome, I'm sorry you will not be here tonight. Hopefully I'll see you later, Kagome. Coben, did you miss the guy getting like seven billion gifted members? It was ridiculous. He had so much fun today. 
But it's a bunch of games I could play on a 360 without needing, like if I don't need to buy the games, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> if I don't need to buy the games? It's like a billion games. I could play I Am Alive again. I never streamed I Am Alive. I do want to play that game. What happened here? What is he doing? Maybe this is a bathroom break. So That is amazing. Um, I guess real quick before we go on a break, let me look at what three we have. 3360s all stock, but all special. One, one is the Blades Dash, the other NXC, and uh, um, one was manufactured on your birthday. On this fucking dude. We what we can add. Okay. The collect the next box is based on a manufacturing date. <laughs> Let's take a quick look. I don't know why 360s are so weird. When it comes to everything, there's so many models and manufacturing dates and just everything. They were having fun. Microsoft was just trying to protect the customer. They didn't want you to spend $400 and then have the system break while you were playing Skyrim. No, not even Skyrim. You were playing fucking Morrowind. No. Oblivion, yeah, 360 Oblivion. What is this dude doing? It's a weird segment. I'm confused. And look, he's doing a thing. He's like yelling in the background. <laughs> Whatever. When he come back, he always explain to us. Thankfully, see, this is the thing. Oddly, like in this weird, really, really specific way, making fun of DSP literally changed the day he went back to YouTube. Because if you watch him on a YouTube stream, because like he can change his sentence to make it, to make, uh, to force you to have to watch him live. Thankfully, he's not doing that because he's a nice guy. But you can rewind and skip forward and pause and all kind of shit. And when he was on Twitch, you couldn't do that. Yes. For a while. I added Devour. Oh, that was the emo change. Nice. Now we haven't used it in a long time, but there you go. So, so we have some old Twitch emotes, emotes back. Primarily because of Team Ico Gamer. DSP Jesus Shot, Christ, bro. DSP Devour. All right. Basically, at this point. There's some real, like, level one shit. He gets 300 gifted members. And then he says, okay, you guys, I got to add some emotes. He adds the emotes and that emotes he had like two fucking, three fucking, four fucking, five fucking years ago. DSP shot? Bro, you don't even drink on your streams. You might as well have a fucking DSP joint emote. What the fuck? Point. We now have pretty much all... Of the emotes. He's not gonna make new emotes to commission new emotes. That would be ridiculous. DSP doesn't have any money. So we bring back some old shit. DSP shot. What's no, bad? DSP drinking on the stream is a troll meme. He never drinks on stream. Twitch. There's very few that we don't have, and the ones that we were that we weren't that we don't have are he kinda seasonal. thanked them. Like I used to have seasonal ones for Halloween. He was more worried about that I would rotate if out. He had bots um, watching or not though. So that dude legit never got attention for gifting like, three hundred yeah, members. It was about a year and a half. Um but we did it. Feels we bad, got man. back to the point where we were on Twitch where we have all those standard emotes unlocked again for everybody. Okay? If you've been watching this on demand on I feel like I could give I'm talking with food in my mouth. I feel like I could give XQ, XQC like five subs and I get more attention than that dude got for gifting 300 subs to DSP. Like, what the fuck, man? XQC gets 75,000 views a stream. So obviously, I'm trying to make a point here. YouTube, obviously, I apologize. This video XQC is going to be like, wait. No, XQC, he going like, to act like how that VTuber act. Fuck. You, you have no idea how much I wish I could just go to Marked One stream or... Uh, yeah, Dingus didn't watch it. Now that I think about it, I told Dingus to watch it too. His bitch ass ain't watch it. <laughs> you have no idea how much I want to go to Mark Twin stream to find that part where you watch the, the VTuber like putting me over. That's how it's going to be when I go to XQC stream. I'm going to go to his stream and give him five subs. He's going to say, What the fuck? Oh my God. Almighty Tevin's here? 
What? Let's fuck. He's going to pop the fuck off. What's going on? The, all the view bots are gone now. They've all left. Um, so we're back to normal. Thank you so much, everyone, for the support during this video. You know, I'm going to go on a break. Come back. Hopefully, I didn't see that clip again. and, like, cool. feel weird. Because I literally right. named it for so, Dingus. Yes, it's definitely time for a break. And it was them wigging the fuck okay. out when I showed up. They're like, babe, babe, all my time is here. All my time is here. Oh, my God. Tevin, my fiance loves your streams. Tevin's in the chat right now. Babe, he's here right now. It was great. I felt so special. It's definitely time for a break. Let's take about a 15 to 20 minute break. It was a when five minute back, segment dedicated to me. Video. All right. Thank you all for chilling with me. They told me about how their fiance loved my streams. Back with more, all right? And how they'll be like, um, they might be watching right now. If they're watching right now, we lost. They, were, uh, they told me about how their fiance liked my streams. And uh, they were obsessed with me. And how they would be like, just, just watching. Watching my streams. In the, in the corner of the room. And doing other stuff on a computer. Basically acting like dingus. <laughs> yeah, super fan, that's it. That's it. It was a uh, pretty fun, uh, a super chill time. But I'm sad the clip gone. Feels bad, man. I I'm gonna go back in time and watch it on Mark's stream and clip it out of his stream, and then watch it on my own computer in my spare time to make myself feel special. Holy 30 minute break. I like how the 30 minute break never seemed like it's okay. Oh, so much stuff going on. The Silent Hill event ended. Even if Man, like guys know, other so, streams take 30 Silent minute Hill breaks two, because they don't Hill tell you it's a 30 three. minute break. It don't seem as annoying. Graphics look great. <laughs> we don't have a release date for it yet, but it looks good. Um, <laughs> this dude fucking sucks. Spoiling the Silent Hill news, he blows. What a bad person. The fact that he went out of his way to tell us, like, okay, I know we don't like Konami or whatever the fuck, but the fact that he went out of his way to basically tell us that they didn't formally announce it and that he's gonna talk about it. It's like, I wish he would have just straight up said, like, yeah, it's pretty funny, right, that they didn't even talk about it and I'm gonna talk about it. Because it seemed like it's just, it's just a negative, weird segment. Like, he's like stealing views from him almost. Not really caring about it. He's it stealing views happen. from Konami. No. And I wouldn't lose anything because I wasn't getting any anyway. Konami bro is a BTFO. You know. Don't so, support idiots next time. There you go. Um, there you go. You know, support the bender hat. I don't condone it at all. Wait, what is he talking about? Like, like murder? You get bots all the time. Oh, bots. Uh, by, by, I don't know if it was trolls or whoever. But it was weird because my subs would go up and then all of a sudden YouTube would announce they're going to do an audit and I would always lose like tens of thousands of subscribers in a chunk all at once. So it was obviously huh? um, something that was very common back in the day when I was focused on YouTube. Then I, when? I when? My streamer, when the fuck uh, DSP the lost tens of thousands, thousands of subs? Not really caring about it. It didn't really happen anymore. When? Because I went out of my way a few days ago and specifically said how... People always try to cope and say DSP is going to lose a bunch of subs because of uh, like YouTube deleting accounts. And I specifically say how I never saw DSP lose accounts. I never saw anybody lose accounts that way, honestly. I'm sure it happened, but it ain't happening to people I watch or people I look at the fucking sub count for. But now apparently it happened. When the fuck DSP lose 2,000 views, uh, 2,000 subs? When it happened? On YouTube, as I told you back in the day, DSP Gaming used to get bots all the time. Uh, by, by, I don't know if it was true Bro, or whatever. What? It was weird because my... It's like he's making up a bad thing about himself. And why would you do that? But I'm thinking to myself, I don't remember ever seeing this. I've never seen DSP lose thousands of subs. Ever. Subs would go up, and then all of a sudden YouTube would announce they're going to do an audit. And I would always lose like... Oh my god, man, I never found a clip. There's got to be. It's literally no point he would post marked one, like, a link like this. It's the fucking clip. <laughs> I wanted to find this for fucking William the Alchemist originally. <laughs> but you get the point. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> Shut up! This this made me really happy. I was down in the dumps and bombed out. 
And I showed up to somebody's stream and it was like, oh my god, Tevin, you're so fucking cool. Tevin, oh my god, babe. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Tevin! Oh my god! Babe! Babe, look who's in my chat! Hey, look who's in the chat! Tevin's in the chat! Babe, look who's in my chat! Hi, Tevin! How are you? Look at this VTuber model! <laughs> she was say hi, Tevin. Look. My fiance watches you all the time! Yeah, it's actually Tevin! <laughs> <laughs> the He's a celebrity! Tevin. He's a celebrity, bro! Well, I told you! Everyone loves you! He's a celebrity! What the fuck? Hi! How are you? Welcome in! My fiance's obsessed! He's obsessed! <laughs> Look at the VTuber <laughs> model! <laughs> Well, what's up now? Let's go! Enjoy Look your at this VTuber model! How you doing? Yeah, who's the fiancé in the chat? Do we know? Do we- We do not know the fiancé. <laughs> Big up's mad at her. Oh, man. Tens of thousands that was such a such a fun moment for me. All at once. I just thought so they were going to be like, oh, what's up, Dan? They look at the stream, man. Something that was very common back in the day when I was focused <laughs> on They were like, oh, my God. Streamer, it's Devin. Uh, babe, change when I babe, babe, it's Devin. He's in the chat right now. It. it didn't really happen anymore. So then it'd be like, oh, we're going to do an audit, and I wouldn't lose anything. Yeah, that's it. Vauction. Vauction's the fiance. Imagine. I'm unfollowing and reporting. You know, I know nothing about it. I don't an really email and staff. Uh, you know, I hate it. I don't like the. I don't like fake uh, popularity at all. People are saying this is bothering them. The tag. So I'm just gonna take it so... off. So. <laughs> um, you know, I know nothing about it. Wait. I don't condone it at all. Uh, you know, I hate it. I don't like the. I don't like the, uh, popularity at all. People are saying this is. What them. a weird the segment. So I'm just take it off. Fuck the tag. The Futurama tag is bothering them. People say it's bothering them. The tag been on it for so long, though, man. Who's for idiot? so long. Who's this idiot? idiot? Get the fuck out, man. Whoa, what? Refund, what? what a dunce. Refund Get the what? fuck out. Refund what? Legit gifted memberships from a supporter. Somebody being cringe. <laughs> yes, you need to refund. Refund what? Here, I'll refund your ability. To refund your ban. Wait, what? what a Get banned. Complete idiot. All right, I got rid of this. And, uh, now we're gonna get started with gameplay again. Okay. I can't wait to compare the sounds my weird 360 make with my PS3. Because, no, you know, the slim. It makes like no sound. It's not my responsibility to release YouTube for bots. It's not. I'm a content creator. I make content. That's all I do. All right? You know what? That's a good point. He got 300 gifted members. Did 300 people even accept all of them? Oh man, you know I don't even think about that. Because if only 100 accepted, he don't even get all of the money though. Like he don't even get all the money, right? That's gross. This happened. The YouTube system is toxic. I don't know. I don't. It's your site. Obviously, That's what the bots were for. The dude bought bots and gifted members at the same time. I really feel no oh, shit. legit because I, I, I'm a content creator. I make content. That's all I do. All right. You know, if YouTube contacts me and is like, "Hey, did this happen?" And well, I'll tell them exactly what happened. Say, yeah, that's that. not gonna happen. YouTube not gonna ask you if you had site, bots, dude. Obviously, you, you know, people have this ability to do it on your site. You gotta fix it. But I don't. Yeah. I don't YouTube. Know YouTube's gonna ask DSP if he had bots, and he's gonna respond, "It's your fault. I had bots." <laughs> I really feel none of them He's being so game. weird about this. None of them just talk. move on. Just and move forward positively. When we had the poll for the hat, it's over with, dude. So I feel they were all bots. So it is what it is. And, you know, th th there's peaks and valleys. Uh, like I said back in the day on YouTube, when I focused on this channel, this channel used to go like this, where all of a sudden you have all these fucking views, all these uh, subs. And all of a sudden it would plummet again. Because what would happen is they would audit and they would delete all the, the fucking bot shit. You see? What the fuck? When did DSP get accounts deleted because of it were bots? So, I have no control over I ain't never seen it happen with his sub count, man. I've been looking at DSP sub counts since like 2015. Uh, if anything, when the fuck he got channels deleted? Out, right? What? When instead of making more progress in play Whatever, game, man. we lost a bunch of progress. Apparently, at one point, so DSP got a bunch of accounts taken off his sub count. 
Thank due you to bot really activity. Anyway. We have a but I never saw it. Members, 825, mostly due to Team Ico Gaming. Uh, thank you to everyone who super chatted. And of course, thank you to everyone who tipped. We're over $100 in tips. Now, we still have about an hour and 15, hour, 20 minutes left on the stream. If we get $150 in tips, you can vote for a vest and or a jersey. It would be great. Oh, uh, he Hit definitely got to have that on by now. Um, it would be great. Oh, look. He gets scroll. 300 gifted members. Bye. Okay. So I only talk about the views great to hit that, that would help and the tips. That would lock it's like he back. wants to ignore God the most positive Friday. part of the stream. You could tip today to support the stream, please do. Also, remember, there is a second stream tonight. It's the conclusion of Scorn. And then once Scorn is done... Um, no, I'm not doing think, X-Link. I know what it is, okay? but I'm not doing it. Fair enough. I barely play anything online. No way I want to play old Xbox stuff online. Friction to get the reaction. What? But we don't even know if it will go through. Too late for that. Okay. We're is this it. one dude? This he be in Frogger chat. We're doing it anyway. He stream like he 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 well, does what you're right talking about. Face, right? He play on the original oh. Xbox hardware oh. and play online oh. through X Link. Doesn't matter. <laughs> and he play up. like uh like Blinks and uh oh. the online version of that N64 game. Whatever that so game was, Con Great. the Conquer I got, game. I have to watch it. I have He's to. a very unique content creator. I have to watch all these new trailers and everything that have come out. I want to see what it's all about. I want to play a, you know, I about on the a bunch of shoot 'em ups on there the 360, though. The was out when we That's going to be my goal. Yeah, Suspicious shoot 'em ups and JRPGs. Because Microsoft really wanted to get the weebs at one point. And then they threw them all away. I could play Blue Dragon and Lost Odyssey. <laughs> Even though I already played Blue Dragon and Lost Odyssey before. But I didn't beat Blue No Lost Odyssey. Blue Dragon. I don't know. Alright, chapter four. I thought it was Protector's Duty. Yeah. Was I also a burden of blood. Chapter three complete. Very nice. Don't yeah, this game is extremely chill. A lot of talking and no background sound to the talking. So you got this weird echo because of his neck phones. If you listen to this with headphones on, you're gonna hit this, you're gonna hit his like light feedback to everything. It's adding a new layer of immersion. up here appreciate that josiah thank you mm, this is anyway. wow <laughs> so much he really sit on that pause menu sometimes huh? always got very good <laughs> very good <laughs> let me unblock again so you guys can see what our options are in the upper left here so we can do level two sling so now you'll be able to shoot two no i won't they won't ring as soon as i plug it up it's one of those like uh um, we have repasted, okay. re cleaned, LP, blah blah blah. Which means I can carry more alchemical ammo. It won't break within a week. I could carry, It'll break three months oh, from now. With traveler's tools, you can now upgrade your equipment without a workbench. I could do it anywhere. Damn, that's useful, right? It means immediately I'd be able to uh upgrade anytime I find resources. I could just upgrade anywhere. Shit, that's good. I wonder what the third one is. You can use an unbreakable tool to upgrade your equipment without a tool cost. Whoa! We have to find an unbreakable tool to do that. Did uh, this camera break? I just okay. noticed this camera not showing. Okay. Let's get to work. Perfect. So let me unblock again so you guys can see oh, the in the upper left. Oh, wow. So we can do he couldn't even get rid of the border. <laughs> this dude. He, he talked about grouping no stuff in OBS no and he rocks. never did it. Really useful later on in the game if more enemies are coming at us. Right? But I kind of feel like I should do this one. I really do. Carrying, carrying more ammo at once I think is, is going to be useful. All right. Is he waiting on hand holding or what? I don't know. We oh my god. A long time. Someone really? Was tipped earlier, but I don't know. I haven't checked. <laughs> Why do you ask, Calixification? Did you try to tip? He got to check to see if tips work. Why are you asking? Because someone asked if they work. I haven't gotten a tip in a long time. 
It's because you one oh nine out of 150. Maybe, I don't know. My tips page is working. It loads. Uh. Why do you ask? Everything seemed to be working. It's literal well. bait that they did that. They specifically did that to get him to not play the game and to look at something. And then it worked. He's like, why did you ask? Did you want a tip? No, they don't want a fucking tip. Your DSP, of course, they don't want a tip. Wait a minute. What if they did? Are they might have tipped. tipped. And you're wondering why I'm not shouting it out? Whoa, they the did. They tipped. This is huge. When did you tip? Huge news. The tip happened. It looks like there might have been a tip that came through and I didn't see it. Yeah, actually. <laughs> now that I'm looking, but the emails are Oh my weird. god. That's weird. There is At this tip. point. Okay. Okay. So there was a $3 Dude, it tip. happened. Let's it fucking go. Tuna roll. Thank you, ugly tuna roll. A little late. Cheers to the playthrough. Yeah, yeah, late to everything at this point. Oh, a lot. A lot of progress today, for sure. Um Definitely a lot of progress in the game today. I want to find a stream where I fell asleep watching the guy Thank play Madden. Tuna roll for three dollar tip. And I think That's I found it. I see. I don't see any other tips outside of Ugly Tuna Roll. It's five hours long. Thank you, Ugly Tuna Roll, for the tip. Probably because I was asleep for an hour and a half of it. And then Josiah just did a super sticker of an anthropomorphic gamepad dancing around. I did not have a camera on for this stream. Appreciate that, Josiah. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. No, really. Thank you. All right, but that is it. Those are the two tips. Oh, now Duckmaster has done a super, <gasps> uh, a super sticker. Whoa, oh, wait, super a sticker. Lemon. A lemon. Like fawning with, with hearts in its eyes. Interesting. Where do they get these from, by the way? I have absolutely no clue All what right. YouTube's doing with these and why these are super stickers, but okay, thank you. <laughs> Duckmaster, I appreciate that. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, so this pause know, screen I'm segment. Minutes. Another 30 minutes, so please last tip. Chance if you guys wanted to last chance, chance to tip. Uh, if you want to get that goal. tip in. Um, guys, so just so you know, I'm, I'm streaming for about another 30 minutes. Um, so it would be last chance if you guys wanted to try to hit that uh, $150 goal. Um, so that we can uh, have a vast... If you want to try to hit the goal so we can get a vest. Or a jersey, but at this point, with only 30 minutes left... Not likely we're gonna hit it. I'm just throwing that out there. Oh, big ups! If I'm you want twenty thousand glow, just say something and you'll get twenty thousand glow. Okay. And that's all I can do. The only other one they would let me do is level one gear, which means an extra jar. But I don't think I want the extra jar. I think I want to save my resources for another upgrade. So there you go. Okay. So I can craft more, more alchemy stuff now. If I so choose. Looks like Beetlejuice threw up. But I'll hold on right now. I won't. If it says I maximized, like, like ingredients, then I'll start crafting. Do you think he hit the final goal? But for now, I think we're good. Let's see that boat. We've been seen. With this, I definitely want to continue on with that. I like how we take the camera that away. Line of leveling. To show yeah. the menu. Oh shit, he's still streaming. Oh god, this fuck. It's it's gorgeous, right? So I love the game. Okay, good, he's clocking out perfect. Weekend. Thank you all for attending. Like today. right on time, god damn. Earlier today with the whoever that was view botting, obviously. Oh sweet, we get to hit us too. We get to the like the outro. So you know, oh this is a souvenir moment. I should do this now. That's really it. That's the only complaint I have. Everything else so far, the graphics, the gameplay, <clears throat> everything's top notch. You know, the music, the voice acting, the atmosphere, the plot. I mean, just look at this. They didn't have to do, put those birds up there. They didn't have to put this mist coming off the water. It's it's gorgeous, right? So I love the game. I cannot wait to play it more over the weekend. Thank you all for attending today. Thanks for putting up with that nonsense earlier today with the whoever that was viewbotting. Obviously, stupidly. Um, wasting everybody's time. Thank you so much to Team Ico Gamer for the insane amount of gifted membership. Thank you to everyone else who supported the stream. Obviously, a really great stream. And I had a ton of fun, and I will I let you know. Uh, it looks like it's either going to be Saturday or Sunday when we play it again. All right, guys? 
Thank you so much. Obviously. Obviously. Until next time. Excellent. Obviously. All right. Good stuff all around, right? So. Larry's going to end the video again. Very nice. Now, guys. Tonight's late stream. Let's talk. It's going to be Scorn, but not the whole stream. We only have about an hour left in Scorn. And I know it's going to suck. It's going to be very annoying. But there's nothing Scorn really late night going to be fire. He going to hate on the game and then do a Q&A for an hour. Holy Even shit. The game isn't that good anymore. I want to finish the game. I already invested five hours into it. I want to wrap it up tonight. So I hope you'll be here for 6.45 p.m. Pacific time to see me tough through the end of the game. Now, once that's done, all right, then we will switch over and do some fun interactive Q&A and just chill it to end my streaming week, okay? So I hope tonight you'll join me if you can. 6.45 p.m., all right? I'm not here tomorrow, but I'm back on Friday with the premiere of Gotham Knights and the seasoned finale of Friday Night Fights. So, if you're interested in what Gotham Scoring Knights is... Scoring is very I, exciting. I One of my favorite Friday, games of the year. As for Saturday, Obviously. It is either going to be more Gotham Knights or it's going to be uh, Plague Tale. So, it really depends. Let's see how Gotham Knights goes on Friday. If everyone likes it and you want more right away, we'll do it again. And then Plague Tale will be Sunday. If we play Gotham Knights and we're kind of like, nah, we want to go back to Plague Tale, we'll do Plague Tale Saturday instead. All right? So, really, we'll, we'll play it by ear. We'll see what, how, what you guys think, what I think on Friday, and go from there. All right? In the meantime, please enjoy the break. And hopefully, I will see you tonight for the conclusion of Scorn and some chill fun. If not, hopefully, I'll see you hey, It is Friday. Wednesday. Okay? It's guys, National so P-Fan Day. Please have a good night. I'll see you later. All right? I'm, I'm about, to eat some, uh, about to eat some tuna casserole. My wife oh, shit. Smelling. Tuna casserole. Uh, it smells amazing. Yeah. Why we need to hit is weird. Whatever, man. This dude's fucking Thank you so very much. sucks. My wife's making tuna right. casserole. Right. I'm, I'm about, to eat some, uh, about to eat some tuna casserole. My wife is making it. Smell it. It smells amazing. He's been eating right. the same tuna casserole made yeah. the same way by the same lady every week on the same day for like two years. And he's still trying to hype that shit up. For who? For who? You don't even want to take a picture of it, bro. He didn't want to take a picture of it. And he never took a picture of it. He's never going to make a video of it. His wife's tuna casserole. That shit could have, like, fucking panties in it for all we know. I don't fucking know. He's hyping up nothing. Oh, well. Later, peeps and DSP Gaming. T. Michael Gamer. T. Michael Gamer was immersed as fuck today. They gifted 300 subs and talked the whole stream. Well, that's pretty good. Those other idiots don't talk. Oh, God. The doctor was in his chat today. I'm not going to say who he is, but the doctor was in DSP's chat today. You know, the dude that cooked the videos? He cooked the videos? The doctor? That doctor. What? He was lurking and stalking. Chat. Help. I don't know if he talked the whole stream, but he showed up. I like that he's still, like, you know, he's still, like, an actual fan, quote-unquote, of the guy. <laughs> Even though I swear at one point, the doctor, yeah, he did. The doctor used to always say that he didn't like DSP. He used to always say that. No, I don't really watch, no, I, don't, I don't watch Phil anymore. He used to always fucking say that. So goofy ass. Whatever. You know what? Maybe he don't like him anymore, but he still watch him sometimes. Technically, I watch him. And if you ask DSP, I hate him more than anybody else do. So it makes sense. He probably wanted to know why he had 4,000 views earlier. It makes sense. So, there's multiple things I could do. I think I know what I'm doing. Yeah, I know what I'm doing. We're going to do an amazing AFK segment. And it's going to be some hot content from the past. Like uh, back when Mixer was around the past.
That's not right. It's Final Fantasy music. Oh, it's Bayonetta. Man, the Bayonetta 2 soundtrack sucks. And if it's good, what the fuck are the good parts? I can never find them. I never hear the good parts. It's just fucking boring. It's just fucking boring. Kind of like watching the catch stream. You never hear the good parts, but that yeah, other people bring them up. Other people always bring them up. Anyway, this is 2018. That one SMT game and a Madden 19, 19 stream. Oh, bigger lol. I can't even read the comments. I think if it's set to unlisted, I can read the comments. Let's see. Black Lives Matter appears, I don't know what, four hours and four minutes? Madden starts at an hour and 39 minutes in. Maybe I can skip ahead then. Wait, huh? <laughs> DSP, no. Well, like, me me doing this isn't proven shit, but the DSP autoplay is so bad. It don't mean anything because, like, I watch these people on my own anyway. But geez, man. You watch a DSP stream and he go offline and the stream in and it roll like autoplay every single time. It send me to like piece of peace or an lead or like fucking that being said or some shit. Every time it never sends me to another DSP video though. No matter what, it never sends me to another DSP video ever. Poor guy. That's how it be sometimes. It ain't easy being cheesy, and it ain't easy being uh, it ain't easy being chill. Yeah, that's it. It ain't easy being chill. This looks so lame. I gotta find a way, a better way to capture this, or just download the video. Cause I'm never gonna be able to get it the way I want it. I'm blaming you too. So if Madden started an hour in, what the fuck did I do? I really was fooling around. I was having fun. <laughs> I know what I was pointing out here. I already know what I was pointing out. I should crop this because sadly it's got that fucking mixer link on the screen. Like come on. Whatever, man. The network's cropping it. The network's editing the footage. Get rolled, idiot. Look, I knew. I knew when I originally did these streams with this format and layout. I was like, you know what? One day I might have to crop this out. One day Mixer might get felted. They were felted the whole time. They've been trash since day one. That's not true. I'm being mean. Uh... That look kind of weird. Blame the network. They uh, didn't pay enough or they need to pay more. They definitely need to pay more. They paid enough last month and this month they were like, well, you did so good last month. We don't have to pay as much this month. I'm like, wait, what? That's not how business work. You guys know how business work. Hey, this game. Dude, I remember this game. So I was just listening to DSP B DSP. Makes sense. That's uh, like what I do today. And we can get... It's the wrong layout, isn't it? No, it's the right layout. We can get this and this. 
And this. It's totally gonna make sense. That was gonna be lit. I can't wait to see you play all of those games. Swollen niggas is clocking out. With 18 shipments received. All by himself. Yes! The dingus should hear at the perfect time. Tevin 24 7 is about to be locked in. But don't worry, it's not gonna last that long. I wanna see him play Cat Mario. That shit gonna be lit. Dingus, as a matter of fact, why the hell aren't you streaming now? Dingus always taking L's. If he was streaming now, he can get rated for like a million views. And sadly, he's not. He's too busy doing something stupid. And instead, he's he's out here losing. Need to get my steamy little Caesars. What? Little Caesars. I need to end the stream. I need to delete my fucking account. We were we were supposed to get something else, not Little Caesars. Whatever we were getting, it wasn't Little Caesars. <laughs> See, Dingus was gonna lie about what food he got. He was gonna lie and say he got Taco Bell. He was gonna lie. Little Caesars, this fucking broke boy. One crunch wrap cost a whole pizza. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> One crunch wrap cost your pizza. Imagine. I can't wait till Dingus stream. I can't wait. I can't wait. I'm gonna show up and say, "Look at this! Look at this dude! Y'all know what this dude ate? This dude was eating Little Caesars." He could have been eating a fucking crunch wrap. A big beefy hefty crunch wrap. You ever seen uh the Edie Bot crunch wrap emote? You could have been having that. And instead you're gonna have a pizza. You see how big a crunch wrap is? Unbelievable. We out here eating pizza. God damn it, dude. God damn it. <sighs> what's what's Tevin 24-7 supposed to be? It's definitely not a 7 to 12 hour block, but we uh we lie in marketing sometimes. So 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. will be or whatever the fuck this stream was wonder if it'll be an easy way to like steal this stream out of this stream not really i'm gonna have to download my own archive and then edit it just for that one dude it'll be worth it this will be a hilarious uh, restream and upload to YouTube. And I can edit it out at this exact point. This exact point. It'll be sweet. Pre recorded 7 24 7. Bloop, 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 bloop. I know what I could do. I'm gonna have to kill the stream. I'm gonna be forced to. And then just restart it. After I do other stuff. Tuesday, bloop, bloop, 10 to. Yeah, sure. And maybe I can set up the 360 or at least uh, test it out. Six PM to nine PM. Med nineteen. You better take a sip. Talk about great soundtracks. When you think of the Sonic soundtracks, that's when you're talking about a great soundtrack. Well, 
Well, I saved that. Wait, is Gunner here? The guy? Who's bothering him? Somebody. Nah, fuck Little Caesars. I'm not watching DSP review Little Caesars. Make Dingus watch that. He wanna fucking he's literally the one that wants to eat it. Actual fucking clown. I'm going out of my way hating on Little Caesar. Somebody's gonna go out of way out of way out of their way to defend it. I don't want you to do that. So don't get too serious about it, you know what I'm saying? But I told him to get Taco Bell. That's the point. I would never tell somebody to get Little Caesars. Yeah, bro. Get that Little Caesars, man. That shit gonna be busting. What? Just buy a fucking bag of Doritos, man. You're gonna get the same amount of flavor out of it. But the last time I had Little Caesars, it did taste pretty good. But at the same time, I'm not a pizza snob either. You ask DSP about Little Caesars, for instance, he's gonna act like somebody shot his grandma. Little Caesars, oh yeah, that shit fucking, oh, it's so fucking disgusting, man. You ever eat fucking cardboard? You ever eat like cardboard? That's Little Caesars, man. It's fucking nasty, man. Oh, yeah, God, dude, I couldn't be Little Caesars, man. That, that would be him talking about Little Caesars. <laughs> the actual. <laughs> An actual, like, like. Like nine person talking about Little Caesars. Oh my god, man. Little Caesars is fucking disgusting, man. It's like fucking cardboard. I wonder if he even ever ate it. Rambo probably gave him a piece. It's called Little Caesars Pizza. Oh, it's disgusting, man. It doesn't taste like uh, floppy New York pizza. It didn't taste like a $50 pizza made by some dude named like Mario. Like, actually named Mario. So therefore, it was nasty. It makes sense. I'm pretty sure this is done. Oh, yeah, very tight. Enjoy the AFK segment. It's like the best part of my stream. Why does Pando do this? I reset Pando, and they go hog wild in the chat. He call like shit graffiti. you can get those on t-shirts. Well, All right. T-shirts, mugs, stickers, and a, a couple cases sweatshirts. One of the designs didn't. Really Remember when DSP used to advertise T-shirts? So give it a look. And now he stream every day and tell us he don't have if products to advertise. Anything, Been doing it ten years, you guys. Okay. Ten years. Line of product, number one, Sounds good. You're gonna get <laughs> a really cool. <laughs> Think of the pockets. Nice. <laughs> All right. But at the same time, I help you out. I, just, I, get a for I don't want to say anything about what that was. Now I really need your I'm trying to get this, this fucking is. ghost to not yell when something happened. King of the Pirates are regulars and you know what's going on. It's like super old star Brunel. Oh yeah, will he complain about chargebacks? That prediction's over. Uh, no. They stole my the prediction uh, era? Saga? Whatever. Is over. Again. Did I call it the prediction era? The chargeback era is over. Again. It started, it lasted like three hours. Oh, yeah. Pando, do you only do this for rock, paper, scissors, or what? Maybe. As a matter of fact, I could give you... Gotta figure out. This dude's going well. I can give you advice on how to get a sweet font shirt. Make, go to go to defont .com. Yeah, it's only because of Ignan? rock paper scissors. What about you? <laughs> okay, so the, the lady worked. A worked nice out. Thank you for the. God damn. Okay, thank you for two fifty. Uh, too quick, with the dig nine. That's in a video that somebody did. It was something else I wanted to. I forget the name of that dude. Maybe man. see. I forget. Mimology one on one. I mean, even then, it's still, it's still a be hard to find, but no. it's one of his H1Z1 videos, the Dick Nine. Shout I'm out. totally yeah. streaming again tonight. It's it may be super point. late. It may be kind of early. Sweet font t-shirt. Just go to D-A-F-O-N-T. Shut up, shut up, Tevin. Shut up, Tevin, from the past. I'm streaming again tonight. This technically, obviously, isn't the same stream. But I'm streaming again tonight. And it's going to be Fatal Frame. Whenever the hell it happened.
but if you got nothing else to do, you can just sit in this stream until somebody else go live and then you can open that stream. Anyway, this will be the name of the stream is like this is literally the name. My streams have really good names. That one SMT game and a Madden 19, 19 stream. Oh, big a lol. Panda emoji, panda emoji, horse emoji, horse, horse emoji, broken heart emoji, broken heart emoji, broken heart emoji, gun emoji, detective emoji, October 7, 2018. You're a fucking degenerate. Basically, I watched the guy play Madden after listening to a pre stream and I fell asleep. So it was a hilarious stream because I fell asleep during it. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the way I was gonna watch this. I got a playlist. We get the default promo. I gotta change the title too before I forget. Fantastic fonts. That's how I get my. Uh... Do I have any font on the screen for this? Nah, that shit basic. Look at that. Look at that cool fucking font. This used to be the startup for the Twitch channel. Look at that cool font. You can get even more. Even oh, yeah. Who cool said something you. about 600 Only emotes on 7TV? It might have been marked so one. There, 600 fonts, emotes on 7TV? A totally legal what? Copy of Photoshop, obviously. Get I didn't check the website yet. Template. You don't even need a shirt template. Just get you just get you a blank blank uh, space. Black background. How would this keep happening? Text, it look it's just fucking up in OBS. Upload it to I don't uh, understand. Teespring. Just make an account. Upload it to Teespring. Say you're selling a shirt. Buy your own shirt. There you go. You, got you, put on you can have a shirt that say I spawn, I die. Buy your own shirt. Just make a shirt and upload it to Teespring and buy it. Teespring don't exist anymore, Tevin, in the past. They're called spring.com now, idiot. People love font shirts. You fucking moron. How are you going to wear that? It's got my face on it. This doesn't make sense, DSP. I can turn Sonic off, too. People stare at your shirts all day? Don't you have a bunch of gamer shirts and shit? Dude, I would love to wear a DSP face shirt. Why would you not? I want to sell shirts that's not distracting. That's the truth. I want to just blend in. The designs that are more like logos or words have sold better. And that's why, as you can see, this 10th anniversary line of product is primarily that. Yeah, maybe it's because I'm a 7TV, uh, whatever they call when they buy stuff. <laughs> they want me to feel special again. It's been too long. What is the progress, Obviously. I was planning on deleting a bunch of 7TV emotes today because I meant to do it last stream. But, I mean, if I got 600 slots, I don't think I'm ever going to have to delete any. I'm never going to fill up 600 spots, man. But what if I did? Yeah, I wonder what my hate Twitch, hate YouTube shirt. <laughs> I want to look at DSP old merch. The hate Twitch, hate YouTube shit. And it would just say hate in a bunch of big font, like edgy fonts. It would say hate everywhere. And then it would say Twitch in between and YouTube in between. It was very awkward artwork. I just didn't understand because I'm an idiot, sadly. Hey, Swaggins, back when he used to give money. Oh, man. I was looking through the old, like, Tevin archives or whatever to try to find stuff for Tevin 24-7. And I was, like, seeing the titles and the thumbnails and the like-dislike ratios of the original, 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 original first, first Tevin streams on YouTube, at least, not on Twitch. So this is, like, 2018. And this is back when Swaggins was first giving DSP money. And, oh, my God. It was basically like the first guy that gave DSP money that people talked about, I guess. But that's not true either, because Vidal was maybe that. Yeah, Vidal was that before Swaggins was. But people used to piss me off about Swaggins. Tevin, do you, do you think Swaggins is this and that and this and that and this and that? 
Swang has turned out to be nothing but a broke fucking weird bitch who don't never give anybody money anymore, and he lied about everything, and everything he ever said that anybody ever read was a waste of that time. It's what I thought back then. That's why I got, like, suspiciously annoyed when people asked me about him. When it was something that was something that... When it was something that took fucking brain power to think about. Basically. Which is what swaggins don't fucking use. So why would you use it to think about them? Why would you use brain power to think about stupid fucking people, basically? And swaggins is a stupid fucking person. DSP is more intelligent than swaggins because he getting money from them. Or at least he used to. Swaggins ain't paying himself because he don't know how to or something. I don't know. I'm just saying stuff. But Swaggins is fucking stupid and dumb and a weirdo. And uh, that was back when he first showed up around this time. And people like, like half the stream would be people just showing up asking about Swaggins. Did Swaggins give Phil money today? Do you think Swaggins is rich? Do you think Swaggins has a pet alpaca? All that weird shit Swaggins used to talk about. He was just a dumb fucking weird person. I'm just literally being toxic and not actually saying anything about sitting here and talking about him. But you get the point I'm trying to make. Uh, me and all of my homies hate Swaggins. And he don't even give DSP anything anymore. So what's up with that, bro? Did he, like, lose his mansion and his alpaca? Did, uh, you think inflation, did inflation hit Swaggins? He couldn't feed his pet alpaca anymore. And he couldn't buy his $3,000 jeans. That's probably it. Fuck. That sucks. That's how it would be sometimes. Pre-recorded 7, 7 2018. Yeah, we're not watching horse vids. How many people was here during his stream earlier? Wasn't that stream laid back? Every time somebody cheered, he was scared to read it. People was getting timed out and banned and drawn. 2018, Madden 19, restream. People had what the dude sent like fifteen dollars in bits over the course of the stream. When he's not recording anymore, he's <laughs> I wonder who I was talking about in this clip. It was a super laid back stream. It was chill as hell. Somebody sent a bunch of bits and got banned. Hell, it was tight. It was sweet to be honest. I do want to apologize for yesterday. I was pretty, pretty after Vice City. I was pretty. I pretty much. I've been stressed out. You know what? I still might have the save file for this game. Shimba got my ten save. Radu no hood something versus something I don't know something sad boy stream Twitch deleted my save file when they banned me so he basically been mad the last two days <laughs> DSP begging in 2018 we're not supposed to listen to this we're literally not supposed to hear this. DSP didn't do this back then. He only started doing this the last time he did it. Yeah. I really care about your credit. Ten years. All right. Now everything's set. Tevin 24 7. Uh, Mad 19. Super chill Tevin stream. And when it's over with, I might play. This not fear effect, fatal frame. If not, I'll host somebody and then play fatal frame eventually. Money, 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 money. It depends. Plugs, 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 plugs.